Hello minions, welcome back to my stream, I am Lord of Skellies and today we are playing Goodbye Volcano High. It's the last days of my vacation streams, so because again, I don't want to stream next week, so that is gonna be like the last streams that I am gonna be able to play. Today we're gonna play uh, the whole day, we're gonna play Goodbye Volcano High. And tomorrow we're gonna play a uh, Snoot Game, which is the parody game of this game. <laughs> but we're gonna play it with the crew. So, you, if you guys uh, want to actually see both of the games, you can literally look at the original game today. And tomorrow we're gonna see the parody game, <laughs> which both of them are kind of like um, really, really interesting. Both of them. Uh, the original one is. Mm, more, more or less really good and but snoot game is also really good in their own terms but yeah it's it's kind of like a, a really difficult way to actually explain it mostly because uh again snoot game is supposed to be a parody game and they release it even before goodbye goodbye volcano high actually get released it, it, it was he was released like four years before goodbye volcano high release <laughs> so yeah it's it's kind of really interesting how Snoot Game actually made stuff. And well, the Bubble Cannot Hide still is something that I that people actually try to literally, you know, avoid at some point. But then, uh, b thanks to Snoot Game, and I know that Co-op is gonna be like really resilient about this, but Snoot Game literally actually make the hopes go, uh, or uh, the hype goes for the Bubble Cannot Hide. So I think Co-op should actually thank k Bannon in order to actually know that the, this game is now in the radar of a lot of people. So, but not, not at all, not of all of them, but on some of his people that actually look look at uh, really, this game with really bad eyes. But anyway, enough talking about Snoot Game, let's talk about Goodbye Volcano High because this is a stream for Goodbye Volcano High. This is a vision novel, which is kinda unique, if you ask me. It, yeah, it is unique. So the thing is that um, Goodbye Volcano High literally was... Uh, it is a visual novel, but a kinda animated visual novel. Uh, it's kinda like an animation thing, and yeah. You will see when I actually we start. And the thing is because it was like this. Uh Co-op had like a really difficult time, mostly, because they actually announced it on the PlayStation Showcase. And of course, people actually say that uh, you know, it's kinda it's kinda like stupid because looking at this kind of game in a uh, PlayStation Showcase alongside uh, God of War Ragnarok and of course Dark Souls or and Ratchet and Clank Rift Apart, it's obviously gonna have a really bad impression of, of PlayStation or Sony or even for co-op, which it's stupid. And of course that happens with a lot of stuff over there in the middle that I'm not gonna tell anything. But yeah, that's why people actually didn't have really low hopes with this game. However, I think, uh, I think, I think, I actually thought that's the same. I'm not gonna give a shit about this game. But after Snoot Game happened, people actually uh, started to realize that probably this game is not too bad. I mean, if he, if the, I mean, the guy, the guys that actually made Snoot Game, literally give us something to work with. Well, depends. I'm not sure. Depending on how you see it. But anyway. Enough saying it, and I'm not sure why the chat is not working. Give me a moment. Is the chat working? Uh, yes or no? Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's working for some reason. <laughs> it didn't pop up. Okay, yeah, the chat is working. Thank you, thank God. Okay, anyway, without being said, let's play the God of Again, this game is a little, little short game, so I think we can actually finish it in just one session. So I'm gonna start right now and then I'm gonna keep going until we literally finish the game. Which we will see, we will see what happens. Okay, anyway, without being with all of that being said, let's play the game, shall we? Okay, new game. Okay, starting a new game with a race recording. Yeah, 
I'm sure. Yeah, I played this game before, so don't worry. <laughs> if I'm gonna change something, I may change some 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 things. And as well, I I they actually uh, updated the game, so probably they adjusted some few things. And again, I'm playing on PlayStation Five, so so I think they actually fixed it something. Trust me. If it, if they fix something, I'm gonna I'm gonna be the only the first one to actually notice. In combat with character, your choices will influence the relationship you have with other characters. New content unlocked depends on your decisions. Got it. When you make a choice that might have changed your relationship with a character, you'll see this icon in the corner of your screen. All right. Cool, cool. No pressure. See you at school. Let's go. So this is how dinos behave before they blow up. <laughs> Glass of the end. Ooh, and to each pizza. I vote yes. I don't think this is a voting type situation. I mean, it does kind of belong to all of us. Or it was supposed to. It does. You did a great job. So, what do you say, Fang? Hmm. Okay, goodbye, Volcano okay, High. The end. Let's go. Let's go. Hold on. Nah, let's go. Yeah, something that I don't like is <laughs> the fact that it's un it has a unique, unique kind of choices. Like, come on. Just pick the one that I want to actually pick. Eight months earlier. Okay. So, yeah, this is kinda also like a music game. So, they did. So, of course, we're gonna have like a rock band parts on this game. Which, it's uh, it's fine. Or, before, besides the kind of... Uh, the uh, thing of the, um, how to put it, uh, the visual novel aspect, we have some kind of gameplay with a uh, rocket, rock, rock band thing or something like that. So we will see. Alright, uh, I hope that the game doesn't actually strike me with, <laughs> with copyrights, with prior songs, because the songs are good. I'm not gonna tell you that. The songs, the songs are really good. Okay. We'll never clean up, we never fail. Okay, uh, it's the finish line, the ring bell. We got here quick, we got here slow. Uh, it's the finish line, I suppose. It's the finish line, the ringing hmm. bell. So, yeah, that, I really like that, uh, or at least I thought it would be really cool to actually be able to uh, Make the your own uh, song that is actually is going to the end. So uh, oh, making it to the end. The finish away, the ring a bell. Oh, we, I begin again. Oh, I started. Then mm, I say, oh, it all started. Then. I begin and then, uh, yeah, I think, I think, I think, I think this one is more fitting. If we're gonna die, <laughs> why, why not make a really depressing song? <laughs> okay, move the L, the, the L stick in the direction of the beats coming from the top and size of the screen to hit them. All right. Press the indicated action button when the outer cycle is touching the inner cycle in the in the time with the music. Move left stick and right stick in the indicated direction when the arrows completely overlap. Okay, continue. So this is the uh, rock band stuff. Nope, they didn't fix a thing. <laughs> Again, this is something that I expected co-op actually fixed and it's the fact that they sum, sum in all the shit. Like this. 
But no! Cop! I trusted you! <laughs> I want you to fix this some issues! Like you're subbing way too... Too much! Really nice. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna tell you that the music's really nice. Okay. Now or never. Okay. Uh, we could stop overthinking. We got this. Uh, let me see. Nothing from. Uh, stop overthinking it. Let's let's let's, let's, do it. let's do it. Let's go straight. Kaya J is fine. From Warm Drama. Here's our new song. You rock. You rock? Ugh. Too bad. It's already read. It's already read it. Okay, let me let me read all, all this shit. Hey LJ, it's Funk from World Drama. We wanted to hear our new song. So I don't know if how the song was. Maybe we call me play Lava Java for some time. Maybe. Not this time. Sounds a little off. Keep trying. Hey LJ, just wanted to thank you for listening to Warm Drama. Played the other day. Uh, sorry about that, I'm just having a little perp over there on my... I just eat it, okay? <laughs> In order to actually stream for like 6 hours, I needed to eat something first. Okay, have you made any decisions about the lineup yet? Hi fan, unfortunately it's no for Warm Drama. Very long next time. Here, a new one. We hope you like it. Sorry, pass. Try something different. This sound isn't it. Okay, no worries. Just get a song to me by the Monday AM and I let you know if your band can audition, okay? Okay, thank you so much. Don't thank me till you get it. And please, if you want this gig, you all will be playing something new. Nothing from the other 100 auditions, okay? Just trying to help. Okay, thumbs up. Thank you. Uh, I, th I think that's the social notes. I'm not sure. I I have I have a little a little just a little window. So yeah, those are those are those are music songs. Okay. Okay. Send send me the song morning, no, uh, Monday morning. Okay. And this is the one that I that I sent it. All right. Let's see next. Dino Gang. Pussy Vice for the best for the best year ever from Stella. Hey, Sib, are you playing the guitar right now? Ugh. If you'd been, like, a minute earlier, I... Seriously? Why aren't you getting ready for school? Okay, school is for chumps. Get out of here. None of your business. Um... Uh, school is for chumps. I'm getting ready for life. Very funny. Me too, by the way. Not all of us can coast on our talent. Some of us actually have to go to school. Eh, uh, sucks for you. <laughs> sucks for you. <laughs> yeah, it sucks to be you. Ouch. <laughs> okay. Well, I can't give you a right now. We still have time. Not me. Class president. Remember? First meeting of the year. Oh, great. Does this mean there's an assembly today? Tomorrow. And thanks for your support. I voted for the other guy. So did everyone else. It's all rigged. Okay, I'm leaving. There's some breakfast for you downstairs. Have a good day. 
Hmm. It's a rig. I can't. I can totally be sure of that. I will never bought that. <laughs> that, that orange crest. Okay. Hey, when I head across the bay today, just hang around. Maybe start a new life. You don't have any plans, right? I feel like there's something I'm supposed to do. I don't know. I forget. Let's just go at the mall. Oh, wait. We are school kings now. I think that's, that's what she tries to say. We should go. Do that. I guess. <coughs> Seniors, best year ever. Best year ever. Okay, LJ. Is this your new song? Tell the group you're in the audition. Good luck. Ooh, we made it! I guess. <coughs> yes. Best year ever. Hmm. That's a, that's a good thing, I guess. <laughs> and if I know. Alright. We pass the audition. And we are going to... Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, and thing. Volcano High. We're gonna say goodbye to you all. We are really soon. Race for wings. We're gonna have race for wings. Hey! Hey yo! How's it going? Whoa! Your hair, it's silver. And your makeup. Oh, wow. When did this happen? Are we all getting makeovers now? Hmm, I don't know. I don't look different. It's not a big deal. Um, eh, it's not a big deal. Makeover? Not really. I, I don't know. I just, I felt like doing something different. It's not a big deal. Just wanted to, like, set a new tone for the year, I guess. I wore the same worm drama hoodie for, like, all six weeks of TS and I. Very misleading shirt to wear around bug people, by the way. TS and I? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Duh. Tendril Summer Nature Intensive. I was in the entomology section. Mm. So, bug camp. Pretty much. Dude, I have so much to tell you about it. So, what'd you do all summer? Worked on songs, mostly. Uh, wait for Reed, hype her up. Uh, let's wait for Reed. If we are an entire group, you'll want the entire group to actually get in there. Something happened this morning that is going to be like every birthday you've ever had in one amazing moment. Wow, okay. That's a lot of cake. And I'm definitely listening. No, 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 no. We have to wait for a proper band meeting. We've got to have Reed. Wow, okay. Not cool, dude. <laughs> so, can I tell you my news, though? Obviously. Meet Mango! What? Why, cute? Uh... Why? <laughs> That's how what? Why? <laughs> Was that the camp mascot? No! Even better! She's my new pet slash precious baby angel. She's an anacophora. A velvet worm. She's the sweetest. They're super rare. Rosa and I found her because we were out planting the special kind of moss they need for their habitat. Rosa? From second grade science class? Oh my god, her paper mache volcano! Dude, I think Mr. Perea quit after that. No, but Rosa is super cool, actually. She was at camp with me, and she knows, like, basically everything about plants. Like, did you know that certain bug species need certain plants, not to eat, but so they can reproduce? And they hold their eggs in, like, a sack inside their bodies for months and months and months, and they'll only lay them on this one plant, and then... Yeah, I think Fag is not a fan of that. <laughs> so, you wouldn't think it, but if just one plant goes away, so do tons of really important bugs. Like Mango! She needs this super special moss we were looking for. Usually these little guys hide all day, but because there isn't enough moss anymore, she was just huddled up in a little termite tunnel all alone, and it was so sad. And now she's mine, and I love her the most for ever. Check out this video of her slime attack. It smells so bad you want to die. Slime attack. Good song title. Uh, yeah, that's a no. <laughs> that, that face is telling you, is the seriously telling No. <laughs> uh, 
Oh. Oh, oh, oh no. Wow. <laughs> How often does she do that? Every time she eats. Yeah. So, <laughs> you really like my hair? Oh yeah, it's awesome. Like you're a super hot assassin or like a powerful witch goddess. Hell yeah. <laughs> Honestly, I was going for more of a... Hmm. Dude, tell me that that's not terrifying. Jeez. Anyways, I was going... F I have even worse sounds in school. I was going for more of a... Trust me. <laughs> Seriously? I guess that still means it's time for class. And a new bell. I mean, hello? Ugh. I've got Roberts for homeroom. Whew, not me. I think Reed does, though. Hey, best year ever? Guaranteed. I agree. Band meeting at lunch in the music room? I'll be there. Ugh, I missed you. I missed you, too. Bro? Buddy? Old sport? Old chum? Hmm. I didn't have friends at all like that. I mean, the first one I had, I think they died. Well, technically one died. Never mind. Never mind about that. But, yeah. Reed. I never saw I have my big old friends band news. of school. Ooh, what is it? You're not gonna believe it. Oh, excuse me, sorry. Hey, what's up? Check out my new quests. Quests? Yeah, I'm gonna have to prepare some fire spells. Yeah, you bet you are. What just happened? Hey, Reed! Is there some special circumstance preventing the two of you from taking your seats with the rest of the class so that we may all begin? Nah, I think we can actually talk. I'll... So, welcome back, seniors. Mm-hmm. Believe me when I say that this year will fly by and you will find yourselves wishing you'd taken more time to prepare. As loathsome as high school may seem to you now, you are all still in the nest, so to speak. <laughs> it's because we are dinosaurs. <laughs> Kill that fucking teacher. <laughs> She's a fucking racist. <laughs> okay, let's see. Uh, oh, we are doing the. Okay, let's let's do the the kind of, the kind of a really good um, emblem for warm. No. Mm, let's see, let's see. I think I can I kinda like the the fact that okay, let's let's grab all we have until today until now. Warm I'm gonna put the, this warm for uh, because Fang is but apparently Fang doesn't like worms. Which is stupid. Drama Uh Drama 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 uh, actually I think a better um this is this is kind of a really good uh, pe the pen. The pen is kind of like a really good uh, found in order to actually do like drama or something like that. Okay, eyes no, wings no, fire no, splat no. Of course, that's not gonna happen. Place I cannot like I like this one. Sip no, storm no, boil no. Mm, I go with the skull. I, I kind of like this skull one. Okay, uh, yeah. Done. Are you sure? Yeah. I'm sure. I have the best news. Band meeting in the music room at lunch. Also, check this logo I designed. Fail to send. Mm, it happens to me on X every single fucking day. <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm not sure why it happens that to uh, Twitter. Sometimes I try to put a fucking gif or a picture, and sometimes it just put me fail to send. And I'm not sure why. And trust me, I reply with gifs and images most of the time. <laughs> so I don't know. And you will be pushed out to fly, or falter, in exactly nine months. My job is to make sure you don't plummet to an early demise on your first foray into reality. Is that clear? Way too clear. Excellent. Reed, why don't you start us off then? 
Tell us your plans for after graduation and I'll give you your first flying lesson, so to speak. Ah, uh, I don't know. Uh, my brother's been doing pretty all right making his deliveries these days. So I figure there's always gonna be a need for that. And I'd still have time to practice the drums, you know? Hmm. Smart. A steady industry that builds on existing skills and lets you pursue hobbies. Who's next? Okay, band meeting, missing room, lunch, big news. Bell to set. Again. Yeah, I'm very sure the server is going down. Like... <laughs> like that. <laughs> Come on, what the hell? Fang! You should know by now not to text in my class, yes? Uh, nothing to see here. I don't know. I won't. I won't. I was just taking notes. Hand it over, please. Uh, I'll take it. No. You can't pay. You can't have it. No, no. You can't have it. You can't have it. That's fine. Book it, teacher. <laughs> There you go. I don't have time for games. Just don't let me see you on it again. You can't stop my phone. It's not working anyway. Ugh. Mine's not working either. Same. Like totally dead. Anyone else care to update us on the fate of your emojis? Yeah, me. Actually, my mom's transistor radio was picking up all sorts of interference this morning. It sounds like that's what happened with the bell, too. Which would also explain why no one can send texts all of a sudden. Oh, cool. Yeah, that sounds good. It's not good or bad, just unusual. Do feel free to enlighten us. Well, if it's affecting cell phones, it must be pretty high frequency. Oh. oh but, you know, it reminds me. I've started looking at pre-med classes online. <laughs> because after graduation, I'm going to become a physician. What does that have to do with electromagnetism? What? Nothing. I was just thinking of the sciences in general. What about you? Yes, Fang, since you have so much to say. Well, I'm going on tour with my band. Right after graduation. First step? Uh, a van, new gear, and a P? What's an P? Okay, first of all, uh, when... If you are going into a trip, you, I'm very sure you will need new gear. Mostly because you're not gonna use your old gear. You li I, it's kinda like streaming. I literally didn't have any stream things. And the only thing, uh, and the only mic that I had, it was fucking ugly. Until I had my new streaming mic, which I assuming, yeah, I'm assuming that it's working properly, right? So, yeah, that's a thing. So, new gear is for me. Upgrading our equipment so we can melt everyone's brains. You're in a band. Oh, yeah, that makes sense, of course. What kind of portfolio do you have so far? Or, ah, uh, that's probably not the right word. Uh, we're kind of still cooking, you know? We've got some stuff in the works. Well, you still have several months to think of a viable career. Someone else? Ah, fuck you. Oh, it's working again. Hey, do you have a minute? Hmm. Okay, sure, why not? Yeah, sure, what's up? I just wanted to say sorry that I put you on the spot. I didn't realize you haven't really made a plan. I have a... Still, I think it's interesting that you want to play music. You never seemed like the kind of person who would go to university. Wow. Thank you. Trish, got the music room. Have to fight. To, to fist fight a whole short for it. Okay. Yes. Awesome. It is? Sorry, not you. I gotta go. But we actually do play shows, you know? You should come see us sometime. We're about to blow up. Yeah, okay. See you. Hmm. Okay. 
So that's now we for you guys. See, velvet worms actually have two separate slime exit points. They squirt out the streams at different speeds and angles, and get this! With rotation! So the slime streams cross mid-air and weave a slime net around their prey. A slime net, dude! Oh, uh, that is gross. Awesome. Ooh, I might have to steal slime net for one of my L&L characters. Of course you will. I just got a new module. Of course you did. I ran into Naomi at the library over the summer. Now that's gross. She actually had some wild ideas that would totally work with the whole slime thing. Uh, really? Like what? Play and find out. Okay. Bad news time. Did they see me? Ah, bad news time. Hey, you guys ready? For what? For Fang's face to fall off. What? No. Wait, what is going on with your face, though? Your face! <laughs> What's with your face? Your face? No, dude, you look all glowy. Like, good. I got a new foundation. It has micro shimmer. Is it too much? Nope, that's not it. You look happy. Because I am. Okay. Band meeting officially started. You know the big Battle of the Bands coming up? Nope, never heard of it. Battle of the what? Wait, are we fighting someone? Ha ha. The Battle of the Bands that we thought we'd never get in? Because I'm ready to punch. Yeah, you are. Oh my god. Mm. Focus. Are you ready? <laughs> yes, definitely. 100% super for real, ready. Yeah, but are you gonna tell us or... Okay, we got an audition. Okay, yeah, I'm very sure it's the same thing. An audition. We got an audition. We got an audition! For Battle of the Bands. Whoa. But wait, how? Did something bad happen to LJ? No. And, oh my god, don't even say that. Mm -hmm. No, she just liked our song. But LJ hates our songs. Like, all of them. She really does. Well, she likes this one. Which one? Did I write it? Um, feels like it's a read jam. It's new. I worked on it all summer, and I was feeling really good about it, so I took a video, and I sent it to her this morning, and, and she loved it. Worm Drama is gonna play Battle of the Bands! If we pass the audition. Wait. I mean, super cool, but what's the song? Well, like I said, I, I worked on it all summer. I missed you guys a lot, <coughs> so I distracted myself and I focused on music. And I learned some cool stuff. I don't know, I just got really into practicing and thinking about the band and what we could be. This is our year, you know? This is our shot to start the lives we actually want instead of... So what's the new song like? Just let me play it. Okay, so we're gonna play this song for Trish and Reed. Because apparently Fang is the one that actually is making this song. Again, what's with the all fucking zoom in? Co-op! Just... Get rid of the zoom thing! I fucking getting pissed off because of that. Mm. And there is a really good images. That's why I wanted the zoom to get rid. And now I cannot. Get rid of the zoom thing. It's the finish line, the ringing bell. And how we run, how we run it
Oh, shit. I... Ugh, well, obviously I'm messing it up, but you can imagine your parts. What do you think? It's... Wait, just just wait until you hear the whole thing. I, I need to warm up first. No, it was awesome. It's really different. Really different? Like, is it even warm drama? Hmm... Eh, I'm not sure. They hit it. No, and it's a uh, point, of course it is. I don't know how the songs was before. Okay, of course it is. I mean, it's us playing it, so of course it is. Yeah, but it doesn't sound like our stuff. Mm, yeah, it doesn't sound like Space Caverns or Gym Teacher Sex Dream. Those are so old. I wrote them when I was like 14. It's kind of cringy. Plus, LJ hated it. So? LJ's just one person. One pretty mean person. But she's the judge. Duh. She has to actually know something. Okay, LJ opinions matters. Yeah. She's one person who is connected to everything music in this yeah, town. Yeah, that's what I was saying. <laughs> We've been trying to play Battle of the Bands for years. Whoever wins... Yeah, I hear ya. Get to spot at Caldera Fest where they pay you money to play music in front of a thousand people. Exactly. It's huge. We'd get real money to start the big tour. Can we really learn all new songs, though? I mean, Reed's got a point. And what if it's a setup? Every contest needs a loser. Okay, LJ will never do that. Now we have to switch up. That's not the point. Uh, LJ will never do that. I gotta defend LJ, just in case. <laughs> no way. We can trust LJ. And she's gotten what? Like a dozen bands from this town signed? Real contracts? Real tours? True. Mm. And she's why everyone loves swamp babies. Which is like, ugh, thanks a lot. No one plays the same songs forever. Things change, or we all just rot. Well, hey. You got us our first real shot, right? Yeah. That's cool. When's the audition? Next weekend. What? Whoa. Oh my gosh. I haven't practiced all summer. Bug Camp did not like my guitar. Or actually it did. Like certain bugs liked it to like live inside of it. We can start practicing now. We have all weekend. We're all gonna play L&L this weekend. Who is? Everyone! Me, Rosa, Sage! Oh, Rosa can make it? Yeah! She just texted me. Sweet. Naomi's playing too. You want in this time? Mmm, Red loves this stuff, I mean. If Trish is there, I'll be good then. Ah, uh, I'm gonna go with Red. I kinda like Red more. <laughs> yeah. I'm intrigued. Ah, yes. I have a character all ready for you. A dark mage. Very cool. Wait, no, we didn't even get to practice. Uh, trust me, this is gonna be amazing. New songs, new shows. If we can do it in time, anyway. We'll go over everything next practice. When is good? I'm on babysitting duty again tonight. Yay. Maybe tomorrow? Yeah, well, maybe. I gotta work with Rosa on our project tomorrow. Bugs are getting smaller, and no one knows why. Evolution. See ya. You see? Evolution. Maybe worms are big as fucking dogs or anything, but evolution tells them to go smaller. For us to actually stomp them. Hey. Hey. Jeez, slow down. Your legs are too long. Ha. <laughs> hey. Wait. Don't you drive? Vans in the shop, broken tail light, bumper, window, hood, steering wheel. Where's Trish? I think she had a project with Rosa. Ooh, abandoned. Left to walk with old armpits here. I'm absolutely heartbroken. Shattered. So you're serious about L and L? You're actually excited? I never took you for a fantasy dork. I'm not. But everybody's been hyping it up, and I know you're good at it. Gosh, shucks. You. I'm serious. 
Remember when you got me and Trish to believe Mr. Montoya was conducting spooky rituals in the school basement? <laughs> Still not debunked. You had like this whole lore. A town-wide conspiracy. It was awesome. <laughs> well, if you like that, you are going to love the campaign. Your character is basically like Spooky Montoya, but if he was hot and cool and had wings. Mr. Montoya does have wings. Well, whatever. I missed you, dude. Hmm. Well, here's where we part ways. You're not taking the bus? I have mysterious places to be. Ominous. Plus, I think I see Sage and Stella coming over, and I'm hot off my last disastrous tarot reading slash cookie adventure. Also ominous. Enjoy. Okay. See you later, Reese. Sorry, Reese. Not Reese. You're not Keanu Reese, but have you seen still, Fang? Is there a Dino Keanu Reese in this Who universe? Who is I don't really that? Like. Do we know them? Um, I don't remember being friends with a gorgeous style icon. What? How dare you look so amazing in high school? Okay, oh, uh, that's nice. Uh, embarrassing. Uh, okay, okay. Very funny, thank you. Oh, it's so good. Mwah, like, seriously, so good. Here, have a cookie. I made them this morning. Wow, I really need this right now. Aw, oh, there's a secret ingredient. It's lavender. Or is it? Is it? So you spent summer getting an awesome makeover. Cool. What else? Catch us up. Stop it there. Well, the wolf. Trish was at bug camp and Reed was off somewhere. Well, they're done. So I mostly so. just like hung around and played music. I'm not saying they can't eat. It was there. fun, and it got us an audition for Battle of the Bands. Um, what? Hello, fame. Thy name is Fang. Yeah, I'm. I'm pretty excited about it. Auditions next week. Oh, that's amazing! Congrats! You guys are gonna kill it! I know it. The cards told her so. Oh my god, stop. What about you guys? What'd you do? Try not to melt, mostly. Dressing cute is hard when it's hot as hell. You're saying this to, like, our gothest friend. Exactly! Fang knows what it's like to suffer for the aesthetic. But yeah, I was mostly an indoor boy this summer to beat the heat. And I baked a ton, so I got really good at it. Somehow, I don't really get how baking helps you beat the heat. Like I'm saying. <laughs> Ugh, you guys suck. Cookie privilege is revoked. No, I take it back. Well, I spent the summer banking babysitting money and doing tarot for my mom's friends on their wine nights. Hey, want me to read your cards for you? Uh, okay, this is the only thing that I... I can actually get so sure. Uh, and one thing that I gonna say by myself. First of all, why does that look so fucking square? <laughs> he look, she looks like a fucking Roblox character. <laughs> I'm not joking around. <laughs> ah, but again, it's just a personal thought. I can, I can totally say that we we can actually she can actually make it make it better. Sage, on the other hand, he looks neat. The, the design of Sage looks. Neat. I'm not sure why they. Make characters designs looks neat. As, aside from from nice Nasser. Nasser really looks like again square for me. But Reed and Reed and Sage looks neat. The designs of Reed and Sage looks really neat. Sure. Okay. Yeah. How do I? Uh, how does it work? <laughs> okay. So like, I'm gonna draw three cards from the tarot deck. There are a few different ways to do a reading, but for now, we're just gonna stick with choosing one card. When you choose your card, have a specific question or idea in mind that you want an answer for. Maybe just a direction, or like a sign of where the energy's at for you right now. Mm, what will happen with the ban? What should I focus on? Do I buy with anyone? Ah, uh, what should I focus on? Okay. Got it. Ready. Yay. Now pick a card. Okay. I go middle. Oh, I always go middle. The magician. <gasps> Ooh, the magician! Exciting! What does it mean? So, this card says that you've got an intense creative drive. The little magician guy on this card is in their workshop, and they're utilizing all their resources to create the outcome they want. And that's me. 
or it's supposed to be? You got it. You're magic, babe. Or at least, you have the opportunity to be. The magician appears as like an indication that you have the ability and resources to manifest your will. You just need the focus and the drive to make it all happen. So it's good. I don't get it. Again, I don't get all the stuff of the tarots. But again, it's just a personal thing. But it's good, I guess. So it's good. One of those person that it's actually good. says that you're, you made your own. If you're destiny. smart about it. You need a clear vision, basically. You have the window of opportunity, but you need to know how to use it. This card just means that the outcome is within your grasp. It's up to you to guarantee it. See, like that card sounds completely terrifying to me, but also now you know what's gonna happen. It's not exactly about what's going to happen. It's just something to help you frame events or decisions in a new context, like a subconscious thing. You project your own meaning onto these things. I don't know your life, and neither do the cards. Mm, I'm pretty sure she says this stuff so she doesn't get hunted down and tried for witchcraft. Oh my god, enough! She's a witch! A witch! Burn the witch! <laughs> okay, thanks. Thanks for the size, Stella. Uh, teach me how you teach me your forbidden arts. <laughs> Stella, teach me your mystic ways. Enlighten us, oh magical one. Let us learn that which is forbidden knowledge. <laughs> oh my god, Fang, not you too. Oh, gotta go. Bye. See you in the future. Oh, stop it, you. Right, Doc Brown. <laughs> I must send you back to the future. I hope, I hope they made, they made uh, another back to the future movie, but not... But not like that, like, they're doing it today, like, completely, uh, they remastered the, the old one. Okay, Baba and I go. Baba and I are gone to Isla Okay, Nubla. thank God for that. Don't eat all the food at once. Be responsible, no parties, one friend is fine. Fatme, don't stay up late. Nasser, keep up with your homework. Don't misbehave just because we are gone. Call cousin Amal if you need something. And look after each other. My name is Fang, Mom. Hmm. It's just me, or they look, sound like? Does this look right to you? I tried turning India. it into a vector graphic so we can scale it up, but it looks bad, doesn't it? I don't know why uh, English has That's what I'm asking. Nah, <laughs> it looks fine. I think you might be a perfectionist. Aw, thank you. <laughs> that wasn't. Never mind. The yearbook's gonna be great. I hope so. We need more pictures, though. At the moment, it's mostly just Sage. And he's really cute, but this has to represent everyone. Okay, slowly, quietly. Yeah, saw that coming. <laughs> oh no! The cookies! And there goes. <laughs> oh, hi! It's weird, but I forgot you lived here. A court moment. Nasser's just helping me with the student life pages layout. Very cool. You can go now. Wait, wait, um... Do you have any pictures of your band? Uh, what was it called? Worm drama. Right, worm drama. Does that mean anything? Uh, you know what, it doesn't matter. If you have anything, we can add it to the yearbook. Oh, and maybe someone can come take pictures of you at your show. You're playing a show? When? I had no idea. Ah, shit. Don't jinx it. Nice try. You see, practicing. <laughs> You're the one always complaining about how much I practice. This is why. Oh, and then you can use the money for your tour van, like you said? Your tour van? I didn't Wait, speak about the tour van. How much money are we talking about? Okay, I should have kept this a secret. I guess I have to explain it. Okay, I'm gonna explain it to you. Just to, for you to know. I'm going on tour with Trish and Reed in the summer with my graduation money. It's not a big deal. It's a super big deal. Pretty sure mom and dad aren't gonna let you spend that money on a band. They don't know yet. And it's my plan, isn't it? It just sounds expensive. How would you even... 
Uh, I think it sounds cool. You get to see so many new places. Exactly. I bet it's gonna be really amazing. Oh, would you play something for me? Um, for us? Um, right now? Yeah. You know what? I could use a break. Do you need to go get your guitar? No, I could just play the piano, but I've, I've got all these snacks to eat. Oh, you need some help with those? Doop, doop, doop. Nah, fuck you now, sir. <laughs> I'd really I, love to hear something. I was love very if, if you want. <laughs> I don't know much about music besides what I hear on the radio. Me too. What is music? I can't even remember. Help. Okay, fine, but I'm out of here. I was going to process anyway, they are not scary as hell. Okay, I was going to process anyway. Alright, it's your lucky day. I knew it. What's it called? It doesn't have a name yet. Maybe. I know people in the living room. I need to get out of here of this of this room. It's untitled. I know people in the living room. Don't be a dick. No! You get game! You make me the, the choice to be a dick. I want to be a dick. Let me be a dick! Come on, Fang! You know you wanna say it! Say it! Say it. <laughs> okay. okay, this is another fucking piece of crap that I have this game. It doesn't want me to be a dick! And I hate it! Okay, it's untitled. It's called... Untitled... Number 7. Huh. Cool. It's just something I'm working on. Here goes. We're playing the piano now? Yeah, we're playing the piano now. I said it back and I said it again. The music is really neat. Wow. That doesn't sound like something you wrote. Um, thanks? No, I mean, it sounded really good. It's... I just meant that it's also kind of really sad. Oh. I mean, I'm just experimenting. I thought it was beautiful. So did I. It's nice to hear something that isn't about falling in love for once. True. You never really write about that, do you? I love that one about the moldy pudding. What was it? Puke Factory? Everyone loves Puke Factory. I wanna hear it. You got the touch. You got the touch. Maybe they're, they're right. He's just saying that. And maybe, they, maybe they're right. Yeah. I'll keep working on it. You'll make the show for sure. 
Yeah. Maybe we will. Looks like you've got lots of work to do. So let me just let you do it. Wait, before you go, can I send this to Mom and Dad? I think they'd love to see it. They ask me about you, like, all the time. You took a video? Not cool. But can you send it to me? Sure. But what do you think? Could help Mom and Dad get behind your whole tour idea. Mm, she got a point. No way. Uh, yeah, that's sort of got a point, so... Yeah. He got a point. You know what? Sure. Send it. Why not? But thanks for thinking of that. Of course. Photos unlocked. Just unlock the photo. As you progress to fun story and make decisions, you will unlock new photos to your gallery. Press options to open access your unlocks to the previous video. Okay. Not a bad pick, actually. Very singer songwriter. Such a sap. Bye, Nasser. Bye, Naomi. See you, Fang. Sorry, was I really awkward? I just thought it was good. Yeah, no. They're really good. Oh, uh, don't forget to send me pictures! Uh, yeah, right. Nah. Could, could be cool, actually. Yeah, right. Will do. Never. Yeah. This is the new food we got here today. She loves it. Nom nom nom. Say, who is we? I thought we dumped Mr. Sad jeans last year. Stella, lol. Trish, I did it. I did. And it was me and Rosa, okay? Oh my gee. Okay, weak emote. That is she. What is she eating? It's sick. Have to agree, let's just say. I have to agree. Very sick. Oh, I think she's cute. Thanks, me too. It's special type of fur. It's like their favorite food ever. So, best worst part of his day? Lunch, always. Okay, I'm bringing that velvet nose are known their curious mating behavior. Need details, please. Perb. Dude. <laughs> this is why I love it. Yes! Give my girl Mango some privacy. She can be into whatever she wants. Mango sex positive. Ugh. No, please. No. You gotta hear Rosa talk about Hang on. Rosa has been added to the group chat. It's Rosa, everyone. Just in time. Oh my god, hi. Yay. Hard eyes, I guess. Rosa, yes. Hi, hi. We have a lot of questions for you. Don't scare her away already, Sage. Hey, Rosa. Uh, be cool. Whatever. Ah, uh, be cool. Be cool, thank. Always greet new people. Hey, Rosa. Cool to see you here. Is that weird? Fang! Sorry, guys. I gotta work on some songs. Talk to you later. What's it fail to say? Again? Hey, are your phones being weird right now? Yup, it's the electromagnetism again. I think. Not totally sure. But what else could it be? Hmm, gonna be like bad phones, aliens? <laughs> Martians? I guess so, actually. Okay, well, um, I'm going home. <laughs> My parents are probably freaking out about whatever's happening. See you in school tomorrow. Bye. Come on in. Hey, I'm gonna make dinner. Mom left a bunch of stuff in the freezer. Is it pizza? Definitely zero chance it's unhealthy in any way. Be right there. Mmm. I ate pizza on Thursday, so that would be nice. 
Trust me, it's not as healthy as it sounds. <laughs> what are you making? Whatever was in the tub labeled Monday dinner. I thought about Tuesday dinner, or even Thursday dinner. But I'm not sure we're ready to embrace that level of anarchy. Mm. Good call, bro. Anarchy is not sure will be cool. It's like they think... Uh, anarchy is not sure will be cool. <laughs> Ooh, watch out, class president. Don't want to be caught throwing words like anarchy around. Very funny. <laughs> hey, you're not the one getting five texts from mom today. Five. Yikes. There should be a way to cut off parents after they reach a certain number of texts per day. She does it to you too? Actually, no. They've both kind of ignored me all week since they left. Uh, it rules, it's weird. It's gonna hurt, it's gonna hurt. Hey, no, no. Okay, I have time, so it's weird. It feels strange. Kind of like I'm forgetting my keys, but they're just in my pocket the whole time. Yeah. Half the text she sends me are for you anyway. Tell your sister, make sure Fatima does her chores. No, I mean, she's trying. Sometimes she calls you Fang. Does she? Yeah, let me find it. Well, I know she has. She, she's doing her best. Mm. Yeah, but again, there's kind of We parents. have spices, right? Totally try. Oh, yes, brilliant. But... As it needs, it needs a spice. But again, sometimes parents had a little bit trouble because again, for them, they know you the, your entire life. So, if you guys, if you guys had a parent a little, a little trying, do not do not scratch them up because they call you with by your name. They're trying. They they just have like that trouble that they know you the whole life while you were a baby. So, try to emphasize that. So please. Give your parents a chance every every time if that happens. Okay, let's see. We need, we need a spice. We can... Uh, Drisha Starfather! Hello! Welcome to the stream! I am Lord of Skellis. I am a demon from space that is trying to conquer air by playing games! Do not actually question my logic of the plan. <laughs> anyway... I hope you had a really good day. And if you're not, I'm gonna try to actually make the best of your day. Okay, let's see. Thermic... Turmeric panda. Wow, 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 we're we're cooking. I cannot. I cannot. Don't, don't know. What is it? it? It depends on what we're cooking. I get a new spice or I'm not sure. Uh, nice. I'm a fan of this game. Uh, I mean, hell, before I came out as a trans, my mom will will call me by all my five brothers' names by accident all the time. Yeah. Uh, you see, she doesn't. She doesn't know what know what happened. So yeah. Try to get your parents that is trying to actually call you by the pronouncers. Give them a chance. They're really try. Okay, nice. I'm a fan of this. Yeah, totally me. I am actually trying to play this game as well. <laughs> but so far, it's it's kind of good. It has uh, some flaws, but uh, it's kind of good so far. Okay, uh, ground nutmeg, pepper, salt. I'm gonna go with. Uh, I'm gonna go with salt. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what I'm cooking. So I'm gonna go with salt. You always need more salt. Okay, done. No such thing as too much salt, probably. And a sauce. And a sauce. Uh, marinara sauce. Bronze sauce. Fish sauce. Again, I'm not sure what I'm cooking. What the fuck I'm cooking? <laughs> I have a way to book reports to the... Dev yeah, something... So, I read, again. The, fo the book that actually... Fish sauce. Okay, fish sauce? Yeah, fish sauce is kind of it's kind of something work for me. I'm not sure why we're cooking that, but again, one of the books that I freaking getting my ha my head over is the fucking zoom in the music videos. It's it's kind of like you know what I know that that Fang is literally fish sauce. It's, it's, it's literally um looking really good when it's when it's uh when it's singing and all, but I'm very sure that we can actually see the little. The, the, the little flea that it's on her face right now, so we will sum at that. I'm very sure that flea has a really good story as well. <laughs> Fish has was bugged. They saw it's fixed now. Okay, let's try it out. Are you sure you want to risk it? That might make it taste a little fishy. Ugh. Here, let me taste. Oof, more sauce. Stat. 
better? Uh, I mean, it's probably as good as it'll get. Yeah, <laughs> totally. Yep, fix. Anyway, oh, nice. I can't give you a ride to school tomorrow either. Unless you want to get up early. Nice. I have presidential duties to attend to. Assembly prep. Exciting. Oh, also, I sent mom and dad the video. They liked it a lot. Really? What'd they say? Well, it was mom, but she said, my brilliant and talented children. And one of those free emojis of her sending a kiss. I kinda wish I hadn't shown her how to do that. Eh, uh, that's... Uh, that's nice, actually. Bryce, that's new. Sounds like they don't care. Ah, uh, that's nice, actually. I think I think that that's nice. I... I didn't expect her to like it. <laughs> that's... that's cool. Why wouldn't she like it? It's really good. Well, whenever I talk about music stuff, they both just kind of... shut down. Or say something like, Oh, we're so glad you have meaningful hobbies. Or, my favorite is when they're like, Wow, I have no idea how you do that. We're just, we're not creative at all. Like, thank you? I mean, they're not though. Like, at all. Have you seen Dad try to play Pictosaurus? It's like a psychological experiment. Fascinating. I think they're trying. Like the kind of chill piano music you played is perfect for them to try and understand you. You're just kind of different from them, you know? Mm, not like you, believe me, I know. I am a disappointed, you mean, uh, believe me, I know. Trust me, that is not something I'm ever able to forget in this house. Not what I meant. Okay, that, It's not like I love her all, all, all the time either. <laughs> Whatever. Thanks for dinner. Tell mom I'm studying math and wearing a pink dress. Wow, you really are really aggressive out there, huh? Again! Your parents are trying! Today, the discovery of a previously unobserved asteroid, estimated to be roughly 10 kilometers in diameter. Designated CO103, the object shows a rather high possibility of entering the solar system and a non-insignificant chance of collision with the planet. Astronomers were quick to add that very little is known about the orbit and speed of the asteroid in these early stages. And trajectory predictions are very likely to change as more data is collected. That's right, Mary. Though we know very little, scientists say the asteroid's electromagnetic atmosphere may cause some minor interference with electronics. And we'll be right back after this commercial break. Mm -hmm. Warm chat. Yo, Naomi was right. Uh, 10 kilometers asteroid predicted to enter solar system. Okay. Anyway, asteroid takes us all out. Best way to go. I'm out. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I, I'm not sure if the, the real asteroid literally was 10 kilometers. I'm not sure. I, I mean, I came on in that asteroid. So I I had like a 10,000 eons to actually notice that. But trust me, I had better, better things to do. Like them in my rock. Williams. <laughs> Wills or another one that is Wilson that he left the asteroid. Well technically I kill him, but shh that's a secret. <laughs> okay. Okay, yeah, no thanks. Sounds pretty metal. Come to me! Come at me with your <laughs> Why should we change our name to Asteroid Drama? Whoa dude. You so you so loud fast. Well, I love living a historical insignificant time period. That was fast. <laughs> Alright. Can we? Okay, why is not. I'm tapping next. The only problem is I'm not. Why is not. Doing anything? Excuse me, game. I'm tapping next. Look at this. Here it is. I'm trying to tapping next. <laughs> and it's not. Okay, uh, can I go. To the last checkpoint or not? Because apparently it's not gonna apply changes. No, it's now in the game. Uh, find a bug. <laughs> okay, quit the my menu. Let's let's try to do this again. Continue. Okay, find a bug. Yeah, I know about this. We don't need to read it again. 
I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Come to me, Meteor. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Ah, come on! Why is this happen? <laughs> come on, game! Good. Okay, yeah, I'm trying uh, all, the, all the combinations of buttons for apparently. Ah, there we go. Yeah, I found that bug again. Hmm. Okay. Very significant electromagnetism. <clears throat> hey, Fang, I have to tell you something. I like you. Like a lot. I don't know if this is me because you don't know who I am. I just need to get it. Okay! Got someone that actually sent us a love letter. Okay, the last year. Okay, uh, again, this is just me, but if someone sent me an, an anonymous uh, message, I just ignore it. Trust me. I had a million of, of, of things like that in, when I was in school, and I know they were trolls, so I just gonna ignore it. Okay, then again. Was that the meteor? Maybe just a coincidence? Okay, uh, what is that? S smile? Is that, is that a smile or something? Come down with our meteor. Okay, I'm not sure I didn't, didn't read that one. Okay, convince definitely meteor. Coincidence definitely. Okay. Let's try to calm down. What a coincidence. Nice move, uh, nice move, electricity. Great ghost. Um, question. I just got a text of someone saying that they're in love with me. And they're telling me now because we might be die soon. Ah, oh, come on, stupid text. <laughs> Allow me to really read it. Come on, shit. Okay. Which one is yo, was it? Uh, anyone else get this? What should I do? Uh, which one of you was it? <laughs> okay, soon or whatever, so. Which one of you never send it? Because, ha ha ha. It was obviously real. Not me. See? I like a fact, but it's real. The energy is wild right now. Who is it? It's just a random phone number. And they won't say. Ooh. Secret Admirer. Now that's some exciting asteroid content. Wait! Is it a meteor or an asteroid? Need to know what, what to call the thing that is about to destroy the entire planet. Thanks. Oh, good question. Let me look it up. Whoa! There is already a meme page. Asteroid image gallery. <laughs> yeah, I'm very sure that there's gonna be a lot of people that actually is gonna make fun of that. People are awful, people are the best. <laughs> Sometimes I think I'm good. I'm not good enough for this world. Okay. Okay, that's that's a that's a shrug evil. Worm chat. Okay, well, see you at the practice tomorrow. At least we know that's still happening. Then again. Okay, it's an asteroid, not a meteor. So now we know. Brains. Bit stars. But stars. But in space. Brilliant but. I'm not sure. I'm not sure how to translate that one. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. 
I don't know how, how the, the emote thinks. I gotta say that Bootstar. I gotta, I gotta call it Bootstar. I'm not, I'm not sure all the, the emote. What's the internet say? Okay, cool, cool, interaction. Uh, once some fucking rat survive the asteroid and then now give in the planet. I don't know, game, let me live, let me read it. Planet to mammals, can you imagine fucking rat survive the asteroid? Yeah, I, I mean, I'm a rat, I come in that asteroid if you ask me. Some, someone tell my parents I can't make out the trash because we are gonna die in three months. If I die when this thing hits, then that means I literally peck in the high school. There is some asteroid single. My parents can no longer tell me they had a worse than me. Make they had a recessor, but I have a little apocalypse. No fucking way. I have a cousin who works at a aerospace community, and they are saying the channels a lot of things. Okay, that, okay, the entire thing is really getting black, and I'm not gonna be able to read it. But yeah, the end is near. So, where are you gonna spend your last your last days of your life? I go, I go totally like my, my, Mad Max. <laughs> I totally go Mad Max my way out in the in the fucking end. Trust me, I'm gonna get a car. I'm gonna put it spikes in the front, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna ram over most of the people that I can. <laughs> that's that's my that's gonna be my la my last days on the earth <laughs> if we all die. Okay, I'm gonna uh, move around. I should just sleep. Eh, let's just let's just try to to get out to get out our eyes shut. Hey, you um, you hear the news? Uh, to tell us this, make it feel better. Make it feel better. Reassure him. Let's reassure him. Yeah, people are freaking out, but no one really knows anything yet. It's probably nothing. Tell that to Naomi. She's been texting me asteroid facts, and they are high octane nightmare fuel. Sounds like Naomi. You know, every fact she sends me has been cross checked with at least three verified sources. Kind of hard to dismiss. Uh, hit me with some verified terror. Uh, let's wrap this up. Uh, okay, hit me with some verified terror. Let me hear some. Well, okay. For a start, this is the biggest object to get this far into the solar system in. in. ever. Yikes. Good thing it's not gonna hit us, then. Yeah. Seriously? It's not. There's already memes about it, and that means it'll be over in, like, a month. Yeah? Yeah, no, you're right. Thanks. Trust me. You staying up? No. Gonna head to bed. Okay. Okay. Me too. Good night. Night. Mm. Yeah, everything is going to be fine until everything blows up. It's gonna be fine. It's senior year. Just gotta make it to the summer tour. Yeah, right. Just throw everything away and do, <laughs> do what I said. Go Mad Max. <laughs> and communities all across the continent reacted to the news of a previously unknown space object this morning. Okay, turn it on. No, no, no. Turn it off. Sorry. It's not, it's not good for me. Man, enough about the asteroid. Yeah, that's a good call. I might be obsessing. When did you start listening to Pangea this morning? I thought the goal is to not turn into dead. Uh, I have my own reasons to stay informed. I'm on the debate team. I'm class president. And dad could never pull off this outfit that I'm totally crushing. Hmm. Nope. This silence is nice. We don't need to fill it. Definitely not. Okay, he's been weird. He's got something to say. I'm very sure he has something to say. Except you have something to say. No. No. Well, hey, hey could I run something by you? Fine. So, today, big day, class president's speech at the assembly. In light of the whole space rock potential demise of civilization thing my chosen theme feels off what's the theme using this year to um make an impact that's gonna go seems fine to me so ah uh, seems fine to me you're overthinking it 
I use it 542 times in a 1,000 word speech. I even had a section where I rhymed every sentence with impact. Eh, that's just a boy. <laughs> You're describing a poem. And I think having a poem inside your speech is your real problem. We have to act. Let's make this pact. Our goals can become fact. Please stop. It was a bit. No, I have to change it. Yeah, it's just too weird. Can I run some ideas by you? Please help me. Okay, fine. Pep talk time. I don't have the. Okay, fine. Fine. What do you got? Okay, so this year I want us to burn bright, to streak across the sky like flaming trails of potential, ready to vaporize our obstacles upon entry. And now with a meteor. Oh God, stop! And now with a meteor. Jokes, please. Stop. Stop. <laughs> ah, I get it. <laughs> Hilarious. Good session. Seriously, please. You're so comfortable on stage, and I don't know how you do it. And I want to be that way. Uh, help him out. I really can help you. Ah, uh, help him out. Okay. Here's what I'd suggest. You've got. Okay, you unlock a flashback by making choices that affect your relationship with that character. You unlock flashback related to them. Press option success jokes. Okay, what is that? Nasser jokes. Is that really a flashback? Okay, Nasser jokes. Hey, fine. Ah, what? I'm a little worried about the calendar. It stays hard, our number. Ugh. Does it smell like Optino in here you, to you? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> okay, let's see. You know, if we were twins... Hello? We have perotactyls. <laughs> Come on. Ah, I get it. Okay, thanks a lot for that. Please stop. Hey, Fang! No. <laughs> Okay, yeah, and Nasser is kinda cool in, in this game. Of... Okay, make people laugh, avoid mature talk, be relatable. Be relatable. I think the best option is be relatable with that one. Let people in a bit. What if you just told the truth? How are you feeling about all of this? It's not about me, though. I'm supposed to speak for the student body. And you are. Yeah. And you're better at doing that than you think. But, let's say people are feeling as confused as you are. Coming in as if you know everything would be the worst thing you could do. Thank you. You give pretty good advice sometimes. Wow, I have never been to school this early. You mean on time? Oh, well, good luck today. Thanks. And you'll be there. I'll just focus on you and the audience. <laughs> yeah. Assembly? I can't remember the last time I actually went to that. See, it'll be a fun new thing for you. Plus, you'll get all the hot intel on Senior Picture Day. Woohoo! Hmm. Ah, uh, we will see how it happens. I mean, he's my brother, all but, but not my fans. What are you doing here? You being up this early feels wrong. Wait, blink twice if you're a mimic. <laughs> new year, new me. Okay, but if you join debate club or something, I'm getting you some help. Hmm, fair. Hmm. Okay, so, yeah, Okay, it's... okay, everybody! Lots of assembly energy happening right now. I kind of like it. Oh, are they still doing that? I don't know. The whole apocalypse thing really puts talking about Pizza Fridays in a different light. I was just gonna go chill on the roof. You are obsessed with going up there. You're above and inside, on the outside. It's awesome. Mm. Okay, LJ. Bang, remember the audition is next week at Lava Java. Let me be clear, you got talent, but if you want this gig, you have to play something new. Nothing from the other 100 auditions, okay? Just trying to help. Um... Okay, this is bad news. This is great news. I think this is great news because again, you're you are trying to make something new 
So you don't. Every single fucking band has to do every single time every, something new in order to actually progress. That's how we have really classic. So yeah, this is great news. LJ thinks we have talent. I always try had to try new different things. Gosh, you think she could write a nice text for once? Um. Uh. What well, should I say back? At least that's what I think. I when, mean, if I am not bad. That will be there. Wait, there's a gif I think is perfect. Ah, uh, not helpful. Okay, be careful, be confident, be cool. And be grateful. Everybody is will do whatever it takes to get the spot. Thanks, Sergei. I think this means she's rooting for us? We're gonna get in? Or she's telling us not to get our hopes up. Uh, she wouldn't bother. Wow, doubter. <laughs> Ah, uh, she will bother. No way. She wouldn't bother with that. Ugh. Emergency band meeting. We need a plan for the audition. The showcase is huge. So, meeting on the roof? Oh my gosh, get over the roof. Perfect, let's go. Wait a minute, don't we have like a week till the audition? Exactly. You can love the view up there. Hmm. Well, to the roof we go. I wanna see what the. Ooh, nice plants. Is that a cactus? Wow. Yeah. Yeah, this is pretty great. Right? Peaceful. <laughs> no thanks. I quit. My voice. Anyway, the bad news. About the giant rock that's gonna kill us all? Yeah. We heard. We need new songs for the audition. Seriously though, I got like no sleep thanks to the news. What if it's real? I mean, it's probably, definitely, real. So, like, it could be just as bad as people are saying. They'd never even tell us if we were all toast. Right? What if everything we're doing is for nothing? I just spent hours on homework when I could have been, I don't know, some fun bucket list thing. Okay, the band is a thing. It does feel pointless. I'm not too worried. Ah, uh, the, the band is a thing, I guess. Not sure. Exactly. That's what we're doing. And we can still win Battle of the Bands, asteroid or not. Really? Should we even practice at a time like this? Or should we throw off the shackles of capitalism and bound into a life of freedom and hedonistic self-indulgence? Hell yeah, Trish. Let's do the music thing, thanks. Which, again, is why we're up here. To talk about the songs. So that'd be, what, three new ones? That's a lot, dude. That's a lot. I have this project with Rosa and a test already happening in calculus, Plus babysitting again, and my sister's birthday. Okay, be sympathetic, be insistent, be compromising. Be sympathetic. Yeah, it's true, you're, you're dealing with a lot. Ooh, let's just play an old song in, like, a new way. Ugh, they're so embarrassing. Wow, okay, sorry. Yikes. Rude. No, ugh, I didn't mean it like that. I just want to write about bigger things now. Our old stuff is about big things. But you could change some of it, I guess. Works for me. Let us know when you're done. Well, maybe we can all pick one at lunch. Sure, sure. I gotta go. To my locker, but in a shady way. Because I have a terrible secret today. <laughs> oh boy. Mm. <laughs> What's with Bruce? Was I weird? Uh, what's with Rish? Uh, was I weird? I'm gonna, I'm gonna ask Rish. Was I weird with Trish just now? Like, weird weird? Yeah, kinda. Uh, are you okay? You've come into this year kinda intense with the band stuff. What's up? Mmm, somewhere kinda suck. I'm fine. The one is everything to me. Uh, the one is everything to me, I guess. The band is important. Why did she have to just leave? I said it was an emergency. 
You did? And it is to you. So I was weird, exactly. Not so I was weird. It's better if you out of criticize yourself. <sighs> so I was being weird. Shit. Sorry, I just. It feels like we really have a chance. Uh, you also have to sympathize with people by just. I bet this would be a good spot to how be. you will behave as well. The asteroid? At school? No thanks. Nah, not in the school. I. Rather not spend my last moments at school, actually. It's weird how everyone's acting like nothing is different. Like to me, everything feels different now. Even though it's just a maybe? Yeah, I don't know. It's like once something may or may not happen, you can't stop thinking about it. And that's like the rest of my life all of a sudden. We're going on tour with the band. You, me, Trish, a van with our name on the side. Nothing has changed. The fan would be pretty sick. So, you know how we all play Legends and Lore, right? And ITM? Yeah. I'm joining this weekend, right? You are. Yes. Anyway, I've been playing LNL since I was like eight years old. I know the game better than anyone in this whole school. It sucks when the people you want to sh- Yo, man, I'm gonna say check the, check the photo. Uh, Ray gets it. Share it with aren't as interested. So, I get it. But I don't know if a lot of other people do. Okay, so L and L are like DVD, right? I never played DVD. Well, yeah, after I finished school. Yeah, I, after I finished school, I was winning DVD with some friends, but that's it. I never played again. Time to assemble. Good luck with that. Catch me up on whatever I miss. About the yearbook dance or whatever. You're not coming? <laughs> no. I gotta do some invoicing and some L, &L planning. Wanna ditch with me? Well, Trish isn't there, so. Hmm. So, we're doing this, again, if Nasser is the one that actually is making the speech, I'm very sure it will be nice for him to see me in here. Just supporting my, my brother, I guess. Ooh. Okay, I guess we are seeing people's profile, I guess. Okay. Uh, Adana. Dang God, and again, I'm having I'm having trouble with small, with small letter because again I'm playing on a on a fucking window. Okay, Tony Box the say that they tried to spin the asteroid into some motivational speech about our dreams coming untrue. Adam Musk got the gift prophecy. I swear they pretty on, on fable. Okay, anybody else in here? I don't think so. Okay, this one. Sorry. This tiny this. Okay, uh, um, before the meteor hits and we all die, when I need they have a crush on me. This is cool, but how oh boy, she's a lot. Okay, anybody else? No, just this one. Dead death the official, the uh, official, I know. Okay, new video. Just uploaded my first day at school prep plus OTD. I'm not sure how is that. What is that? Plus, plus my tips for making the most of senior year. Star link YouTube. <laughs> okay, that's a really good, good way to actually put a YouTube. <laughs> the other way is hustling. Past hustling. I wouldn't be surprised if she hatched from her egg with a five steps business plan. Alright, let's see. Anybody else? No? Okay, this one. Serena Rena43. I heard some shit went down at the volleyball practice last night. Serena always seems to know the gossip before everyone else. Ooh, so she's the. So she is the kind of, um, you know. The one that actually has all the info, I guess. Okay, Chris. Church 
042. This Friday, defending our house. Playoffs or nothing. Razor Wings said, uh, say, uh, I'm sure. Uh, sorry about that. Uh, every year, Chris posts like he's on the football team, even though very obvious, is it? Okay. So, anybody else? No, this one just. Abby. A new school year, new for new me. And new enemies. Watch your back. Abby is very cool, and I hope I never get on her bad side. Okay, let's see. And nah, this one. Claire. Claire IT. Oh my god, the new Swamp Baby single is so good. Ah! She better not hear the have audition. He might ask us to get out of her. Okay, anybody else? Yeah, you. Okay, KT. KT runs. Cross country tryouts after school. Open to all levels of experience. Don't miss out. She's nice, but it should be illegal to be a, mor a morning person in high school. Okay, anybody else? Yeah, you. Mark. Mark my words. No, you stay up last night playing the last stage of Carnage Game. I was sub crying about a father and son and their dad puppy. What do you mean they are the same thing? Mark's fun, but I don't know if we ever talk in real life. He tends to be asleep during daylight. Okay, I guess this is the last one. Yeah, this is the last one. Kalini Okayani. And there we go. Nothing I hate more than being 20 minutes late for class and seeing someone flying dinosaur soaring about me. Don't know them well, but they're cool. Non-binary non dino solitary forever. Okay, I think we are. We're done. There's Trish with Rosa. Yeah, I know these characters. Are you gonna go in or...? Okay, stay here. Go sit with it. I promise not to be here, so go sit with him. Guess I have to. Hi, I saved you a spot. Excellent seating choice, right? Not so close to the front that we have to like make awkward eye contact. I worked at a movie theater last summer, so I'm kind of an expert on optimal seating. That's cool. Is that a joke? <laughs> I don't care. I. That's cool, I guess. <laughs> Cool. <laughs> Watching movies for free sounds awesome. Oh, hey! Oh my god! Oh my god, I heard you got an audition for the showcase. Flashback, uh, That's huge! Okay, okay, give me a moment, I gotta see the flashback. Rosa and Sage. Hey! Oh, hey! What are you? I need to break from being me. I get it. You ever feel like, like support staff for other people? All the time. It's nice, but I don't know. Yeah. They love you for being there when they need you. But maybe they don't know you, you. Nice to meet you, you. You, you. You, you too. Mm. Yeah, again, um, in this game, Rosa is trans. And again, Sage is... I'm not sure if he, his... They are trans or... Just, you know... But, nah, I'm, I'm okay with kind of people, the kind of people they are, so... Nah, but we'll see. Ouch. Oh yeah, we're gonna be amazing. No big deal. Oh, hey, did I tell you what Mango stole this morning? Not one, but three socks from my laundry. Do you think she's trying to build a nest? I mean, I know sometimes they build dens, but usually only in mating season. Oh my god. Baby mangoes? Ah! Yes, please! I want five! A dozen! Ah! Wow! Huh. Yup! Hey! A lot of worms, that's what it is! <laughs> and am fucking starting to it. <laughs> Good morning! We have a quick announcement, and then we'll hear from our class president. Truly an inspiration to us all. Yes, and hi. 
I'm Naomi, and I'm here to remind you that the Yearbook Club is still looking for members. I know I want to remember this year forever. So you can join and be part of making our memories last a lifetime through good design. And speaking of yearbook, don't forget senior pictures are coming up. Um, uh, so some good tips for taking good photos can be found on the Yearbook Club website at... Okay, well, uh, okay, thanks! <laughs> I will be caught dead up there. Well, that's going to hunt, sir. She seems fearless. Uh, well, that's going to hunt her. <laughs> I'm very sure that's going to get to hunt her. That's the kind of memory that'll follow you to the grave. <laughs> Look, we're all feeling a little off right now. I know I am. But I also know I'm not alone. And I know you aren't either. And if it ever feels like that, come find me. Seriously. He's connecting. It's working. Okay, Trace is definitely being weird. Ross is kind of nice. She'll go with it. I should have gone with it. I think Rosa's nice. Rosa is nice. Really nice. What's her deal? I don't really get a fake vibe, but... In conclusion, maybe the rock will hit us, and maybe probably it won't. But either way, we will still have each other. Kind of. Okay, and that's my perfectly crafted plug for the big dance. So, end of the year, mark your calendars, prep your moves, that's it for me. You've been great, Volcano High. Please don't post any videos of this, like, anywhere ever. Thanks. Okay, that was rough. He did okay. I think he did okay. <laughs> yeah! Woo! Again, he really sympathize with other people. And, again, if you sympathize with other people, that's okay in my book. Okay, not to be weird, but that speech was, like, amazing. Um, not weird. Do you have eyes? Nasser can get it. Mm. Don't see it. <laughs> That's my husband you're talking about. Still I see Nasser. Hey, uh, <laughs> hey, hey guys. <laughs> I forgot to mention it at assembly, but the Young Engineers Club has some openings for new members. <laughs> oh yeah? What kind of thing do y'all do? Well, on Thursday we'll be dissecting a frog. A robotic frog. Oh, sick. Yeah, and it'll look good on college applications, so the more the merrier. Wait, I thought you were going to be a physician, though. Uh, I, I mean, I, I am. <laughs> Engineering is basically just surgery for machines. <laughs> totally. Anyway, um... Okay, bye. Bye, nah, no me, don't worry. That was so not what's a word, the deal huh? with Miss Robot Frog and Nasser? Are they a thing or Naomi? Nah. Oh my god, you're obsessed with him! You know what you should do? You should do a terror reading about it. Who says I haven't? What did it say? True the lovers, no big deal. Oh! I love that card! <laughs> Yeah, I thought I will do that if anybody had done the same with my brother. <laughs> oh, hey. Locker pals. Oh. Huh. Yeah. I'm glad we finally met. Trish talks about you, like, all the time. Ha. <laughs> Does she really? Oh, yeah. Every song that came on Shuffle, she would have a whole story about a concert you two went to or a riff you did. We've been into music for a long time. It feels like we're bound by it, but, you know, like, in, in a good way. I get it. And now Battle of the Bands? You're really killing it. Well, I don't know about that, but we're doing our best. I don't know. I work with LJ. Trust me. I know how picky she could be. Getting that audition is a big deal. Yeah. You know, I really hope that Trish and Reed know that. Honestly, it seems like Trish is just so busy since we got back. Well, I think Trish is figuring things out. She knows how important this is. She's just a bit scattered, a little anxious. We talk about it sometimes. We're all, all. We are all, all doing that. Sorry. 
We're about to die, what? so. Four. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> no worries. <laughs> oh, hey, I gotta go. I'll be sending good vibes at the audition. I'm on shift. I'll see you there. Okay, uh, photo unlock. Give me a moment. I gotta see it then. Oh, did I? He didn't check out these photos. He's a good Paul, but he's a good Paul with a stage presence. Oh, sorry. All right, there it goes. Okay, look at all this. Hmm. I mean, so everything is going to be like flattened, right? Squish, stuck to the bottom of a rock. Like we're just gum or something. I mean, wherever it makes impact, yeah. If it makes impact. Right, right. So then everything else will just explode into dust? Like all those cars in the parking lot. And all the straw wrappers and sunglasses and little air fresher things inside the cars. <laughs> Did you just write a poem? Shut up. You really aren't thinking about it? The big kaboom? Mm, nope, definitely am. Yeah, definitely am. Of course I definitely am. Definitely thinking about it. But also, there's really nothing we can do about it, right? Yeah. Gotta just control what we can until we know more. Zen. I guess. Which is why we are gonna absolutely nail this audition. That's like the one thing we can control right now. Mm -hmm. Getting out of this town, speaking our minds, living our dream. Uh, getting out of this town, nah, I think we're, we're living our dream. You don't have nowhere to run at to this time. live the lives we've always dreamed of, no matter how long we have left. And doing it on our terms, with our songs and our hard work. Like, sure, this meteor might kill us all, but wouldn't it actually feel worse to blow our shot? I don't want to live like that. And if LJ hates our stuff, that's exactly what's going to happen. So we just got to do it. Practice. Well, yeah, but that's not what I meant. Play our songs good? Yes, our songs. She wants something new, remember? But we can't do that before the audition, so we have to just rework an old song. F -f the back catalog. Okay, here are our options. First up, everyone's favorite, Puke Factory. Okay, are we? My mother is a robot. Beep boop. Oh my god, these titles. And last but not least. Ugh. Are we? Bent Jimmy Two Face. Are we are in a rock band now. <laughs> well, what do we think? What's your favorite? Get Bent Jimmy Two Face. That song gives me all the feels. In a mm. good way now, though. My mother is a robot. Beep boop. Great, no consensus. I guess we can go with. Um, uh, my server gave me, gave me Jimmy Two Two Face. Uh, um, we're gonna make Trish happy. <laughs> Get bent, Jimmy Two Face. Yeah, that guy still sucks. <laughs> so it needs a new name. What else? Different key, new hooks. So wait, we have to redo the whole song. In like a few days? Dude, no way we can do that. But we have to. And I also have to go to school, You're right, shot. babysit, and study and not fail my classes. Me too. Not babysitting, but you know, my job. Yeah, this is like an extreme makeover. I don't know if we can pull it off. Maybe we just don't? No, okay, um, just let me think. I will figure this out. I have my MIDI controller, and, and I can make it so your part isn't that different. Ooh, MIDI magic. Sick. I'll make it work, I promise. Trust me. Just give me my little part, and I'll be there. Okay, okay. Cool. We're gonna do this. It's gonna be great. Okay, we are going to practice. MIDI controller. <clears throat> MIDI controller. She's not finding it. 
Again, get your stuff in order so you Are can you get it. I feel faint. I'm just looking for something. Oh, I thought this was all a highly specialized management system. Or that's what I've heard you scream at mom for years anyway. It is. So, big audition coming up. How are you feeling about it? Good. Totally fine. Why? No, nothing. Just asking. I used to get really nervous before every debate tournament, you know? But Naomi taught me this great meditation. I can teach it to you sometime. I'm good, thanks. I'm kind of busy working on songs, actually. Would you ever be a solo act? What? No, no way. Worm Drama is a band. Interesting. That must be weird, though, right? Like, sharing something like that with other people. I mean, everyone thinks you're some mysterious rebel, but you actually have a really tight crew. Mm, I guess you have friends too. I'm serious, right? You have friends too. You have friends? Naomi? She's here a lot. Like, a lot. I don't know. The band is special. I just think it's cool that you have that. I'm gonna go shoot hoops with my sports band. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> what the fuck was that? I mean, I get it. She, she's backed into searching, but what the fuck was that? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, let's. Well, we, we have to search a mini thing. What is this? Ugh, I should probably empty this out sometime. Okay, uh, what is this? I'll read these someday. Probably. Yeah, someday until you, you, you're gonna be dead until that happens. A boot? Okay, another boot. A boot! <laughs> you have two boots! These are probably still good, right? Probably? Probably. I was wondering where this sock went. I thought the dryer ate it. Hmm. Something, something mightier than the sword. Okay, I cannot... These should probably go in the wash. Generic black sock number 41. How I've missed you. Hmm. Yes! Okay, that's a mixer. I'm, I'm not sure. It's called MIDI. I call it a mixer. I'm not sure. It's, it's, it's just the same thing. Okay, rock one time? Yeah, rock one time. Again, what the, with the same thing? I wanna see her performing like normal, please. Fix that!
The music is neat, but please, cop, if you're watching this, I swear to God, I'm having a seizure right now with the soap. Get rid of the soap! <laughs> Get rid of that fucking soap! <laughs> that was local favorite Swamp Babies of their newest LP, Rabies Babies. Pretty messed up title, but okay. Speaking of the Bay's babyest trio, you'll be able to catch them at this year's Battle of the Bands. Hit up Lava Java's website for all the details. And as always, we'll be there scouting out the songs we'll play for you all year. Don't miss it! Ugh, Swamp Babies. I don't get it. Don't worry, it's gonna be our turn next word chat. The audition is tomorrow. Pump them up, uh, keep it steady. Remind them to practice. Ah, uh, keep it steady. How are we feeling, Worms? So hype. Made of hype. 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 Made up of the school. One last practice. You got it. Okay, thumbs up. Stars eyes. Don't forget, Mono Day. Thank you, Naomi of my head. Thank you for reminding me that. <laughs> what the fuck is that? Well, I'm very sure that's normal for you, with that reaction of yours. Uh, no! No! No, 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 no. Well, I'm, 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 no, no, the nail paint actually does something for electronics. I don't even can tell that. Just program me the controller. Nail polish everywhere. I have to die. Where an asteroid when you need it. Okay, help. I'm freaking out. Emergency. Again, I'm an electronic uh, technician, so I'm very sure that that's not that bad as it looks. Again, if you had a um, contact cleaner, you just you just open that up, you clean it, in, and that's it. You don't need to do anything else. It's that simple. Okay, hello. It's that time again for a ride to school with me. Thanks. One sec. Hi, makers and breakers. Welcome back to my channel. Today, we're going to learn how to fix... Blah, 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 blah. So this is a bit tricky, and I would not recommend you try this solo unless you have experience with this sort of thing. If you end up with a real expensive paperweight, you've been warned! Ugh, damn it! Bang! I'm leaving, mm. for real. It's not that simple Wait, to actually fix it. I'm, I mean, I'm coming. I, I can totally fix some, something like that. But again, I'm an electronic technician, so of course. For me, it's that easy. So, again, if that happens to you... Good news, my tallest friend. Except grass. Remember my words. It's not that expensive to actually fix that. Can you... You can fix my controller, but that... That's just news. You mean... You can fix my controller? You figured out how to get nail polish off a MIDI controller? Oh, that... No. Major bummer. Okay, so the controller is an open issue, but hey, I got some other great news. Rosa got a job at Lava Java! She's our woman on the inside. She says LJ is actually a huge softie. What do you think? Should I tell her to put in a good word for us? Uh, yeah, why not? We uh, we we totally have someone inside. <laughs> I think. So, yeah. I mean, she's our, she's that's, our intel. That's actually a great idea, but I don't think you understand. Without the MIDI controller, we have no songs to play, except the ones we know LJ hates. Well, I don't know. How bad can it be? Like this? Oh, pretty bad, I guess. Again, I'm not sure. Cute color, though. Uh, for me, it's, that's just a six. 
in my le in level of repairing. No, not even a six, a seven could be. Not even a seven, not eight, it's just an eight. It's just that simple to actually fix that. <laughs> but again, I take it to, for myself. I'm not sure about you. I saw that I. <laughs> okay, picture time. Ooh. Oh, wait, it's time. Never mind. Uh, I'm gonna put this here. Nah, nope. Okay, it's time. Let me, give me a moment. I'm gonna... There goes. <laughs> that's, that's the perfect, that's the perfect picture. <laughs> there you go. You're up. <laughs> oh, no. I'll go later. Got my afternoon glow going. Bang! Just the person I need. Can I ask you a huge favor? Reed promised me he wouldn't skip picture day this year and... <gasps> Naomi, you fix electronics in your science club, right? Uh, yes. I, I mean, not like broken phones or anything, but yeah. Nail polish. This morning. Oh, yikes. How about this? Uh, don't tell me how, don't, how about this. Is it dead? It's not great, but it's totally fixable. If he'd use the glitter polish, I don't know. But, mm. Can you fix it? Uh, totally. <laughs> Probably. I think so. You can fix it. There we go. What a way to actually have hand on it. <laughs> Just, <sighs> sorry. Do you think you could find Reed for me? Then I can take a look? I cannot have a blank photo in my yearbook. Not again. Yes, yes. Thank you. Okay, we need to get rid in order to... Okay, Reed. Now we to fix our... Where are you? Our midi. I'm very sure he's on the roof. I'm gonna go upstairs. Roof. I mean, last time we were on the roof, and he said he, it was his favorite place. Yes, I always know details. If you see that little tiny thing in the corner, you didn't saw it, but I do saw it. Of course. <laughs> Best spot in school, right? Okay, I need a favor. It's really great up here. Picture time, friend. I need a favor. Yeah, it's great. Listen, there's something I need you to do for me. I, I mean, for the band. But you're not gonna like it. Sounds awesome. Tell me more. You have to go get your senior picture taken. Nope. Come on. Why not? It's a family tradition. Orson didn't do it. My mom didn't do it. Her mom didn't do it. I'm just carrying on a long line of being blank spaces in yearbooks. Admirable. Totally makes sense. 100% normal. But what if I told you that if you do the picture, Naomi will fix my MIDI controller and save our audition, and then we can win and play Caldera Fest and have amazing lives? Naomi. Oh, shit. I think we did talk about this. It was her one condition. Oh, uh, yeah. And she doesn't budge. Believe me. I have to think through everything when I'm writing a campaign for her. Okay, yeah, she's a lot. So, you do it? You do it? Okay, so is that a yes? You know, I just wrote in a new storyline for your L&L character. Wait, what do you mean storyline? I thought I just showed up and rolled dice until something died. <laughs> no. You've got a whole character arc now. And you'll have to play through it every session. Are you holding my MIDI controller hostage? Pretty much. You do want it fixed, right? Yes. I'll do it. I was gonna anyway, I think. Just please get a picture. Yeah, I already promised. Uh, I would. should have worn a different tank top. I mean, I played D&D before, so I'm not a stranger of that. Oh, this? 
I'm saving the band with my sacrifice. <laughs> I am a hero. Your sacrifice will be remembered, Reed. Don't worry. <laughs> You're the best. Right this way, sir. Go get him, Slugger. Does my hair look stupid? Stop like going. always! I feel weird. Are you guys hot? It's hot in here, right? <laughs> You're doing great. <laughs> Oh, he's gonna run away. <laughs> yes! Oh, that's 100% photo completion. After your pick, of course. Okay. Now it's Trish time. Make it memorable, Trish. <laughs> okay. Thanks again. I fulfilled my end of the bracket. I fulfilled my, my end of the bracket. <laughs> I never said it'd be a good picture. But you'll fix my controller now? Yep. I, I mean, I'll try. Meet me after school today. You can't do it, like, now, maybe? We have our last practice after school, and tomorrow is the audition. I have to get these proofs to the office and pay the photographer, then Miss Roberts needs me to assist with a freshman demo, and then there's language lab. Okay, yeah. After school. Thanks. No! <gasps> Uh, okay, yeah. When I said make it memorable, I didn't thought you were doing this. And of course, Naomi is losing the shit. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't sure I was gonna pull that off. Oh, no, 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 no. The backdrops, we, we can't retake it. Oh my god, what is this stuff? And, and, oh my god. Yeah. That smell. It's her mask. It's very distinct. <laughs> Police! What's wrong? Did you not just witness my truly triumphant moment? No, no, sorry. Reed really saved us, and hopefully Naomi will save us. But now we don't get one last practice before tomorrow. Wait, is that all? No biggie! We got this. We've practiced like a million times. I mean, I can use the time on L and L, so... Win-win! Oh no! <laughs> Are you sure God doesn't want that to be killed? <laughs> Later, Wormies. <laughs> because that sounds like it. Okay, give me a moment. Do I have anything new? No. Oh, hey. Was I supposed to give you a ride or something? I'm actually here to see Naomi. Really? Uh, yeah. <laughs> we can work over here. Why does your MIDI controller smell like chemicals? It's just nail polish. And solder and a chemical solvent. We should probably open a window, actually. Okay, yeah, I'm out of here. Thanks for stinking up the place. You're welcome. I love stuff like this. Seeing how things are put together on the inside. Like an autopsy. Wait, does that mean it's dead? No, no, just sorry. This means a lot to you, I know. Okay, it's kind of everything. Is that weird? I guess. It's kind of everything. No, sorry. Not not to pressure you. No, I need to get used to it if I'm going to be a doctor, right? Probably, yeah. But seriously, I think the patient is going to make it. So, uh... Why music? Um, what do you mean? Like, what got you into it? <laughs> oh my god, I, I never even really thought about it, you know? It, it always just felt like the right thing. I guess I made up little songs when I was a kid for Nasser and stuff. Our parents were always working a lot, so we kind of had to entertain ourselves. Like, I know I'm supposed to talk about how songs helped me find myself or understand the world or something, but... They don't? No, no, I mean, they do. Especially right now, but it's also that I feel different when I'm playing. My whole body feels lighter. Okay, what am I talking about? That sounds really weird. I can't believe I said that to you. I can't believe that I said that to you, Naomi. <laughs> anyway, you're, you're just trying to get me to talk so I don't feel nervous, right? Yes. But 
I also understand what you're talking about. Okay, to go, to go, for a ticket. Okay, now Mary really knows her stuff. Yeah, I I gotta point something. Uh, unfortunately, this is a really fun fact, but someone pointed that the head of Naomi literally looks like a hand back human. I just <laughs> I can't just look at that and think about. <laughs> I know I'm being cruel. Oh my god, no. I, th I know I'm being cruel, but oh no, I cannot say it. I cannot unsee it anymore. I cannot unsee it. Oh man, better, 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 I can't look it, uh, in, in front and not as, not outside. I'm sorry. I, I know I'm being cruel, but. It's called the flow. And that's the thing. People feel it from <laughs> all sorts of things exercise, painting, math, even. I feel it when I'm doing things like this putting things together or back together it's like you're doing exactly what you were meant to do yeah that's it all fixed oh naomi you're a genius i owe you like a million favors well since you're gonna be in the battle of the bands um maybe a vip ticket wow uh, i mean yeah, sure. If we get in, I will totally do that for you. If? Wait, I thought... Uh, so tomorrow is kind of just an audition to get into the battle, but I've been working really hard. A and now this works! I was happy to help. And it was nice, you know, to chat. Yeah. Well, I'll just, um... See you at the Battle of the Bands. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, why she wanted VIP? VIP <laughs> things. That's kind of interesting. Uh, we are not. Uh, we are not what's happening here. It's nothing from other one. The audition, the band, the meteor. Uh, the audition. I can't believe we missed practice because of the controller. What if that was what would have put us over the edge? Yes. Okay. I know you are kind of having. Okay, five hours six. You get my message last night? Yes. Who is it? Not, do not respond! <laughs> I don't, want, I don't want to say. I'm sorry, I didn't think it will really go through. So, you didn't mean it? It was nice message. Seriously, who are you? Uh, seriously, who are you? You really won't tell me who, are, who you are. Not even a hint? I still kind of freaking out to be talking to you like this, to be honest. I guess we both keep talking then. Okay, smiley mode. I like that. No! Ah. Again, guys, if you have someone that is going anon, do not respond it. I know. Trust me, I have a lot, a lot of trolls that happens to me. Do not respond. Just block them. I, even after this day, I'm having fucking spam telephone calls. And I'm very sure they are from companies and all stuff. But trust me, do, do not... Do not do that. Do not respond. Do not get the call that you don't know. Just ignore it. Walk away. And none of that happened. Trust me. I know the I know the I know this this kind of stuff. Hey, everything okay? Uh yeah. But we have a gig tomorrow, kinda, right? Yes. So we gotta do the thing. Oh my god! I forgot! With the controller, and I had to get Naomi to fix it and everything. I got you. Oh, wait. What is Swept it from my dad's desk. <clears throat> Hope it wasn't important. What is that? With this sacrifice, we decree worm, worm drama. drama. No, no harma. Here, Here we spend, we spend all, all our, our good, good karma. karma. Worms till the end. Worm, worm drama forever. Wow, we were kind of weird kids, huh? Totally. <laughs> Plasma, okay, flashback on luck. So this is kind of a ritual from every single band. Uh, is, I'm not sure. i never been in a band. So is that a thing for every single band? I mean, I remember when I watched I'm in the band, 
really, really good series, by the way, unfortunately it's not in Disney Plus, which is stupid, because it's a really good series. I see I see that the, the, um, the Iron Whistle had, had themselves dressed as fucking furries. And then they, and then they just um, make make that wind, wind blow, and they turn turn on the the fucking fan. They make the rain the rain fall, and they just they just splash uh, the water everywhere. <laughs> so it is it is that a ritual? Is that literally something that fans do? I'm not sure. I I really want want to know that. I really I literally want to know if that is a bad thing. So. If you guys know that, please let me know. Okay, starting world drama. That's this is a flashback. Hmm. Hey. Oh God. What? That's a worm. Why? <laughs> I found it on my locker of all places. Isn't kind of cute. Okay, so that this is why Fang never never like worms. <laughs> sure. I wonder what, what it's like to be a worm. Maybe it's nice. No misery, no unrequited love, just warm stuff. Hey, you don't know that. Little mud, mud hub see, here seems like a real heartbreaker. Do you? Do they even have hearts? They have our arches. Five of them, so technically they have more broken hearts than us. That's a lot of warm drama. We should start a band. <laughs> Just for that? Okay, I get it. I get it, guys. Okay, with that, I gotta go. I'm supposed to be home with the kids right now, but you know we had to do this. You're the best. Back at ya. Okay, so we are going to Reed's house now to play some D&D. &D. Okay, no. No, I don't like that. That looks neat, if you ask me. Not a fan of that one. And that's a classic. <laughs> Look at our phone, trying to eat something. Uh, try to eat something. <clears throat> Still no ETA for mom and dad? Nope. Did you go shopping? I did. I heroically accepted the groceries our parents had delivered from afar. Hey, wish me luck. With audition or those questionable food choices? Both. <laughs> Both. Yeah, we are, we are, we are talking about that. <laughs> That's a, okay, we, we have the audition right now. Okay, he seems relaxed. I can't believe Trish is late. Hmm, he seems relaxed. We wanna wait on Trish. We're gonna, How we're gonna are you always so chill? Push it about, about Master here. never reveals his secrets. Hmm, Master. Okay. It's all a matter of perspective. Is that code for don't give a shit about anything? It's code for give just the right amount of shits. Hmm. Okay, Trish. Where? Hey, where are you? At the door. Where are you? Are you on the way? My worms! What are you doing out here? Whoa. Where were you? Inside, waiting to nail this audition. Really? I got here early to help Rosa close up so she can watch us play. And check it out. Free lattes. Seriously? Coffee. You want, you want me with the coffee. <laughs> you want me with the coffee. Really? Ah, <laughs> caffeine. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I, am. I like coffee. I really enjoy coffee. I already said that. This is weird. Or like terrifying. Don't worry, this is normal, I guess. I think. I hope. No pressure, everybody. Hello, competitors. Tonight, you are auditioning for a spot in my annual Battle of the Bands. 
Why a battle, LJ? It seems kind of harsh. Can't we all just play our music and support each other? Ha! The best thing I can do to support musicians that I believe in is to challenge them, toughen them up, and push them to make their best music. And that's what I'm here to do for you. Make sure you're ready. Agents, tours, the whole shebang. Like the Spines, ever heard of them? I love them. Or how about Tina and the Tyrannosaurs? Know their multiple number one singles? They rule. God, is this? Or how about Swamp Babies, the band everyone thinks will win this year? But then young upstarts Worm Drama are here to throw them off and maybe this is their year. Ah, that's us! Woo! My point is that you are all here because you show promise and I need to see which of you can actually fulfill that promise and earn a spot at Caldera Fest where you will perform for thousands of members of the paying public. Now, let's get to it. After all, I hear a huge rock is coming from outer space to kill us all anyway. Yeah. So, certainly sounds like showtime to me. <laughs> First band! Of course. Well, we better, we better get this done before that happens. I like this lady. This lady gets it. <laughs> so, that's not the same song you played last month? Oh, no. Uh, uh, so we changed the hook. Um, so before it was like, hey. And now, now it's like, hey, you see how it went up there? It went up at the end. I wasn't really asking. If I can't tell, that's all you need to know. Next! Oh my god. Am I in hell? Maybe. Mm. Come on, let's go. Um, hi, we are Worm Drama, and this is us. Okay, this is us. Rock band time! Yeah, rock band time. If they start running somebody in, it's rock band time. <laughs> Go up! You know that rail? Get rid of that zoom. That zoom literally destroys the immersion. At least for me. Yeah, that flea is very, I'm very sure that flea in Fang's side has a really more interesting story than this. <laughs> I think I missed it. this game song because it's fucking it's fucking cool this the game is cool. not bad the song is cool. got you a bit huh wait that sounds bad did we suck nah not even close did good couple of rough patches here and there but you probably already knew that 
You're only as good as your weakest link. Uh, we just need more time. Thank you. Thanks. Um, we did what you said with the new songs, and, and we worked really hard. I can tell. But you thought it was okay? Stop worrying so much about whether other people like it or not. All that does is rattle your nerves and make you play like crap. You have something special. Run with it. See you at the show, kids. We're in? Nice! We're in! We're in! <laughs> yeah! Okay, okay, get off my stage now. Next! We did it! Hey, Rosa! We did it! Yay! I can't believe we did it! I, I I feel like I'm dreaming. Am I dreaming? I feel like I had an out-of-body experience. I bailed hard a couple times. Do you think LJ noticed? Uh, definitely she just trying to help us. Yeah, I definitely she noticed. <laughs> yeah, she said you need to tighten up a bit. Oh, I feel awful. <laughs> it's It's fine. She was just trying to help. <laughs> Selfie? Nice! Ah, look at that! <laughs> Audition! We fight, we get it! Okay, let's see. Who's. What is this? Ah, okay. We're doing the. We're doing the posters now. Okay, basic. Who's. Hand drawn. P9, Scotch, Feathers, Warm. I think Gotch would be nice. It's us, Warm Funeral, Cool Wizard, Cool Ass Warm, Real Ass Warm. Uh, I don't. I don't like the, the fact that it's a worm, so. I think Wizard is. Cool Wizard will be. Okay, Permanent Maker. Basic Battle of the Bands Java Lava Java Fortnite Permanent Maker Unrated Comic Sans Lucky Wing Dix Never Never use Windix Never use Windix <laughs> Otherwise nobody is uh, uh, only a very few knows how to speak in Windix But never use that one that one not all of them can actually know that, and I can I can totally tell. I am the one that actually knows how to interpret this one, but not all I can, not all can. Okay, but of the band. This one, this one looks looks better. Handwriting. That. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, actually, yeah, I'm not. Yeah, I'm I'm not gonna be able to actually change colors or anything. I don't think so. You better remember us when you're famous. Okay, I won't change. I just want to play music. I won't change. <laughs> don't worry. I don't think I'm going to change all that much. And we still have so much work to do. Like, we have to put up all these posters so people will actually show up and cheer for us. Do you think all this get it energy is tied to the meteor? The power of stardust. What do you mean? Sometimes all you need is a push. Like today I drew the Eight of Wands. This is a higher power saying like, move it girl! I was about to pass your ass, let's go! I feel the same thing, that's a lot of pressure. Yeah, I feel the same thing. <laughs> yeah, I know what you mean. I, I feel like I'm finally on my way to something. I really believe that the cards just help us get clarity. It's not about the future so much as tuning into where you are right now and what energy you can work with, and what energy you can send right to the trash. See ya, no thanks. You wanna draw one? Uh, yeah, um, why not? Okay, yeah, I it's guess. an option. Why not? Right? Think of a question. One of these three cards holds the answer. Or something like that. Okay, I always go to the middle. So let's get the middle. Once. Uh-oh. Well... 
No, I'm sure it's fine. Any immediate feelings? Uh, oh, maybe it's not as bad as it sounds? Maybe it's not as bad as it sounds. Um, how screwed am I? <laughs> oh, babe, don't worry about it. Um, you, you didn't answer the question. Mm, sorry to butt in, but we gotta run. School and all. <sighs> right. Listen, find me later if you want. I can explain it a bit. Catch you later, shooting rock star. That card and all that stuff about the asteroid. Mm, I make my own destiny, right? Yeah, I made my own destiny. If there are signs from the universe, a giant rock from space is a pretty shitty one. I, I can't let that be it. Mm hmm. <sighs> Snap out of it, dork. If you're gonna face a really dark future, just face it with all the positive you got. <laughs> it's close to the deadline for college applications, so if you've been procrastinating, consider your final snooze button pressed. Now, Naomi has generously offered to help anyone who may be struggling. I can help with essays or proofreading. Whatever you need. Any questions? Yeah, so, uh, why are we even doing this? Well, you might not care that many of your classmates are looking to their future. Sorry, really, but what future? I hate to break it to you, but this seems like a waste of time. I mean, the future we're looking at's got a big rock blasting through it. No, the future is what we make it. I've worked really hard to get the life I want, and I'm not going to let a big jerk rock ruin that. Mm, Riz right, Naomi's right. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to go with Naomi's, with Naomi. Yeah, Naomi's right. She's right. All the more reason to go for what I know I want right now. Yeah, nothing is set in stone. Or whatever. You know what I mean. I guess I just don't see how anybody could ignore this. Well, since you insist on the subject, presently, we are within the early detection period. As time goes on, it may appear that the probability of a collision increases. However, this is to be expected as more precision shrinks the field of probability. Ultimately, we can expect the probability of impact to go down over time. Statistically speaking, if it did impact the planet, it would most likely be on a sparsely populated area or the ocean. There will always be a reason to avoid difficult tasks. I advise you to desensitize yourself to it, or you'll never leave this classroom. Whatever. Primarily how you intend to excel under these unprecedented circumstances. Take your phone. Perhaps the subject is not entirely irrelevant. It would stand you in good stead to reference the current events in your application letters. Send me a paper note. Tell me what it is. Hmm. Okay. LNL. Hey gang, it's Fang. Sorry. Also, their charter name is Faye. Welcome, Faye. So glad you're joining. Guys, we are in a class right now, but yay, Fang, Fei, dude, finally, you should dump all our stars into charisma. Do not dump all our stars into charisma, coward. What's your weapon for? Possibly though, mine is a bat, like a baseball bat, not the animal. Although that will be great. Read, I need a bat sight. <laughs> I mean, I mean, if you're a druid, I think... Oh, no, wait, not a druid, uh... I'm not sure, I'm playing Baldur's Gate, and right now... And I, I, you guys already know by the previous Sunday stream that I choose to be a witch. So... Or a wizard, I'm not sure how to put it. Wizard, witch is it's kind of the same. So, and the thing is that I can actually uh, call, call for... For a creature on my sides, and I'm not sure if a bat is one of them. No, actually no, it's, it's a crow. But yeah, if you're a witch, I think you can actually have like a familiar or something. Just saying. So, like I said, 
your Megazostrodon did not eat your homework. The asteroid does not excuse you from planning your future. What's going on, Naomi? I'm gonna hit the vending machines. See you practice, Dark Mage. Don't worry about LNL. Reed is a really great DM, and and you're a natural performer. Um, I'm sure you'll be great. Uh, I'm not worried. Thanks, Naomi. Uh, thanks. I appreciate that. Really looking forward to it. Ha! Yep. Yeah, and me too. Well, this is... Um... I gotta, <laughs> I gotta go. <laughs> That's something pulling up over there. You cannot fool me. <laughs> Nasser. Hey, Sib. Why are we going around that you pop the band's posters? Gossip, right? Anyway, did you? That's the question? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, sick, right? You gonna be there? I think he was. She was not gonna do. Yeah, I never thought I'd see LJ look at us like... Like she didn't want to squish us out of existence? Seriously, dude. Amazing. Who put up the poster outside? Yo. Nice. God, I can't wait to destroy swamp babies. <laughs> Who's feeling smug in their leather pants now? More like... Bog... Olds. Nice one, Reed. <laughs> Ah, uh, nice one, Reed. I gotta be positive. I, uh, I prefer to be positive. Mm, no. I'll workshop it. Please. I want to see baby tears. I mean, not like that. Like the band crying. Okay, flashback. Really has a crush. Lucky. Okay, show me the big goth. This is why I don't tell you things. First of all, you do uh you tell me things. Second of all. Show me a pic. Absolutely not, and it's nothing anyway. Hello, fellow dramaturgs. Uh, what? Ah, uh, what? Uh, Nick says you're cute. You are, with a winky face to a person. It was you are like you are. Okay, come on now. Let me see. Let's see. Reed, have you, like, ever flirted before? I have you know I am very well liked. Alvin, wait, wait, screw up, screw up! <laughs> so that's a person that, that Reed is into it. Okay, I can take it. <laughs> I take it. This is like Reed's fan fiction. <laughs> <laughs> and I really enjoy the fact that Reed is over there, like, I mean, why am I here? <laughs> this, this is even better than my Reed fan fiction. Please kill me. <laughs> okay, that, you know what, if I had a friend like Reed, I'd totally do the same. <laughs> we'll workshop it. So how does this battle thing work anyway? LJ just good, picks whoever she likes most? Because she personally texts you, so... Um, kind of, but it, it's not just that, or even who has the best songs. It's also who the audience liked the most. And not just liked, but who they connected with, you know? Yeah. And whoever LJ can get people to come see. Yeah, that's why the posters are so important. If we don't have anyone there for us, we're not going to have an audience to connect with. Okay, no problem. We could win this thing right now. Not... Really? I mean, we hate swamp babies. Wetland grannies. But everyone else pretty much loves them. So we need three killer new songs. Like what LJ was asking for originally. I, I have some ideas. Wait, we're not just doing the songs we just did that, you know, won? Uh, we can't. Come on, Trish. I wish we could. Yeah, I wish we could, but no. 
We need new stuff. I mean, that'd definitely be easier, but she said new songs. We got lucky just reworking the old stuff for the audition. Plus, we have a big chance now. We've got to use it to let people see the real worm drama. You mean us? Yeah. Yeah, but like the us we're gonna that do when we're out on tour, you know? That is so weird. Not just high school kids. Shit. So, <laughs> did okay. you put up Fire the posters? Because <laughs> I can print more. I only took that one to school. Figured we'd have it covered. But I gave the rest to Orson to put up on his delivery route. Smart. And now it's three shots. Oh. <laughs> oh, I forgot to take him out of my bag. Dude, I'm so oh. sorry. Oh, so, just put them up now. So, they are thoroughly slimed. Okay, slimed? Come on, Trish. I, I, I work so hard on those. Slimed? Slimed? Okay, so I brought Mango to school again because I think she might have separation anxiety. My dad told me she makes like a whimpering sound when I'm gone and that made my heart explode. Anyway, she just sleeps in here all day anyway, so no one even knows. But she kind of sometimes sleep slimes. Like most of the time. Like all the time. Cool. That's very gross. So, I was gonna put the posters in my locker. Mango? Wait. Mango? She's not here! Oh my god, she got out! Oh, uh oh. Okay, okay, um... When did you last see her, feel her in there? I don't know. Lunch, I guess? That was over an hour ago. She could be anywhere. I have to find her. It's okay. We're gonna help you look. But... Right, Fang? Totally. Practice canceled. Let's find a worm. Okay. First, we need to triangulate and we need bait. Here are some moss biscuits that Rosa made for her. Mango loves them. Mm, it'll be okay. I gotta find Mango so we can present. Uh, it'll be okay. We're gonna find her. It's gonna be okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I <laughs> Worm hunt commence. I asked it before, and I'm gonna ask it again. Okay, Are you sure God doesn't want to be thing, killed? Where would I go? <laughs> Do I smell slime? Check outside. Of course I've seen a mango. Seen all kinds of fruits, man. Oh, a worm? I didn't know mango worms were a thing. I'll keep an eye out next time I'm in the grocery store, though. I'm not sure if you are okay or... Just... Got a few stuff in your body, you know. But if you have, good for you. We 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 have been in there in high school, so don't worry. Keep up, keep up your stuff. Looking at the stars. Check it, check it out. <laughs> See you there. Have I seen a worm? Have I seen a worm? Did you see my shirt? It went down the hall. I have to go change. Okay. Wait. You're in the trash, aren't you? You're gonna make me dig through trash. Okay, okay. Whew. Here we go. Okay, yeah, he's, he's in the trash. There, there, he, he, she, she, I'm not sure what the fuck gender is the worm is. Trish, I found it! Oh my god, I can't believe you found her! My baby! I owe you like 10 Rex Burritos, that's the bounty. I settled for the killer show with a certain popular like guitars. Well, worm chase. Okay, photo unlocked. Can I watch the photo? I don't get it, but what makes her happy? Okay. There we go. 
I got, I'm gonna ask her, are you sure God doesn't want that to be killed? <laughs> Five of ones, I'm not sure what the fuck that is. And I give a shit. So your posters are on the school. Congrats on the gig. Are you excited? Um, more like neighbors, I think. Mm, yeah. Yes. Cannot wait. Everybody things are kinda slow with the band right now. Wait, are you coming to the slow? To the show? Maybe. But what's going on with the band? That's what I'm trying to figure out, to be honest. Trish doesn't seem excited about the Battle of the Bands as I thought she would be. Even though it was we've been dreaming about since we were 13. And she doesn't have time to learn the new song. But I can seem to write them anyway, so... Pretty stuck right now. Advice? Sorry for the feeling stump. Uh, sorry for the feeling stump. I'm not sure about the advice. Okay, you know what? Yeah, advice? Because I'm sure sh Frank already talked with this fucker. Okay, you seem to know stuff. Any ideas? What the hell is uh, you can't beat what's inside of you? Look to, fe to feature in the face and your courage will spread like life. Hearts. Are you uh, like a uh, motivational speaker? Huh, no. It's from a show. Pretty ones? The cartoon? Oh my god, I love that when I was younger. I still love it. Such a nerd. But it's really sweet. The messages are so cheesy. Uh, come on, the text it <laughs> doesn't allow me to, to read it. Okay, totally. I need more of that. It's cool. Uh, I think it's cool. It's cool. But they always... But I think that's cool. Well, I bet your song is way better than you think. I really want to hear it. Pretty ones. Huh. Okay. We s we won't sit around and we let the world go by. And, the and when the fire falls from the high. Okay, we won't sit around and we'll go. We won't back down fear in our eyes. We're gonna take a breath, hold on hair up high. We're gonna take a breath, hold our hair up high. And then the fires flow on high. And then the end times crystallize and the and the love we have internalized. Uh, and then the end, I think it will be nice. It will, this one sounds like. And when the end of times crystallize. Mm, yeah, yeah, I think, I think, I think I'm gonna go with this choice. But. Huh. Who are you? You totally just help me. Write some lyrics. Uh, okay, you totally help me. You're the best. Who are you? Who are you? Since you're my new muse, now can you tell me who you are? Soon. I think. Maybe I'll come to the show. And I'm really glad I started talking to you. Me too. Heart. Okay, I'm sure this thing... Hey. Hi. Hello. Genuine. Look what I found. Oh, hey. They turned out pretty good, huh? Almost makes me wish mom and dad were back to see me actually succeeding at music. Imagine that. You're not getting it. Probably because you completely ignored my texts today, but... It took me forever to pull them all down. What the fuck? Why? That took me forever. Ah, uh, why? Why would you do that? I had to. Lava Java serves beer after five. You can't advertise that in a school, Fang. What? That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. Who even cares? The principal? The school board? The school could get a huge fine. And I'm the student representative. 
Class president takes the blame. You're such a narc power trip much. There is a yeah, we're in trip much. Ah, uh, you're actually here, I think. I got I tried to Come take on. the lower. I don't believe that. Blow up. No one cares that much. Except me, the real person in front of you. I didn't make the rule, but I'm responsible for it. That's why I sent you like 10 texts that I'm sure are still unread. I could have helped you put stickers over the venue name or something. Everyone knows where it is anyway. Can't I have one thing, Nasser? Why do you have to ruin this for me? That's what you think I'm trying to do? You're the one who locked yourself into mom and dad's little plan for you. I Sorry I'm not doing presentations on like admissions essays or whatever. You guys can't stand to see me do what I want if it isn't go to college, get a job, work. I'm into music, so I'm doing that. It's not that complicated. You can do whatever and be happy. Yeah, guess I wasn't chosen for greatness. That's not what I meant. Oh yeah? You don't get it, do you? I don't have it easy, Fang. I don't actually just do whatever. I don't have that kind of freedom. And I do? I am sick of everyone treating me like some spoiled brat. Like I don't bust my ass. If I was studying every night to be a doctor or something, You'd be Naomi. Right. And everyone would love me for it. I mean, at least they'd assume I was doing something valuable. And no one would think I had all this freedom. They'd just think I knew what I wanted and how to get it. Is that how Trish feels too? Feels like I haven't seen her around as much lately. What are you getting at? Okay, Trish is being weird to be honest. The money is fine. Uh, yeah, Trish is being honest. I think Trish is... Being weird, but I, but I think because it's because of the end of the war. Honestly, I don't know what's up with her. Yeah, maybe this isn't the sure thing you want it to be. What's the worst that could happen if you have a backup? Not starve? Make mom and dad a little bit happy? Because otherwise, what? You live here forever? You and me both, right? Or do you have big dreams? I'm still figuring that out. What's your plan B? What's your plan A, now that you mention it? I don't know. Ha! Hey, no, 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 not blow his own. It's an acceptable answer. An acceptable answer. Sorry, that, that sounds like a zero plan to me. You've got to have something in mind, and I'm not leaving until I hear it. I'm not even graduating this year. Really? Nothing? I'm working on it. I... I still have time. Oh, come on. All you have to say is doctor or lawyer. I'll text it to mom and dad right now. I'm not just going to say something to make you happy. <laughs> Imagine that. Why are you even doing all these activities then? Okay, just to be the popular one, just to follow the rules, just to go be alone, just to be alone. Just so you wouldn't have to sit alone in your room? I think I had that spite. <laughs> you shouldn't let mom and dad pressure you so much. Just do what you want. Yeah. Okay. I get it. Okay. So if you're right, I know. I know. Now I try to be less mini, okay? I promise it's not as scary as it seems. Man, I know, I, these choices really are really fast for me. Okay, I'm gonna pause it over here, I'm gonna go to the bathroom, gonna refill my water, and then we are gonna come back play more, okay? Well, be right back!
All right, guys, I'm back. And again, I had to literally go to, to, to have a little bathroom break. So, yeah, it's, it's been like two hours since I was holding up. Trust me, when you work like in trains, you literally have to hold up more than four hours. <laughs> so, trust me, I, it's, not, it's not healthy. I'm not going to tell you. It's not healthy, but I, am, I have been training it for this. I held my train my whole life for this. Okay, anyway, let's go back to the story. Ha 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 ha! my dark mage. How fare you this fine eve? Uh, fine, let's do it. I'm fine, I guess? I am... Ye, ye old fine. Welcome, Faye. Hey, uh, give me a moment. I gotta pause it. Uh, Sam, mm, my, I, I, I gotta, I gotta call you Sam. Okay, Sam, my, I, yeah, Sam, my. Let's let's put it like that. Welcome to the stream. I am Lord of the Skellies, and I am a demon that comes from space in order to conquer the world by playing games. Don't question my logic, please. And thank you for the follow. I really appreciate that. So if you're having a really good day. I'm really glad, and if you're done, I'm gonna try to actually make it uh, even more, much better. So, anyway, thank you for the follow. Always room for more magic. Yeah, <laughs> totally. Okay, out of character, I'm really glad you're here. I made some last minute changes to the story. I think it's gonna help get Trish on track for the concert. Wait, so you do see that she's being kind of weird? I mean, Trish isn't really doing anything on purpose. She's just got a lot of stuff going on. Chef Jeff is served with her yeah. nerves. Also because of the meteor. Please do not get on the table again. <laughs> Wonderful. Sage. Oh, I love these ones with the creamy stuff. Oh, we got here just in time. Fresh snacks. Look, I'm not going to spoil the story, but just hmm. we're all in this together. You know, that's what the game's all about. But I'm glad you're, you're okay, so Sam. Maybe it'll make the whole band thing feel more... You Stay know? like that, for me. Yeah. Or for your. I hope so. Or for yourself. I I I don't I don't tell you what you what you have to do. But yeah, stay stay a, a good day. You have a good day. Previously on Legends and Lore, our party tracked Kef's cultists, hell bent on ushering in a cataclysm of apocalyptic proportions, to a confrontation that left the Dark Mage Fey unconscious. Hmm. Kef has escaped, intent on summoning Braxis, an ancient god of death and destruction to this world. But Faye is stirring, and their amnesia is subsiding. The Elder Celeste leans in close to Faye, on the deck of the Vagrant. Okay, we have to actually read this one. <laughs> okay. Ah, uh, Celeste, that was a nasty spell you took. Hold your head! Okay, wait. Nah, not that great, but I think I'm starting to remember some stuff? Go with it. I mean, in the meantime, let me reintroduce the crew. This is Sid, the captain. I'm Sid, the captain of our fair ship, the background. It's just me or Celeste and Sid looks like Reed. Well, he's a, the game master, so... Of course, he, he, they're gonna look like Reed. Hi, I'm Polly, the troublemaker. I like getting into trouble. Really, Trish? <laughs> you cannot be, like, more creative. <laughs> I'm just Jeff. I like punching and seasoning. And, of course, you're having a avatar that is obviously <laughs> a chef. Pretty cute, by the way. I really like that. <laughs> I am Maya, divine mage. I like plants and stuff, so you're uh, the druid. Okay. I am Winetta, the Angelix. Honor and sacrifice. I also like knowledge. That's Naomi. Ah, she looks really good with that. <laughs> so technically, F Fang is the only one that looks... Fang's character is the only one that actually looks badass. <laughs> I love this. Okay. Tell us about yourself, eh? Oh. Um. I, I didn't know I had to prepare anything. That's okay. Perfectly fine. The Lore Maestro's Guide says it's totally fine to not have a huge backstory already. Maybe we could get some suggestions from the table. 
Oh, oh, you're the long-lost heiress to a distant kingdom, banished as a child after an unjust coup. Maybe you were an astute student until your aspirations turned unorthodox and you began studying the scythe. Or you were a traveling musician who signed away your soul for incredible talent with the guitar. Maybe that's how you lost your memories or something. Okay, uh, Seisha Dia, the IRS, Nami Saidia, the student, Trisha Dia, the musician. Now, I'm not gonna be the bard! I'm going to know more. I don't know with I don't wanna be at the bard in this story. <laughs> I know! I know how bards in DMD behave! I don't wanna be the bard! <laughs> Trust me, I had enough experience about that. And again, last time I played Baldur's Gate, we have partial doing that stuff. <laughs> so, no. I'm not, I'm not going into a bard. Okay, I'm a brilliant student of the side. Spooky and cool. So happy to finally meet you, Bay. Come here. We have much to talk about. Like cat? Maya. Okay, it's okay to dream. Maya has a crush on the enemy. It's not a crush. I think he's handsome and charismatic. Sounds like a crush to me. Anyway, we interviewed a cultist last session and found out about the ritual they will be performing in the Crystal Caves. Interrogated. So, fantasy torture, <laughs> fantasy torture for me. <laughs> Tell me you didn't, you didn't fantasy torture him. They won't remember it. Yeah, searing they will come. Sounds about bored. <laughs> We also learned that there are maybe answers hidden in the ancient library, hidden about the clouds of the Mistwoven Archipelago. Now we must choose between the which we know and that which we have yet to learn. We are about to the cave cultist, and it's the only thing we know for sure. Second death for reasons. No way, I will library. I wanna do some research. I just wanna see in your book is there. You have a book? What is it called? Punching and seasoning. It's truly insp inspirational, I agree with Jeff. There is no greater power than knowledge of your foes. Plus, I think... I don't think it's red herring. Red wouldn't do that to us. No meat gaming. No meta gaming, sorry. What's meta gaming? Don't worry about it. It will seem our party is split. Dark one, what say you? Okay, crystal caves, library. Mm, I go uh, crystal caves. Okay, I chose crystal caves. I rather not double in speculation. Let us attack them in their home base. Yeah! Sweet. <laughs> Sweet? Yeah, totally. Okay! This is how we play D&D &D in this game. <laughs> the cave should be right here, but I don't see them. Maybe we should check behind the waterfall. Oh! What a pickup we found ourselves in. It's definitely behind the waterfall. It could be anywhere. Okay, probably in the waterfall. This one is obvious. Whatever shall we do? Okay, probably the waterfall. Shall we check the waterfall? Fine. It's in the waterfall. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Rain. Okay then. What are you? What are we waiting for? Let's go fight some cultists. Sid parks the airship nearby while you check behind the waterfall. Indeed. There is a cave there. Deeper inside, you come across a door surrounded by shining crystals. Hmm. Are we going to open the door or what? No, we no, we are. It's just I don't trust this. What do you mean? There's probably a trick to it. Or a trap. We're staring uh, at it. Isn't going to get us inside. Let's go. Okay. 
Okay. Ooh. Okay, uh, what? What's that? Ah, oh, it was a. Uh, it's time to kill some demons. Yeah. It's, it was that. Uh, um. Ah. What, call, what it's called? Uh, a pattern? I didn't pay. I didn't take up any, any attention. Damn it. <laughs> okay, I'm very sure this one was the first. Okay. Okay. Okay, I think it was this one, this one, this one. Oh no, I I fucked that up. Okay, I get it now. I get it now. Ba bam, ba bam, ba bam, ba bam, ba bam. There you go. Got it. Ah, emotes in the tones. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, those are emotes. The door now open, you quietly sneak into the antechamber. Inside, the torchlight of the cultists reflects off the sparkling walls as they gyrate around an enormous crystal that's buzzing with magical energy. Ooh. As the cultists begin their dramatic crescendo, a hooded figure emerges from behind the crystal. He lowers his hood, and you see the striking figure of Kev, the lead cultist. Oh my god, it's him! It's him! Even from afar, Kef holds absolute sway over the cult. Kef raises his hand. What said Doctor Sebo does he know? Ah, come on, you guys are going to try to bang her. Of course, that's why I I literally didn't try to be a fucking bard. <laughs> Seducible? Susceptible to seduction. Yeah, could he be seduced by, say, a very beautiful bind mage? Um, he's kind of in the middle of something right now. <laughs> I mean, could we seduce some info out of him? No, Kef raises his hand. How revealing is his robe? <laughs> oh yeah, the scene shows some scale. <laughs> it's a lovely robe <laughs> that shows no more scale than is appropriate. He raises. What the red does? It seems like his chahu has. <laughs> chahu was. He's had some hard times. Okay. He raises his hand in the crystal of lights. There. He bellows. Okay. I need action. <laughs> We are now, uh, hey, this is D&D, so you have to use your imagination, unfortunately. <laughs> Come, children of Praxis, let us begin this ritual for the honor of our butler. What do you all want to do? The sooner we rush, uh, rush in and stop this ritual, the sooner I can comfort Kev, sensitive inner child. No! <laughs> yeah. Totally it is. Okay, we have to focus and play it cool. Let's sit back and see what we can learn. Hey, what does your instinct tell you? Uh, attack, hang back. Mm, let's attack. Let's get in there. I wanna um, get my claws dirty. The heroes charge at the cultists. For chaos. For knowledge. For care. For straight food. For NPCs! <laughs> For NPCs! You already have, my, have me this! <laughs> For NPCs! <laughs> For Celeste and... Uh, Sid! Oh, yeah, Sid. Thank you, Bernard. Sid! <laughs> you never stop me! My destiny cannot be overturned. I am the Armageddon! Kef buckles over, wretches, and then spews out a liquid secretion that begins to form into a disgusting dinosaur. Ow, oh, this just makes me love him even more. <laughs> it, it is kinda cute. Kill it! Kill it right now! <laughs> Kill it right now! I'm going to carm that thing back into his stomach so pretty hard. Ha! Foolish morals! You think you stand a chance against the might of my secretions golems? Destroy them! 
All right, you're entering combat. The golem advances, followed by the cultists. Roll for initiative. All right, uh, roll for initiative. We have a nine. I'm not sure how much that, that is. Whoops, not so great. Okay, okay, let's see. Jeff, you're at the top of the initiative. I cast difficult terrain and cover the ground in a slippery weapon creep. <laughs> Alright. Unfortunately, the golem is already slimy, so he isn't really affected. The cultists, however, will have trouble with that. Hmm. Okay. Alright, in that case, I run up and hit a cultist in the face. Oh, hold on there. It's not your attack anymore. Okay, don't worry, Jeff. I got this. Let's see. Okay, attack the land with psych, attack the land with spell. Uh, with a spell, I guess. Ten. I'm not, I'm not even sure what I, what's the kind of thing I am trying to get. I got stuck darkness on the golem. Again, is that a weak golem? Is that a. Is that a struggle? I don't even know. I just think that is that be, be, that below ten is bad and and more rise than ten is good. I'm just going with that. The golem is enshrouded in black smoke and it slows down a bit, disoriented. All right, I hit this guy. Now it's the golem's turn. It lurches out abruptly and smacks Ollie down to the ground. Ali, you take five acid damage. Ow! What the fuck, man? My cool outfit! I punched the golem from under his stupid slimy body. Oh. Yeah, that's nothing. You're gonna keep taking damage if you don't get out from under there. I cast Razor Leap. That has an area of effect, so it should hit all the enemies, right? Right. Little gooey bits of golem are sliced off, and a few cultists retreat behind some of the sheltering rocks to escape the barrage of sharp leaves. Phoenix, I cast Force of Will on the golem. A brick light glows from inside his body and hurts it with a holy light for 13 damage. Nice. Next, Maya, a cultist, casts a spell of confusion on you. Roll to resist. 16. My brain is too strong for their weak magic. Brilliant. Finally, Jeff. A whipped cream covered cultist grabs your ankles and knocks you to the floor. You are being grappled. Ew! <laughs> I had to get Ollie out of here. Okay, focus all of my energy. Hey, nice! Okay, I roll an 80. I focus all my energy and I ignite the golem with dark fairy fire. Oh, that's extra effective against the golem. It wails and gurgles and melts into a bubbling pool. Again, my outfit. <laughs> You're welcome. There's still a few cultists standing. Maya and Linnea, you both rolled the same initiative. Who wants to go first? I could try to immobilize them with my bias powers. I could grab control them with a calming spell, maybe? Okay, violence with <laughs> violence by vines! The vines sound pretty cool, actually. I stand, my, stand with my feet apart and close my eyes, summoning the power of plants. Okay, give me a roll. Twelve. Vines erupt all over the cave floor and catch a couple of the remaining cultists, but a few manage to squirm out of the way. They look like they're about to attack again. Right, let me give it a shot. I start singing an, an ancient song. It sounds like, like something your mother will have sung to you when you were a baby. The cultists' eyelids grow heavy and their movement slows. Give me a roll to see how well your spell works. Oh, wow! Twenty. The cultists succumb to peaceful sleep. Shoo! They're dreaming happy dreams. The last cultist falls. 
But the crystal gets exceptionally bright and then explodes. Cap lies on the ground. You're too late! Nothing can stop him now! Okay. You soft shell babies! Do you really think you have defeated me? I mean... Foolish children, you are but infants to Braxus. You know nothing of his dark designs. My death will only serve to, to cement your fate. You're too handsome to die, please. I'll be your queen. <laughs> Come on, Rosa. Okay, uh, you can do that, please. Can she do that? Please, can she do that? <laughs> That part of the game? Nah, I'm just making it up. I don't know. Okay, that has taken long enough. A cast area of an authenticity. Ah, ah, yes, the area of authenticity. Kef and everyone standing around him are forced to tell the truth. Oh, do you think my friend is hot? She's attractive in a plenty of way, yes. <laughs> okay, how long does this spell last? Wait, does that mean all of us have to tell the truth? Oh yeah, we are in the spell. Here, I prove it. Hey, out of all of us, who is the coolest? Hmm, I'm gonna say uh, Maya. I think I think Maya is the coolest. <laughs> I guess I have to pick Maya. <laughs> what? Not me? <laughs> you can't beat the plan, Mama, baby. <laughs> Anyways, now tell us about the ritual. Long ago, deep within the rivers of tears, the legendary axe Bra Black Bane was forged. It, it's made of shovel like the thousand suns. Its handle. Hold on, I'm being held on my notes. What's, what was the name of that axe? Black Bane. Bright Bane? No, with an L. Blight. Blight pen. Gotcha. The, its handle glimmered brilliantly. Such a weapon had never existed before, and has never existed since. It was brought to the vile chambers of the Temple of Pain, where it was enshrined besides the other artifacts capable of destroying the gods. The Temple of Pain? No, the Temple of Pain. There it, there it was enshrined for centuries, looking away until it was stolen. Now it sits in a terrible swamp, poisoning the land. Now, do you spell pain with a A and A or an A Y A? It's spelled the normal way. My wounds are too great for this. Praxus, take me! <laughs> now wait, what do you think of my hair? Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, you're in. And thus, <laughs> thus, I die. I know you read for this. <laughs> Thank you. <clears throat> ah. You guys survey the aftermath of the crystal explosion and Kef's remains. You feel a small tremor come from the caves. Okay, so... Is there any loot? Oh yeah, does Kef have any loot? There's no loot. Ah, fuck you. I take a look of his hair. <laughs> Standard operating procedure. That's touching. Uh, sucker! Sucker alert! <laughs> you notice a weirdly shaped crystal sticking out of the dirt. Another tremor. I pull on it! You pull out a crystal guitar. It is gnarly. Ooh. Oh, sweet! I got a guitar! Can't wait to play it! Mm, yeah, blight. Uh, mm, no, no, no. <laughs> That's a different kind of axe. Oh, sorry, I didn't read that one. <laughs> I'm not sure if I, if I said... Okay. Oh, hey! We finally found someone loot. Loot, loot. Get it? 
As soon as you take hold of its handle, another tremor shakes the room. This one is bigger. The ceiling shudders and then cracks, and a giant crystal falls and blocks the entrance. Ah, shit! I... Ah, damn it! That's what happened when <laughs> this kind of part, because... Because when they are not talking, I literally have to tap that button in order to progress. Dang it, I, I missed that one. Okay. I knew we should have to go to the library. I'll be with you soon, Kefi. I guess I could use the guitar thing. Use it, use it, use it! What if it doesn't do anything, though? Okay, Linella, spell time. Trace, guitar up! Ollie, do something with the guitar! Ah, I just gonna start jamming. Amazing! As you shred, the sound of the guitar grows around you. Okay. It resonates against the walls, getting louder and louder, eventually shattering all the crystals! The path is clear. Oh my gosh! Encore! Oh hell yeah, magic guitar! Hey, read, quick question. Do I hear a voice coming from the guitar? A uh, voice? No. Are you sure I don't hear a voice? Are you sure I, it's not a sentient guitar? No, it's just epically cool. Why do you ask? Because I want to seduce it. <laughs> of course, that's a really bad thing. <laughs> ah. You hear the airship droning above you, here to pick you up. Okay. Nice, I got a trophy. Well, it seems you have two choices. We can travel to the ocean sand in search of a long forgotten temple. Or we might be lost forever. But it's also the ancient homeland of my people. Sure. sure. Oh, okay, yeah. Thank you, that. Or you can enter the misty mangroves. Filled with bike creatures driving mad by the swamp. Well, we might find a badass weapon. And that's where we'll end our session tonight. Okay, thank god I didn't want to play TV anymore. <laughs> ah man, the fact that Trish is a bard kills me. So, that was LNL. What do you think, Fang? Mmm, you made it fun. Nurse no, Thompson is cool, actually. <laughs> Nah, you made it fun, Ray. You made it fun. I gotta give you, you credit. Um, I loved it. Isn't he the best? Like, dude, I cannot handle that Celeste voice. It's my favorite. Like, can that be my ringtone? Okay, give me a moment. I see a picture. Okay, he's such a dork. It's cool to see him in his element. <laughs> totally. Pick up the phone, Jeff. I can feel it. Well, time to feed the wormy. That was epic. Super epic. Do you think it worked? Hard to say. Right. Guess we'll see. Well. Uh, I can tell this is important for you. Finally, it's over. I can tell this is important for you. Thanks again. That was really cool. And now I know what you're thinking about between all of your drum solos. <laughs> yeah. Again, we're gonna die eventually for the meteor, so we better be kind for people. Trish, hey, sorry, I bailed you so quick. Rosa drew me so... Anyway, I just wanted to say... Thanks for helping with Mango today. Okay, my laundry smells like slime trash. That's what best friends are for. I mean, that's what best friends are for. I'm always here to help. With best bugs. Right? But I'm just glad she's okay. I know, I'm like about Buck and Stuffern. But it's really exciting to me. Feels like I'm onto something, you know? Something me. Yeah. I know that feeling. But we were still gonna totally win Battle of the Bands. Some babies, psh, 
。Back to the ball with J. Rockets. I'm glad we get on this together still. Uh, duh. And now you're in your adventuring party. I gotta hold on on for the dear life. Rosa is an extremely scary driver. See you around. I mean, probably, most likely, 80%. Ah, cool, 60. J just kidding, just kidding. 100. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You're welcome. <laughs> Mmm, don't scoop on other people's chat, Reed. But I still like you. <laughs> you're, you're, if we you were a real person, I'm very sure you're, you're gonna be one of my friends. You're not one of my friends. Wizard and class. In fact, preparing for the future is one of the most important things you can do. Really? But it sounds so overwhelming. Where do I even start? Well, that's a very good question, Nasser. <laughs> But remember what we just talked about. Oh yeah, all those forms. So next year, when it's time for you to apply to college, Nasser, what form will you start with? The application for financial aid? Right. And why? Because I have expensive taste. Ha! And because then I'll have an idea of which schools are an option for me. <laughs> Great. So let's say you've got that all filled out. Then you'll want to research schools that excel in the area you want to study. Well, I like the sound of cross-continental development, but I also like the sound of political science. What do I do if I can't decide? Have you considered a double major? Think about your free time. What do you do outside of class? Happen. Oh, okay, yeah. How much I want to list on paper? He's just watching. <laughs> oh, well, I guess I'm president of the Student Life Association, and I run the debate club. Great. Anything else? And the Young Leaders League, and I volunteer with Pangea tomorrow. You also write for the newspaper, don't you? Oh, right. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. Totally if this was in real life, I'd totally be. Sleeping. Let's put <laughs> all of these down under extracurriculars. It's a good idea to have at least one, and you're really going above and beyond, Nasser. Do you have any more questions? No, I think you answered them all. What about you guys? Do you feel ready to choose your destiny? Not really. A fucking gigantic rock is gonna kill us all, so. <laughs> Very well done, Nasser Naomi. Class, I encourage you to take advantage of your knowledgeable peers and ask any questions you may have. Yo, which school has the hottest student body, though? <laughs> um, that's not really. A... I'm going to know, Paul. So you do the math. Okay, I have a question. No way, I'm pulling this pain. Nah, nah, I'm not gonna prolong this pain. <laughs> at all. I've completed mock applications for all of the big schools. I have 20 bucks here. Could I buy one of those applications? <gasps> no! Okay, great. <laughs> what do you know about GPAs? I heard you need at least a 3.9 to even have a chance at a lot of places. Oh, well, uh, I can actually answer this one. The baseline is really 3.5, but the higher the better. And you can always boost your chances by showing you're engaged with the subject on your own time. Cool, cool. You went to tendrils, right? Something like that would look amazing on an application. We can talk about it after class if you want. I'd be happy to help. Aw, thanks, Naomi. Hey, 40? I am doubling my price. No, it's... it's not about the money. <laughs> okay. 47, final offer. Um, no. Why not? It's wrong? Uh, plus, you'd get in under false credentials, which would be bad for you. You don't know that. <laughs> okay, this assembly is officially over. Please take some college brochures on your way out. 
Thanks for coming and good luck. Man, if you can actually pay the teachers to actually you there, my get credits. Friend. Actually really nice. Trust me. Right now I'm very sure that's a thing, I don't know. <laughs> At least over here. I'm not sure about you guys. I'm gonna miss you guys so bad next year. Like, we are still gonna have this, right? Like, even if we're not at the same school? Yeah, together wherever, right? Mm, absolutely, who knows? I hope so. Yeah, if we're lucky. I'll have you guys over all the time to try my weird food experiments. I applied to like 300 culinary programs, but I don't know. The more real it gets, the more it's like, Ugh. No, you see, <laughs> nothing's set in stone, dude. It isn't real till it's real. I mean, I guess, but I'm pretty sure cooking is it for me. This feels like make or break. Okay, more like make or break, totally. Uh, totally. I'm gonna say totally. I get it. There are hobbies and like careers, and then there are things that almost consume you. Uh, if anyone's consuming anything here, it's me and all 5,000 of Sage's experimental cookies. No, like, um... If I want to die? Like, when you do it, you get lost in the moment, you know? All that exists is you and what you're doing and what you're making. There's no future to worry about, only the craft. But thinking about making it your life is, is scary. The stakes are... higher. Oh, that's exactly it. I knew you'd get it. Hmm. Anyway, I'm not really worried about which place I go to. It doesn't matter where I do it as long as I get to do it, you know? I just want to be able to do it. I mean, first of all, you're going to be amazing. And you know your girl is always ready to taste test. Okay, but you actually have to tell me if something sucks, though. Uh, babe, I always tell you the truth. It's not my fault you're a literal culinary superstar. Plus, I'll have nothing but time. Yeah? What are you doing next year? I think I'm gonna take a year or two to feel things out. See what vibes. I'm trying not to put anything into a box just yet. That's pretty cool, actually. I don't get why everyone is so obsessed with college. I have literal nightmares about it. Oh, I'm definitely going someday. I just feel like, why not have some fun, too? I can get behind that. Yeah. I'm pretty excited about next year, actually. Not the word I'd use. You don't think mm. about what you'll be doing? Yeah, uh... Oh, definitely. Um... I guess, if I'm around, I'll take a creative writing or game design class, maybe. You'd be so great at either one. Yeah, yeah, you already totally have the writing thing down. Like, you in l and L. I don't know how you do it. Thanks. Yeah. Weird how it kind great of came as a fucking script great. gamer. Great. Game so script. everyone sure what, has what, what it all figured that? out. You must have some ideas. What are you thinking? Uh, I don't know. I've just spent all this time on like bug camp and soft circuits and welding and whatever. And I still don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. That just means you can do anything. Seriously, you're like one of the smartest people. It's true. Okay, you're a scary mart, you're always pussy, you can narrow your focus. You're a scary smart! <laughs> I'm gonna go with this one. There isn't much you can't figure out. Even this. But actually, I mean, what takes up most of your brain space right now? What about... You and Rosa are always talking about your worm, Mango? My baby. <laughs> so why not, like, worm science? Entomology? See? Bugs are kind of your thing. That time we tried to do ASMR, you whispered about molting cycles for like half an hour. <sighs> I don't know, guys. What if I change my mind in a year? What if I suck at it? You don't have to go if you don't want to. Right, you're not going at all. That's even scarier, honestly. Oh, but, but you'll be great. Music is like a sure thing for you. Hmm. It has to be, uh, too much pressure. Too much pressure. Ha, <laughs> well, let's not jinx it, okay? I've never seen a future without worm drama. I mean, if we're lucky, things will take off after Caldera Fest. But, who knows? They will. 
I can feel it. And we're gonna be there to cheer you on. Hm. I hope so. Mm. It's good, everybody has plans, but again, meteor! Hey, Going up by everything! Wait up, wait up. <laughs> hey, what's up? Hey, um, I just wanted to say thanks uh, for earlier. When we were hanging out with everyone and like talking about the future and our plans and stuff, I, I really appreciated what you said. Oh, huh. I mean, it's, it's no big deal. You don't need to thank me for it. I just kind of word vomited all over the place. No, no, it was cool. I, I really needed to hear it. You did? Yeah. It felt good to have someone, like, get it. I mean, love my family. Love my friends. Sometimes it feels like no one takes me seriously. <laughs> I know. I don't make it easy for them. I can't help it, though. I can't deal with people being uncomfortable around me. I have to make them feel at ease. I get that. Anything that makes it easier for them to just deal, right? Right. When I told my family I wanted to transition, they took it hard. They were accepting, but super uncomfortable. Yeah, same. Except I don't even know if accepting is the right word for it. it feels more like playing dumb. All I could think to do about it was make them laugh, even if it was at my own expense. At least I'd be laughing with them, right? But I, I feel like I kind of dug my own grave instead of being, I don't know, hateful about gender stuff. They're dismissive instead. And, and it feels like that carried over to like everything else about me, like, like me wanting to be a chef. <sighs> Everything about me feels like a joke to them. And transitioning is hard enough for them to wrap their heads around, but it doesn't help that I dress like this. It's way easier to be feminine now that it's not expected of me, you know? Now that it's a choice for me instead of an obligation, but to them I'm like, I don't even know, playing dress up like a kid. They laugh and compliment me, but they don't expect anything from me anymore. My parents barely remember to use the right name for me, much less pronouns. Maybe it would be easier if I, like, I don't know, presented more mask. But that's not really what I want. Exactly. And, like, they're cool about the music stuff, but they definitely don't think it's a career for me. They know I'm, I'm good, but they don't, like, see a future in it. I feel like half the time my family just thinks I'm confused and they're waiting for me to settle on something normal or whatever. Oh my god, same. Dude, fuck that. We don't owe them normal. Mm, that is oh, something yeah. that is something that I don't I I think it's kinda overthought. Again, I said it before and I said it again. It depends on which kind of parents you have. If they, uh, you have the parents that literally is trying so hard to make you feel comfortable, like calling you in pronouns, calling you with your new name, that is cool. But you have to know that sometimes they commit mistakes, and those and you have to understand those mistakes. Like it's not gonna go insta transi transition. They had to literally have time in order to accept it, process it. And even so, start start realizing who you are. So that takes a lot of time. So you can you, you can go like vomiting all your head all around because you want to them to actually tell you, I'm this from one day to another. So you have to literally comprehend that they have time to transition. Again, they got, they have you the whole life. So they're gonna have trouble transitioning. It's not gonna be from one day to another. Just have them some time. Have them patience. Have them have your parents a little bit of empathy. If you have that, your your parents are gonna have empathy with your with you as well. Again, I'm not I don't know. I'm just talking by myself. But I think if you go positive, your parents are gonna look you even more positive.
Just saying that. I'm not sure. Again, I don't know about things. It's just what I'm thinking. But yeah, anyway. Enough, enough chit chatting. I don't want to go full like that. So it's just, it's just, it's just what I think it's going to happen. But I, but I always positive. So we don't owe them normal. No, you don't. You can't. You don't own them normal. That's that's something that I can. But you can. You have to understand that it's gonna take a long time for them to normalize this. And if you understand that, that's gonna that's gonna be even more faster. Nope. For them no to way. actually accept you. Nope. Nope. Again, it's just my thought. I'm not... I just say what I thought and that's it. I don't talk for other people. The prank can be nice like that or the prank can be pieces of shit. Again, it depends on and on all of the others' experience. Hey, what are you up to? Turning myself. <laughs> oh no, why? Why are you into that? What? Oh my god. <laughs> just looking at college brochures. Getting overhand. Why? Nothing looks good because future application sucks. Uh, because future? Because it's a ton of uh, pressure. Isn't Battle of Land kind of like a college application? Like if you win and play Caldera Fest and everyone loves you, which is totally gonna happen. You're gonna be all set, right? I never thought of that that way. Thanks, you're kinda great. Number college streets. Uh, you kinda great, I guess. You're pretty cool. Even if I don't know your name, I like you. What about your big future plan? It sounds silly, but maybe fashion? I make a lot of my own clothes. Really? I would love to see some. Could you send me a picture? Nice try. No, I really would. Well, I'm working on something. Hmm. What do you think? I am not a girl. <laughs> okay, I want one so good. I want one. Incredible. I want one. Whoa. Did you ever make this to sell? Like to me? <laughs> Shy face. Thank you. I also thought about what you said. About songwriting. So music is also on the table. That's amazing. I mean, I am be ice. I should have to pronounce that. <laughs> Maybe we could talk about about it sometime, or even work on another song together. A big future plan. In person? Oh, fun. Uh, where would you go? In person? You mean in person? Maybe eventually. More fun that way, right? If you will write a song right now, what will it be about? Hmm. Just anything? Yeah! What's in your mind? Okay. You know that everyone sees colors differently. Blue for me is in the same blue for you. That it's yeah, I know that about optical things, but I'm not sure about that. I have no eyes. <laughs> I heard that one before. What will you mean? I know. I know. Oh my god, yes. I love this fact. It's so weird. I know, it's just because everyone's brain has different memories and everyone's eyes are a bit different on top of that. So sometimes that makes me feel really lonely. Knowing that even when I look at the sky, 
I am only one who sees it like that. I guess I want someone who sees the same world oh. I do. God, that's cheesy. Ow, oh, it's kind of sad. Ow. Oh. That's the way you think. Would it be okay I play around with some music? Of course. Do you sing? Never. Trust me, it's better that way. I bet you're being modest. Nope. I'm never modest. It's my best feature. <laughs> well, maybe someday. If anyone can convince me to do it, you can. Heart. Heart. Stars Heart. Or Shine Heart. I'm not sure how to address that. I should go. Like tomorrow? Absolutely. Chef Bates. Ah, that's good. <laughs> Okay, rock band time! Okay, battle of the band, set list. They're not coming, right? Almost 4 p.m. That's just six minutes. If they are late, it's because when they are more than 20, 20 minutes. Okay, now they're getting late. And check out this cafeteria. There's a taco station and a rap station. Separate station. Yeah, yeah, it looks pretty cool. Look at all these entomology courses. There's an entire class just on spider biology. I looked it up. It has six different textbooks. Uh, mm, why not eight? Feels like a missed opportunity. Dude, I'm gonna be the spider queen. What about you, Fang? Mmm, it's not spider. Nah, definitely not spiders. I don't like spiders. I don't want to be the spider anything. Not even a spider night. I mean, what about your applications? For college? Yeah, I'm not going doing that. Maybe a uh, chance to... Nah, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to be the honest. I'm not applying anywhere. Do your parents know that? Because... The Battle of the Bands is my college application. We get that break and we're set. And at least we know the show is actually going to happen. What does that mean? Uh, not you too. I heard just this morning that even if it does hit, it'll probably land in the ocean. But just think about it. Us, being hit, smack on the nose, out of the huge vastness of the entire galaxy? It's a statistical anomaly. Yeah. Hope you're right. It's just science. Are you worried about that, it? That was double, 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 double voice? I think it was double voice. <laughs> okay, definitely, no, ah, uh, definitely. The end of the world? Yeah, it's on my mind. Come on, why worry about it? Nothing we could do anyway. You two gotta chill about the space rock, okay? We're here to play, right? Uh, actually, we've gotta pick out what we wanna play first. Let's do it. Okay, what are we singing now? 12 o'clock. Hmm, okay, I think your reunion. So we're starting uh, this ones, but I'm not sure. I wanna hear this music in order to see if they are useful. Turn it 
Trish! Trish, it's happening! What? Rosa, finally! I'll be right there! Wait, wh where are you going? The roof! It's happening! They seem too happy for it to be the asteroid. But maybe... True? I'm gonna go check it out. You coming? Obviously. Okay, what is happening? Oh, a plant. Okay. It's thriving! Nope, not a giant space rock. Yeah, but what is it? I created a new species. The Rosa Fern. No. Ferntasma. No. Fernin' up. Sick fern, dude. Uh. Fern unit. Fern. Feel the fern. Fern unit. Fern unit. Fernando? Yes! Living Fern! Mmm. Copernicus. Phenomenon. <coughs> Weird fern. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, I know that. It's already, I know. Right? It's not for looks, but just to show colleges that I know about grafting an interspecies selective cell regeneration. We learned about this because I was looking into plants for Mango's tank. See? This part down here is the rootstock, and this is the scion. This particular rootstock is famously resistant to velvet worms who will, ordinarily, eat the shit out of almost any plant like the adorable monsters they are. So, take that rootstock and add a vulnerable planty scion and BOOM! Bug-proof leaves, baby! Okay, cool. Weird, but cool. Trace this. What's your idea? Mango fern? Okay, okay, so... Should it be called... Mango fern? Mango Fern! Nice. Um, I'm really excited for Battle of the Bands. It's gonna be great. Mmm, thanks. Me too. Have you heard all of the other bands? Ah, uh, me too. Yeah. Th me too. And LNL tonight, right? What are we gonna do about Kath? I guess I'll just have to marry him. Never. Hmm. Officiating an LNL wedding would be cool. But Kef would still totally kill you. <gasps> My guitar! Oh, I left it in the music room. See you tonight! Yeah, I'm gonna go too. That plant thing is freaking me out. <laughs> I mean, if you made that new species, I'm very sure that's gonna kill us all. Biased, right? but you're my favorite before, band in the battle. Like, hands down. Before, before the meteor kills us all. Thanks. That's, um, that's really cool of you to say. I know things are gonna work out for your music, Fang. You've got something really special. Yeah. And your plant is... A crime against nature? Yeah, that's what I say. 100% yeah! <laughs> I mean, completely. But... <laughs> it's... it's... Uh, okay, I have no options here! It's gonna work. Impressive. Beautiful. It's impressive. I'm gonna go with impressive. It's... Pretty awesome that you can do that. Bright future, big dreams, everything Roberts is always talking about. You know, I'm gonna stay up here. Oh, are you? I think Coach Connor actually appreciates it when I skip PE. See you at LNL. See ya. Okay, we have another photo. Okay, she's pretty cool actually. Yeah, Ross is very cool. Okay, Alan D, D and D. Hey, what did I miss? D and D died. What's wrong? What's wrong, Trish? Are you living in the band? Can I talk to you for a sec? Yeah. So remember that entomology program I was talking about? That's it. That's my plan. I mean, I know I just did tendrils and just got mango, but I've been thinking about how we were always kind of into worms and stuff, even as kids. We had that comic, we named our band Worm Drama, all those weird costumes. <laughs> My mom still isn't over the dress incident. So <laughs> worth it. Anyway, I think this is what I want to do. Bugs and worms. But like, 
for a job. Forever. <sighs> it feels really good when I say it out loud. So, like, what do you think? I'm coming for you. What about the... Ah, I'm gonna be. I, th I think Trish is... Trish can actually choose the um, stuff. Yeah, yeah. You seem really happy about it. So that's Like, great. the money is just my thing. I can totally see you as a bug. Everybody can actually... Whatever. Do all they want. Yeah! Before you know. Bugologist! Meteor. Anyway, you know how Rosa made that whole plant thing for college applications? Turns out you pretty much have to do something big like that to even get noticed by most schools. I'm working on this way to restore velvet worm habitats by turning trash into food for them, but it's going to take a lot of hours with mango and about a dozen different types of compost heaps to check all the variables and allow time for propagation. And I think I need a break from the band for a while. The Battle of the Bands is going to be my last show. Say something. Uh, I need a minute. I can't believe this. How can you do this now? Uh, I need a minute. I'm not gonna do a, a scene. Um. Just, just. <laughs> you will not. Half is mine. Maybe we can share him? You guys, he's evil. Adventurers, this way, this way. So you're just done? For now. For now. I just want to focus on my future. Well, what about our future? Ah, uh, oi! Ali! You ready to conquer this quest? Hell yes! I'm ready to kick some Praxis butt! Faye? You ready? Join us, Dark One! Mm. Yeah. Okay. Let's play. No, I'm very sure she's not. She's not. She's not okay. <laughs> okay, this is gonna be a really awkward session. All right, everyone have their snacks all set up. Okay, okay. Here we go. Previously on L and L. The party joined by the newly recovered Dark One struck out into the Crystal Caves in search of Kef, the strikingly handsome leader of the Cult of Braxis. But look who struck out, am I right? Charging into battle, possibly spurred on by the cultist gyrations, the party attacked Kef and the golem he created and defeated him. I still think we could have avoided that fight. <laughs> Unfortunately, the ritual succeeded. But then, I found that crystal guitar! Mm-hmm. <clears throat> the crystal axe of fortitude. Not to be confused with another axe. The Blight Bane one. This is the one that Ollie played, right? Not before she wanted to keep it for herself. Yes. With some convincing, the party worked together, and Ali used the axe to free the party and return to the airship. And don't forget about Kef! And, and okay. in a very tragic turn, Kef was felled. He's not dead, I'm sure of. Kef is too beautiful to die. Mm, I won't comment on that. I will, however, remind you that after his alleged untimely passing, he also let you know about a hidden temple in the Ocean of Sand, and a fabled god-killing weapon said to lie in the Misty Mangroves. Mm. Okay, give me a moment. Uh, we have choice to make friends. You can go to the Ocean of Sand to seek the Temple of Praxis, truth name. Or you can brave the misty mangroves for the blight bane hacks. Big decision. Both options sounds equally unpleasant. Take a moment to think it over. Remind us to the unspeakable horrors you mentioned it in the group chat, Celeste. Yoshan of Stan is incredibly vast. You think you risk losing both your way and your mind. But well, the misty mangroves aren't any better, not with those monsters driving mad from the blight. Well, of the two incredible dangerous options, I'm learning temple because the ocean of sand 
is the ancient homeland of my people. And I also think learning the true name of Raxus will be there really powerful. Yeah, that's what I'm feeling too. I'm getting a real Jeff level up. Buy from the temple and people prefer the high loot in that sand over swamp trees. It's just physics. But let's not forget the Black Ben is the only loot that we can really know is going to help us in our fight. Yeah, I'm feeling the swamp trees. I have a note from the last session that says sexy swamp bust, I think. So we shall take him again from my past step. My notes from the last session just say make it sure to get there and then it stops and page full of war gold. This is also why I read of Linnea's note. And that's why I color code them. Oh no, it says sexy zombies. That makes a lot of more sense. I mean swamp busts make sense too. We all know how Pine Mage loves to commune with nature, Maya. I didn't didn't they invent skinny dipping in this world? Okay, let's choose. Temple, true names, it'll be cakewalk. Just think of what we could do with Black Ben, right Ball, right guys? You've been quiet, Faye. What say you to all this? Uh, swamp, temple, either is fine. Ah, swamp! I, I think we're, we're going to swamp. If we need a really gigantic, amazing, fucking, really mystic weapon, I'm going for, I'm going for it. There's always time for loot! I always said it when I play, I play games with loot. <laughs> Are there creatures in the swamp? Yes. Will you say there is young creatures there? Infants? Wait, are there babies in the swamp breed? Are the swamp babies? Can we kill them? Oh my god, Reed, we gotta! <laughs> Let's swamp them, the blight, and it's cure. Oh, wait, is there anything we should be on the lookout for? Just follow your heart, Linnea. Let your ancestors guide you. You begin to see mangroves as you approach the swamp from above. Huge roots reaching down into the water, a deep choking mist forming near the canopy. At first, it's just a few trees, standing alone amidst the brackish water. But as you continue, the trees get larger, blocking out the sun, and the swamp air gets thicker, warmer, and wet. So, basically the locker room of the beer. <laughs> okay, yeah. Exactly. Your visibility starts to get worse as the mist thickens. You can barely see the huge web of roots that lies beneath. In the distance, you catch a glimpse of one huge mangrove rising far above these still giant trees. I, I'm, not I, I'm not sure about what, what, um, what I say, she actually tried to say with uh, physical education. I... No, no, I mean, my physical education time was school was in one way, and then physical education, I really literally have to travel a billion kilometers to actually get into physical education field. And that, and that is weird. I mean, I'm not sure if it's weird for you guys, but for me, it's kind of weird. As you strain your eyes to see, suddenly the airship lurches to the side. The vagrant is snagged in the branches. It's too dangerous. You're going to have to jump before the ship capsizes. Do airships capsize? I can't risk it. Jump! What do we do? Do we jump? I jump. I'm jumping. Okay, I jump too. Jumping! Uh, I jump. Oh, I guess reaching binds as we fall. Okay, you can only target three creatures. Okay, well, since we jump first, I guess I have to leave Faye and Ollie. Uh, sorry, guys. 
Vines spring from your hands and surround Jeff, you, and Linnea. Then reach out and wrap around the branches of the mangrove, slowing your descent. Ollie and Faye, you both tumble off the ship, hitting numerous branches before landing on top of one of the giant mangrove roots. You both take six damage. Okay, that's not too bad. Nice landing. Ten out of ten. Hang on, I think I will get the program unstuck. You all go in search of the axe. I'll meet up with you afterwards. Goodbye. Yeah, see you later, Bagram. Okay, so Reed, where are we? Right, you've all landed together now, and as the patch of mist clears away, you realize you have landed smack dab in the middle of a group of mushroom people. That makes me think about. <laughs> oh my god, now. Oh my god, that's this makes me think about a Mario ripoff. <laughs> So, sorry, Chrissy, if you're watching this, I don't think so. But, but sorry about it. <laughs> okay, uh, that would be actually really cool. That would be actually really cool to have a D and D while we are landing into a fucking Mario world. That would be nice. Oh, the Martian folk are the worst. Their pale, fleshy faces turn to stare at you. They screech and raise the weapons they were honing before you interrupted them. Roll for initiative. Okay, uh, uh I get more shrooms. I mean, depending on kind, what kind of mushrooms. I eat mushrooms before. Depending on which kind you eat. Some are tasty, some are not that, not that good. Okay, 17. Not bad. I got a 20. These mushrooms are pretty slow, so they're gonna go last. I played some six chores on my guitar to blast them with a wave of sound, seven damage to each of them. They actually really don't like that. A bunch of them run and flee, and a few melt into puddles of spores. Wow. Okay. okay. Uh, you next, Faye. Sorry, I need to know when Ray actually is talking. <laughs> I cast an arrow and effect spell too. That vibes. Uh. Dark flames are up from the floor in a 20 foot circle around the target. Five fire damage! Do you know they were weak to fire? Really? I just wanted to set them on fire. <laughs> you burn the rest of the mushroom people into charred little stumps. Barbecue! Nice! I didn't even have to get involved. Couldn't start to hurt any plants, huh, Maya? What? Mushroom iron plants. They're funky. Oh. Anyway, after you defeat the mushrooms, you begin to feel a sense of dread. Can we roll bodies? Do those mushrooms have any loot? Mm, it's very strange. Their bodies sink in the mud, and you can't find anything. Oh, man. Now I'm definitely feeling a sense of dread. Okay, do we want to head to the giant tree? Is that our goal? I mean, he wouldn't just put an one giant tree in the middle if he didn't want us to go there, right? Okay, I just don't know that. Do I have a sense of which direction it is? Yes. As a vine mage, you feel an acute sense of dread coming from one direction in particular. Guys, I'm beginning to feel an acute feeling of dread coming from one direction in particular. You begin moving through the swamp in that direction. It's difficult. The water reaches up to your thighs. Small gnats begin swarming around you, biting at your faces, crawling near your nose holes. Oh, yuck! Each footstep becomes more and more difficult as the mud under the water sucks on your feet. Can I just imagine the mud is kept? <laughs> okay. Okay, Ross, I, I get it, I get it. We, you, won, you won kept so madly. <laughs> yes, actually you can. You start thinking of Kef. You clearly picture his face lit by candlelight. <laughs> I knew he was romantic! <laughs> And as you're looking deep in his eyes, 
glittering in the firelight. You get the sense that something is very, very wrong. And Maya, you turn around, and you see the forest you grew up in as a little girl, and the flicker isn't a candle. It's a line of orange that fills the entire horizon. That's when you smell smoke. Oh no! The flames rush through the underbrush. It's so fast. So remarkably fast. You can barely hear the screams of your family over the roar. And you know intuitively that no water, no fine magic, nothing will save the forest. It is lost. Does the rest of us see this? You do not see this, Linnea. You see a wall. A wall? Yeah, start on me. <laughs> yes. On this wall, there's a pattern. It's so intricate. Lines swirling and collapsing in on themselves. It's so intricate that your eyes have a hard time focusing on it. And yet, the pattern just makes sense to you. You're right on the verge of cracking it. You walk closer, and the pattern begins to converge. And you feel yourself falling. Words lose meaning. You forget how to speak. There's just these lines everywhere. If you can just figure it out, you forget who you are. You forget time. You only see... this pattern. He's awful. Jeff. Oh, no. Jeff, you feel great. I do. I mean, great. I do. You're surrounded by gold. Everywhere you look. Gold, gems, trinkets. You're on a huge mountain of gold. Sweet! Can I swim in the gold? You sure can. You play in this vast sea of wealth. But then, things get boring. You've already tried sliding, swimming, building gold stacks. All of it. The thing is, the more you walk around, the more gold you see. But you never see another person. Not another living thing. You're utterly alone. Oh no! Please, don't try to make me learn a lesson from this! Ollie, you see Braxis. I punch him! I punch him. He smiles at you. You try to attack him again. And again. And he is completely unfazed. Then, with one flick of his finger, you are vaulted aside. You know you've lost. You know that evil will return to the land. And the thing is, life isn't so different under Braxis. You return home, and the day-to-day -day is very similar to your life before you went adventuring. Except for one thing. Every day, every time you step out of your tiny home into the bright sun, you see something in the faces of everyone around you. You hear the whispers behind your back. You see the masked smiles. All hiding. Disappointment. I, uh, wow. Sorry to everyone, I guess. Faye. Faye. You see yourself. Myself? Yes. You are watching yourself. You see yourself return home. You see yourself interact with people you used to care about. You see yourself do things that you used to enjoy doing. But you... You feel nothing. You are a ghost. Watching Faye talk. Watching Faye move. Watching Faye sleep. You keep staring at your Faye face for some piece of recognition of what it is you should feel or do or are. But it's always just out of reach. Can I talk to anyone? You've long stopped trying to scream at the people Faye talks to. But tonight, you try screaming at Faye. To try and understand what has happened. To understand who Faye is. To try and feel... something. But Faye never hears. Never reveals anything. Faye just... Is. Uh, that hurts. Uh, yeah, that hurts. 
What the heck, Reed? Twist it in the, the knife. Well, why don't you? As these terrible visions fill you all with overwhelming doom, you suddenly realize you're all waist deep in the mud, and you're sinking fast. Shut. Um, let me look through my spells. I got it. I guess. I guess a uh, clasping tendril and direct the bind to wrap around tree trunk before extending over to us. You're a lifesaver. Quick, everyone, use bind as a rope and pull yourself toward the edge of the mud. You don't need to tell me twice. After escaping, you finally approach the blight tree. The sounds of the swamp, crickets, frogs, the wind even, have all stopped. Okay, Reed is not it's not it's not gonna gain anymore, so Okay, I gotta I gotta actually okay. This close you can even tell your head back enough to see the top. Thick, dark sobs erupts from the bookmarks and all over the surface of the tree. Oh hey! It's so far more year again. Yuck. Yeah, but your skills are flawless now. Don't even think about it. You begin to feel one okay, yeah, red is red voice is glitching right here right now. Okay, you begin to feel once again the sense of overwhelming. I rush the tree. Okay, you rush the tree. There's no way I'm letting this stupid tree to get better off me again. I'm the plant mama me. You scream, I'm the plant mama, okay, as God. you race forward, brandishing <laughs> your staff as you near the roots of the epic mangrove. What are the rest of you doing? I'm waiting on seeing. I get a little closer, I guess. I just want to smite this thing. Let's go. As you connect with the root, it feels fleshy. Your staff embeds inside one of the oozing pockmarks, and then, with a yank, you are pulled inside. Maya! Oh no! Ha! <gasps> what? Tell me, tell me, tell me! Is something happening to your character? I'll never tell. Ooh, secrets! I love secrets! Shh! No one has any secrets. Agreed. No secrets. Anyways, you all have something else to worry about. I'm going to need all of you to prepare for battle. All right. Uh, roll for initiative. Nine. Oops. Not so great. Onea, you're first. Then Jeff. Then Faye. I'm coming, Maya! I rush forward and put my hands on the tree, casting banishment. Roll for effectiveness. A 50. Normally pretty good, but against this guy, it doesn't do anything. It whips out at you with a root, sending you flying back. I use one of my throwing spoons and hurl, in, hurl it at the tree. How good is your aim? Eagle eye! Oh, well, in that case, it sails through the air and embeds itself in the tree's trunk, where black ooze starts dripping out. I made it bleed! Are you? I can't use any of my big spells. They hurt Maya too. Okay, attack roots with cycle. Attack branches with cycle. Attack, attack roots with cycle. Forty. I go for their roots, but not too close to Maya's body. Roll for me. Body? You sever some of the roots, which wriggle away on the ground like worms. More black sap starts oozing out from its wounds. Ah, this thing is a pain. You guys have done a good bit of damage so far. It's the tree's turn now, and instead of attacking you, it plunges some of its free roots down into the muck. You hear a gross sucking sound, and the wounds you've given the tree start to regenerate. Jeff, your spoon pops out of the tree with its bark healed over. Faye, the cuts you've managed to inflict also seal back up. That's 25 damage it healed itself for. 
I don't understand why this isn't working. There has to be a way to do this. Is mangrove resistant to everything? I don't remember seeing anything in the creature compendium about this. I want to do something. Can someone help me? I want to do something. Can I do something like cast a spell? You can try. What spell do you want to cast? Um, what about this? I cast Physic Lambasting. Oh, what's that? It says here I can tap into a mind of an... Uh, uh, sorry. Into the mind of and turn any sentient creatures I choose with within a 16 meter radius. Are the mangroves sentient? Oh, they sure are. Fay, you reach out, sliding into the collective consciousness of the swamp. What do you say? Make it good! Oh gosh, I don't know. Maybe this should be a group discussion. Hey, three idiots! Your mother has sappy puck market parts! <laughs> yeah, and your roots are so grandly. They make me want to jarp! Normally I will stand for this lander, but it's appropriate. These trees suck. I hate them and, and they should feel bad. Wow. Brutal. Crushing. All the trees at once shudder as if flinching. They're stunned for a moment. Oh gosh, I tried to break free. As you begin to emerge, you feel the mangrove sucking you back. You get the sense that you don't have much time. I took the spot where Maya was poking out. Okay, that's a three, a seven, an eight, and a one. Um, uh... Oh, hurry! I'm doing my best. It's 18. Actually, it's 19. Uh, 23 if you factor in the bonus. And that's a high enough roll. Ollie. You weaken the tree enough for Maya to break free. I'm back, baby! Time to kick some trunk! Maya, suddenly you feel great. Any lingering dread is gone, and you're ready to mess this nasty tree up. I rush back to my feet, take a few step back, and then turn to his face this horrible, horrible abomination of a plant. Maya, you feel a deep emerald power coursing through your viney veins. Where the tree was trying to suck you in before, it reels and shrinks away from your newfound glorious energy. How do you want to finish this? I take my staff, win up, and gathering all my energy from the flower mother, smash into the ground. Do you say anything? Oh, help me! What do I say? Something funny, something badass, something badass. Something about flower power? <laughs> Suck my flower! <laughs> okay, I get it. <laughs> As you smash oh, yeah. your staff into the swamp, nothing happens. Then, after a moment, a streak of blinding light bursts from the water all around you. The water instantly evaporates. And as the circle of light shoots upward, you see the tree pus and decay get blasted off leaving healthy bark beneath. The mist has been burned away, and as the sun shines down for the first time, you see in the grotto of the tree, Blightbane, the axe of legend. I got to get gently rich into that grotto and uh, ease out that axe. Oh my! <coughs> you pull it out. Ah, nice! Cool axe, Maya! Thanks, it's awesome! It feels very good killing. Or, wait, does it, Reed? It totally feels god killy. But you get the feeling it isn't meant for you. Oh! Oh, right! Here, Faye, you can have this. Oh, thanks! Nice axe, Faye! Yes, we did it! I think that was the hardest combat we had. We almost lost you, Maya. What were you thinking, running in there by yourself? You could have been killed. Leave the rushing to me. 
Hey, the important thing is that we made it. I didn't die. And... The rest of you notice that the beam of sunlight reflects off of Maya's hair in new and exciting ways. Yes, I'm slow and um, flip my hair. It looks incredible. It's like a shampoo commercial. There's like a soft glow everywhere. It's fantastic. <laughs> okay, great. I get it. <laughs> a shadow passes over you all. You look up to see the silhouette of the vagrant as a rope ladder gets unfurled. You hear Sid call down from above. Hey, you guys didn't die. Okay, Forrester. Nice. Got another trophy. Let's get out of this town. Alright, you all return to the ship and tell Celeste what happened. Does she notice my hair? Maya, I love your, the hair. You're glowing. Thank you all for your hard work. I know you're the, you, you how dangerous that must have been. Maya almost got swallowed by a tree. You also managed to avoid the true danger of the misty mangroves being lost in your fears forever. You think you may have, I don't know, lead with that? Yeah, that was super creepy. See, now I'm starting to doubt your credentials, Celeste. Yeah, we specifically ask you about that, Celeste. Yeah, Celeste. I going to my room. I literally don't know how I could have been more clear. You all retire to your quarters and turn in. But Faye, <coughs> you spend some time struggling to fall asleep. And when you finally do, you're suddenly awoken by a light in your eyes. You open them. Does someone have a torch? No, it's coming from outside. You open the door to the deck and step out. You hear it before you see it. A slow whine. A whisper coming from this light in the sky. You hear something coming. A whisper tickling at the base of your spine. A single word. Cataclysm. Oh, we're Something this, right? zips onto the deck beside you. It's a small piece of hail, sizzling. Then zip, zip, zip. More start coming down around you. Then come the screams. The burning hail rains down, tearing through the ship. Everyone is panicking, running. It's chaos. You see Sid and Celeste turn and run full speed off the deck, holding hands as they fall. The light winks out. For an eternity, everything is quiet. Then on the horizon, you see the sunrise. Rays of crimson light crawl across the sky. The whole sky is a dazzling red. It's so peaceful. But your gut knows better. This isn't sunlight. Sunlight doesn't smell like ash. The sky is on fire. You hear the roar now, and your world explodes in pain. The sound is deafening. It's so hot. So inescapably hot. Why won't it just end? And you wake up in your bed on the ship. You glance over at the mirror, but you don't see Faye. You see a shadow. A shadow with a burning red smile that whispers, Hello, Faye. Miss me. Hmm. That is where we will end tonight's session. Okay, that was cool, Reed. I gotta tell you, for the um, Lord, that's that cool. was. <clears throat> Reed, dude, what the heck was that last bit? Yeah, that vision you gave Faye was ominous. Things are reaching their conclusion. 
Time's almost up. Yeah, with your thing. I get it. Hey, Trish, can we talk? Sure, but it, it's kind of late, though. Gotta go feed Mango. Sage, walk me home, my cook with the left hook. We'll talk later. Battle of the Bands is gonna be epic. See ya! Mm. Yeah, Trish wants a time out for the band. That's why it happens. I'm not sure, if I, if I were me, I, I'm okay with that. But Good evening. Our top story tonight, in a band. That's the why. latest on the asteroid scientists are predicting will make a close pass to the planet. Good. Officials continue to say there is little danger posed by this once-in-a-generation astrological event, with most projections showing the space rock missing impact by a margin of 20 to 30 percent. But one local amateur astronomer is raising alarm with new self-published trajectories that show a much higher chance of impact from this massive object. Yeah, there's a future here. <laughs> Sorry, Pang. Have to dismiss off this. Ah, oh, he gets number one in something, I'm not sure what. <laughs> National Speech of. Uh, I can't. I can read that. Debate Association. Okay. I said it before and I said it again. The music is freaking right. Before, and I, I'm gonna ask it again. Are you sure God doesn't want that thing to die? <laughs> like all the streaming doesn't get copyrighted because, again, I gotta be really pissed. So now Omi is the one that is actually telling us. Titanic to us in an unknown state. I knew it! <laughs> Best detective ever, friends! Dude! I am really good at Phoenix Wright, <laughs> Phoenix Wright games, so you can understand this. The features freaks me out. It's funny. It's not the day of a big thing that makes you nervous. It's the day before. Ugh. Get out of my head. Hey, how are you doing? Can I help you? How are you doing? How's it going with you? It's going. You? Blah. BOTB tomorrow? Right? Yes. Oh, God. Yeah. I remember, cuz... Well, I could draw your poster from memory. I saw so many of them when I uh, collected them from school. So, effective marketing. Ah, uh, funny. Anyway, sorry for being a narc. How's the show prep going? Mm. We are as ready as we'll ever be, I guess. I just keep thinking of everything that could go wrong. Like breaking a guitar string. Well, I wasn't until you said that. No, I mean, like, the part where we have to get in front of a bunch of people and not suck. Oh. And what if you do? I'd probably die. I get like this sometimes. I think everybody does. I got an idea. We do this sometimes in drama to work out stage fright. I am not doing a trust fall. 
No, not that. Just focus on your breathing. Okay. Now, put your hands on your hips like your Captain Triassic. Come on. A real power stance like this. Feet apart. Really grounded. Okay. Hands on hips. Put your back into it this time. Head up like the whole world is beneath you. Deep breath and wings out like you're taking. You're winning this thing. There we go. <laughs> I really like that, that interaction. <laughs> now, you won. Why did you win? I guess. We work well together, we have fun. Our songs are great. We have fun. Playing together is kind of amazing. And people can tell we're having a good time. Huh. Hey. Thanks. Sorry about the other day. Uh, sorry about the other day. I'm sorry for blowing up at you the other day. I was being kind of a dick. I really do appreciate you, little bro. I know. We're family. Whether you like it or not. So, I'm here to help. Trish. Boop. Hey! You live here yet? Wanna walk together? Maybe not. Uh, sure. Hope that's in this isn't weird. Yes, please. Okay, not uh, if we don't talk about the band this time, I'm very sure we can actually have a really nice fun. <sighs> nice time. Okay. With Trish. She's my best friend. We've talked about stuff before. And I know what I want to say. I just have to actually say it. Listen, Trish. Okay, I feel hurt. I want to support you. I want to support you. I don't want to force you to stay with the band. I want you to do what's important for you guys always. I want to share this. I miss you. Uh... I want to share this because I'm. This is not a. This is not a goodbye thing for all, for everyone. And if it's if it does, at least try to stay friends, I guess. I want to share this. I'm gonna imagine going ahead without you right now. Anyway, you can always talk to me. I'm sorry I got weird. Yeah, I'm gonna go like this. I'm sorry I got weird. I feel like I got weird when you told me I was just really surprised. You, you're my bro till the end of the time. Morning, Fang. Pretty day, right? I can't believe the sky could be hiding something so bad. You know? Sorry, I've had a lot of coffee. I get free beans at Lava Java. I should stop talking. Yeah, you totally go into a caffeine fugue state. So, I'm basically her chaperone right now. Sure. Anything for a friend, right? I'm glad you're wired, Rosa. I barely slept last night. Mango keep you up with her chewing again? Uh, I've gotten used to that. <laughs> no, just life. Hey, did I tell you Dad's out of town again? Anyway, it's been a lot. Between studying and practicing and momming. I know, but I think it's great you decided to stick it out to the battle. You kept saying you wanted to go out with a bang, and now you get to. Yeah, I guess so. Uh, yeah. The battle's gonna be great. But it's, it's just the beginning. I mean, for worm drama. Yeah, totally. I know I'm leading for a while, but it's gonna be okay. Chop a worm in half and you get two worms. I mean, that's us. Two halves of the same worm just reeling along, doing our wormy things. It's gonna be totally fine. Hey, uh, whatever happened to that person who was texting you? Oh, yeah, your mystery missives. Um. They're kind of great. I'm not ready to talk about it. Wow, smooth switch. Uh, they're kind of great. 
we actually get along. It's kind of wild. <laughs> Keep us posted. I'm so curious. Hmm. I better grab my books. <laughs> See you later. We, we all know that it's Naomi, but Bang doesn't know. <laughs> so? I kind of thought you wanted to talk when you texted me. Yeah, I did. I do. Always. Everything's nuts right now, but I don't want that to mean we don't hang out. Right. Just you and me. And Rosa. Uh, yeah, that was an accident. Rosa's really great, though. Promise. She likes you. She's cool, but, um... Could we make some time for just the two of us, though? Heck yeah! Anytime you want! Well, not any anytime, but y you know what I mean. Okay. So, ritual tonight? Uh, I gotta babysit tonight. Right. Well, maybe we can do it the day of the show? Mm, I guess we can skip it. That's curse. That's a curse. Uh, we can skip it. Maybe we just skip it. Well, see you tomorrow, I guess? <laughs> of course. See ya. Mm, yeah, that's kind of weird. Nasser? Hey, Sib, I'm working on the late Jack board. Hey, Sib. Okay. I'm working late on yearbook stuff with Naomi. Nice pick, by the way. There's some sesame noodles in the fridge for you. Just heat them up with a little oil. Ooh, noodles. That looks like ramen, if you ask me. <laughs> Man, it's been a while I didn't re eat ramen. Be here. I'll be there tomorrow. No big deal. Nope. I can't, can't wait. Can't wait to meet you. I dedicating a song to you. I know you'll be great. You're working really hard for this. Smile face. I hope it's okay that I'm coming. Of course. I really want to meet you. I might be weird. No, no. I wanted to. Heart. Trish. Ah, oh, she's doing the ritual without me. No harma. Meteor, heart, meteor. <laughs> okay, that's. I'm gonna, I'm gonna send you a heart. Let's avoid the meteor thing until we have it on our faces. <laughs> okay, this is kinda cute. <laughs> Hey, mom and dad are calling. Right now? Yep, come on. <sighs> They're coming right now. Hello? Shakti, there you are. It's good to see you. Nasrat said you've been working a lot. Is that why you look so tired? Mm, miss you, mom. It's true, I'm tired. What a spy. Uh, uh, yeah, it's true, I'm tired. I guess. Band stuff. Listen, your mother and I have decided to come back tomorrow. That early? It's all this news about the meteor. Asteroid. What's the difference? Doesn't matter. Same impact? Very funny, Nasser. Hey, guess what Fang's doing tonight? What? What are you doing? Oh, it's, it's nothing. Their band made it into this huge music competition. Only a few acts made it this far, and it would be huge if they won. Like, career in music huge. Interesting. I never had a talent for music. 
I tried in college, you know. I remember, unfortunately for me. So what, you win money or something? Not exactly. Mm, let's keep it this brief. Believe it get it's it's not about money. Let's let's keep this brief. Brief. No. We don't win a million dollars. Sorry. We just get to play another show. Mm-hmm. Who else will be there? Patricia? Well, she's in the band, so yeah. I like her. You should invite her for supper when we get back. Don't forget, hmm? I don't want to come home to a house that looks like a robbery happened. <laughs> Batme, you especially. Be good. I'll end it. You especially. Ha <laughs> ha. Laugh it up, funny guy. Guess I shouldn't tell them I'm releasing a comedy album. Ha! <laughs> I don't think they'd survive. I've been a bad influence on you. Well, I guess the age of freedom has come to an end. Honestly, I was starting to miss them. Mm. I mean, it's the last time we're gonna see them, so... It's okay. Okay. I'm gonna go uh, fill my water and then I'm gonna actually try to stretch my legs because right now I'm... They are hurting me really bad. <laughs> so, uh, thir three minutes. Just three minutes. And I'll be back. Anyway, uh, be right back. I got three minutes.
Okay, I'm back. Ah, uh, sorry, I had to fill my water. I had to literally stretch my legs because I really was feeling like the entire blood of my legs were not going to my feet. <laughs> so yeah, I had to literally have to walk a little bit. My legs literally crack up out my way while I was walking. So that's something. And I thought I had to change my joystick because the, I'm very sure the other joystick was running out of battery, but you never know. Anyway, let's continue playing this game, shall we? And now that I see, uh, I have more, uh, now that I see uh, my affinity, it's, I see can actually read and trish are the ones that I keep close, which is not bad. They're my best friends, so of course I gotta get them more uh, close to me. The Nasser is almost there. Then Naomi and Rosa looks a little bit far away, a little bit. And I read this on session. And uh, Stella, how the fuck do you I get closer to Stella and, and Sage? I can if I know. Okay, let's this go. This is the last of the gear. You nervous? Uh, yeah, my, I feel good actually. Uh, I feel good actually. I hope I don't jinx it, but yeah. You're gonna kill it. Good luck. See you there? Yeah, see ya. Wait. Seriously? Just one second. Huh? You packed me a lunch? More like an early dinner. Thanks, Dad. Gotta have something in your stomach to puke out from all the nerves. Now, good luck. Not after I puke up, that I even have a reference. <laughs> Man, I had to actually cook all my my food. And my sister. Hello, hello. Hello, dearest lead singer. So it's gonna be fine. I know. <laughs> I mean, no, I don't. We could completely bomb. It is gonna be. Fine. We should have practiced more. L let's go over the set list one more time. Fang, bro, dude, we got this. You got this. We're in, like, LJ likes us, and honestly, we rule. The hard part is over. It's time for the have fun and blow everyone's minds part, which I'm personally excited about. <laughs> Remember when you booked us at that retirement place? Um, you mean the Shady Palms retirement community from which we are banned for life? <laughs> yeah. I still think that was one of our best shows. Oh, yeah, it was. Lucky nobody died. See? We've been touching people's lives with our music for years. Just think, when we started, you and I are basically the same height. Now look at us. <laughs> We're like... Actual complete people now. <laughs> Speak for yourself. I can play way more than four bar chords. I can play all the chords. And you, you've become like this musical wizard. Dark mage. And you are also here. Yep. Seriously. <laughs> you guys are in all my best memories. Yeah, I know. Man, it's really... Yeah, it's the end for now. Mm, I'm lucky to have, you, have this with you. So, tonight we're gonna kick ass. I don't need to be this. I'm lucky to have, uh, to have you with this. There you go. I'm glad you're in all my memories too. Okay, tonight is the night we kill it. With, well, pro probably with a guitar and drums and everything. I'm not sure what Trish is having. <laughs> Whoa, I suddenly feel extremely cool and capable. Mm, yep. Ooh, this is legit. Never seen so many bards in one place before. Hey, rock stars. 
Hey Rosa! Thank God you're here. You, I'm very sure we're gonna need Is this a lot of emotional support. What? I finally get to see worm drama in its natural habitat. Even got some VIPs waiting for a meet and greet before sound check. And say Shang Story, thanks for coming here. Yeah? Oh god, brushes! <laughs> now nah, thanks for coming, uh, fans. Please, please, no autographs. Too bad, I'm gonna need one. Don't worry, you guys have got this. Seriously. First of all, you look incredible. Flash on unlock, okay, move on. New girl. Okay, so, there I was, covered in head towing SH. Group, I bring a person. Stella. This is a person. Her name is Stella and she is new and also my best friend. A lot is happening right now. Hi, hi uh, everyone. I just moved here from Cliffside. I heard that Cliffside has a really spider, gigantic, cute spider lady. <laughs> if you didn't watch that short, go watch it. It's really fun. I'm really, really sad that it was it wasn't turned on in the series. It's from the creator of Modern Robots. So there's that. So that's Tris Reed Fang. There we go. And I'm Sage. I know, hon. Nice to meet ya. We play music and are generally very cool. So some of us cooler than others. Hey. So what are you into? Well, what do you know about star charts? I'm a heminodon. I'm not sure what that means. I know, hon. Is that, a, is that a, his phrase? I think, I think it's that I don't know race, I'm not sure. I like her. Besties. Let's do crimes. What is going on? <laughs> Second of all, I think they picked the winner based on how loud the audience is. And I drank hot tea all day so I can cheer extra loud all night. Seriously, we've been scoping out the competition and you really don't have anything to worry about. Well, <laughs> crisis averted. I believe in you. There's a ton of fans here, but none of them are the worm drama. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Gotta support my worms. Okay, thanks Rosa for real. Oh god, precious son. Science when we we have worms. Thanks Rosa for real. Hey, you got any plans this summer? We're gonna need a tour manager. Sign me up. Wanna draw a card? See how it'll go? Can you guarantee a good omen? No, no can't do. I promised a witch I wouldn't touch tarot cards for five more years. <laughs> okay... Then you're up, Fang. Before a huge moment, why not? Uh, okay, yeah, why not? Can't hurt, I guess. Okay, I always go for the middle one. The fool. Fool. Great, great, great. So, we're gonna lose. No. No, it just means to go into life with, like, innocence and no expectations. Like, just have fun, basically. It's a card about starting something new. So we're gonna... <laughs> so, like, we're gonna lose, so we're gonna lose, we are gonna lose, are we? <laughs> so it's like we're gonna lose. So what? The real winning is friendship, right? Cool. Cool. I mean, it all sounds like whatever happens, He'll be okay with it. 100%. I get how it seems scary, but the card is really talking about how ready you are for something good. Oh, hey! Hey, it's not with me. I wanna get the uh, star plug now, please. Hey, <laughs> if you, you want. You think she's okay? She's giving off a lot of worried librarian energy right now. Naomi! She'll be fine. We've gotta go. See y'all from the stage, baby! It's fine. No I'm... worm drama! I'm very sure uh, she doesn't want Fang to see her, I guess. And she, she is kind of shy. That's why she always stuck Look with other enemies in an endless Seriously, way. Seriously, why are they so popular? I hate to say it, but they know how to play. Fang? It's true. They're like, technically good. I mean, not good good, but, you know. Catchy hooks, watered down alt boy aesthetic. Yeah. People eat that shit up. 
Oh shit. Oh shit! It's happening! Bee of the bees! It's drama clock! Uh, uh, why are my fingers so slippery? Wait, what's a guitar? <laughs> what is music, really? Like, when you stop to think about it. Mm, please be cool, guys. ATGLG is in here. I love these idiots. I love these idiots. <laughs> I love you guys. Oh shit! Wait, what's happening? Worm drama, right? That's right. Wanna fight about it? Uh, not really. Anyway, yeah, nice. My little cousin said your posters were up all over the high school. It's awesome that LJ lets kids compete. Kids? Teens? Teens? We are in fact teens, Trish. Yeah. You're Fang? Um, yes. LJ says you have a pretty sick voice. They've been playing around with something, like, really different for backup vocals on our new stuff. Maybe you should come down to the studio sometime. Could be good exposure, you know? Go away, dude. I never leave my friends. Yeah, I don't think your style really works for me. Like, at all. Yeah, hit the bricks, Trant. Well, <laughs> think about it. We had 80,000 lessons last month. Probably gonna tour again soon. Oh, and hey. Looks like we're on right before you. Good luck out there. Yeah, you have fun. Don't worry, guys, we're having nice one, T. Those dudes truly suck. Hmm. Could be good for exposure. <laughs> Buzz off, dick. Yeah, gross. Now we have to win. Even harder than we were already going to. Cheers to that. Yeah, yeah. No, you're right. We're gonna win and we're gonna play Caldera Fest. And we're gonna get like a billion listens. Take that, Trant. Hmm. Okay. Hey, hey. Hey, no, sir. Hey, yourself. Here. A lot of people out there. A lot of future worm drama fans. Or a lot of booers. Booing ones. Ones, ones that boo. This doesn't seem like a booing type crowd. Uh, says Mr. Never Been Booed. You've seen my speeches. I have definitely been booed. Okay, me booing you does not count. Oh my god. We gotta stop saying boo. <laughs> Listen, you're going to be great. All three of you are. You're only here because you've kept going every step of the way, no matter what. It's no different here. Trust me, once you're up there, it's going to hit you. This is your moment. The first of many your moments. Time to face the music. Oh, you got so far too. Gotta be me. Remember when you taught me piano chords? Wow, I forgot all about that. And think about it a lot. Teach these assholes a Hold thing or two. Okay, give me a moment. I'm gonna see this photo. I need, I need the power pose when I know he's got my back. Bones instead of ah uh, sticks. Okay, this is it. Okay, I can do this. Whatever happens, happens. We can we can do this together. We can do this together. Band meeting. Huh? Now? Yeah. I just want to say. We're finally here. Best friends, best band. I'm in the best band in the world. Who? Us? Definitely. What's going on? The power went out. Yeah, me, Theor. Oh, God. Do you think it's the meteor? Yeah. 
Probably. But this place is also like a million years old. Hey, can I get some power to my amp over here? I kind of feel bad for them. One, two, three, four! I thought I if you're here and I thought that's my neighbor's dog. Sorry about that. <laughs> We're up. You good? You're good. We are good. We're good. Next up, a young man who's really impressed me this year. They've got talent, they've got style, they've got two guitars. I... Yeah, I got that reference. I got that reference. You don't fool me, Cobb. I got the reference. <laughs> I understand the reference. And of course it's our time and there's no light. There's no power. Fuck it. Alright, fuck it guys, I'm going in! Okay, rock band time. This is the thing that I hate. Cop, if I hope you're watching this, get rid of this Zoom shit. I don't like it. The something is literally pissing me off. I wanna see the fucking animation. Dang! I did it. Thank God. I said it back and I said it again. Music, 10 out of 10. What is pissing me off the fucking zoom out of the video music? Dang it! I wanna see the animation! 
I don't fucking care if the picture is really neat. I want to see the fucking animation. Okay, here we go again. I think. Fuck it up. Okay, I know I did it perfectly, but I did it. Okay, photo unlocked. Give me a moment. Okay, uh couldn't have done it without her. Okay, give me a moment. Ah damn it! Can always count on read to keep us steady. I hardly need to say anything, do I? I give you our winners of the Battle of the Bands. Worm Drama! We <laughs> win! We win the Battle of the Bands! Fuck you, uh, baby, some, some baby, whatever you're calling. Nobody cares about you. Oh my god. Oh my god! We won! We obliterated it! It was so dramatic and cool and powerful and yeah! And Fang was like, Fang! Holy shit, dude! You pulled up a solo in the dark! That was amazing! Classic <laughs> dark one. Thanks, guys. God, if we did that well in a power outage, imagine how we're gonna do on tour. We're gonna crush it. Uh, right. About that, Fang, I need to tell you something kind of important. Yeah? What's up? I wanted to talk to you about touring this summer. I just... So, you know how a while back I said I wanted to go on a break from... Worm Drama. Our champions. Congrats on a killer performance, kids. You blew everyone away. In the dark, no less. Anyway, as you know, winners of the battle go to Caldera Fest. But I wanted to come and personally confirm it. You in? Yes, yes. We are so in. Glad to hear it. I'll let you celebrate. Great show. Um. Did I miss something? Or is it okay? Who did I look? Did I miss something? Did I miss something? Aren't we celebrating? Yes. Totally, we are celebrating. Dude, that was amazing, right? Fang? I'm happy for you. Really. 
for us. But I don't think we're on the same page about Caldera Fest. What do you mean? This is what we've always wanted. We finally proved ourselves to LJ, to everyone. We're doing it. What? What is it? This is our chance to do what we love. That's what you love, Fang. You never asked what we wanted. What do you love? What else is there? You never told me. Uh, what else is there? What else is there? I wish I had more time for entomology, to hang out with Rosa, to play LNL. There's so much more I want to do. Bugs? Seriously? Uh, what about us? I'm not sure. I, I don't get. But what about us? What? We have something <laughs> like heat. It's cool that you want all those things, but the world is ending. And you don't even want to spend it with me. With us. I thought we were important to you too. Of course you are. I'm not saying I want to stop being friends. Then why are you quitting the band? I have other friends, Fang. If all I do is rehearse for what you want, I won't have any time to see them. <laughs> you mean one other friend? Hey, that's a low blow. Even for you, Fang. I know Caldera Fest means a lot to you. And I don't want to take that away from you. I just need time of my own. Maybe you could do Caldera Fest as a solo act. What? You could totally pull it off. And LJ's obviously in your corner now, so... No way. How could you even suggest that? Um, hello? You killed it on stage before Reed and I joined you. Obviously you got the skills. You don't really need us up there with you. The only reason I was able to do all of that was because I knew that you and Reed were gonna pack me up. You have always had my back. Why are you leaving right when it matters the most? Okay, come on, let- When have you ever had my back, Faye? We've always done what you wanted to do, and that's fine. But there's only so much time we have left. I can't spend the rest of it following along after you. I need to think of myself, too. Uh, okay, fine. Don't go. Yeah, this is where we separate. Again, meet you in our hands! What did you expect? <laughs> Bang! Sage, Stella and Rosa. Thank God. Hey, Superstar! No, oh, too bright. Oh my eyes. Someone get the power again. Bang, you guys were amazing. For real! Chills! Ah, it was magical. Oh, by the way, I saw Trish and Reed pop out earlier. Ah! I can't believe they ditched their biggest fans in their hour of triumph! They must have known you were going to make them sign your face. Fang! Pretty hero. You blow everyone away. Me included, obviously. Then I congratulate you in person. I'm outside. Uh, meet Pretty Hero now. Stay here for a bit. For a bit. Ah, uh, let's meet Pretty Hero now. Sorry, guys. I need to go outside. Um, sorry. I, I just remembered I had plans to go I, meet someone after the show. I made a promise, plans? so I'm gonna stick with that promise. To meet someone? What about it? It's not like that. What about it? And? What about it? In that case... Just to help you prepare. Ugh. Fuck it off, you two. Anyway, if you see Trish and Reed, tell them there are faces to be signed here. Yeah, sure, uh, will do. I'll catch you guys later. Oh, hey, Naomi. I, I was just looking for somebody. Yeah. I know. <laughs> uh, thanks for meeting me. 
Wait, wait. you're the... Yep, yeah, it's, it's me. Surprise! Uh, um, anyway, you guys were amazing. Okay, flashback. So in council. No, wait, I'm gonna see the flashback. Flashback. There's no I in team, but we will be um in your team. Cool slogan, Naomi. And that why that's why you should cast your vote for Naomi for student government representative. Go me, Naomi. Hmm. I really don't think you have worry about it. Means it's not like you're you you not, sorry. It's not like. Anyone really believes Bobby, it's going to get them another summer break. Whatever that means, I just really need extracurriculars. We got to apply to college next year. But public speaking, it just sucks. <sighs> it really sucks. Hi, uh, Naomi. Hey, but for Naomi. I watched your speech and I was wondering, could I join your book committee? I just, I really think that will actually, you know, do things. That, that's a yes. Okay. I mean, I knew you were good, but tonight was something special. Oh, thanks. It was fun. I mean, it was more than fun, I hope. You've been waiting for this for so long. It was incredible. Feng, are you okay? I... A lot happened after the show. Like, a lot. With Trish and Reed. Honestly... I can deal with this. Uh, I'm not ready. I'm not ready. I don't think I'm ready to talk about us this not yet i don't want to ditch naomi oh I, I mean that's fine i promise i'm not trying to avoid you i just need some time to process this and and everything else wait for me sure we can talk later naomi i it's fine. I'm used to waiting for you. Bye, Fang. Yeah, shit is happening right now, so of course she's... Yeah, I think Fang is... can't... <laughs> Look at that. I like that, that's animation. Told you you'd win. Need a ride? Mm, yes. Yeah. Thanks. Cool. I'm parked over there. That doesn't look normal. And it's near, friends! P is for battle. Got another trophy. Yeah, that's... I'm very sure that's not normal. <laughs> Kinda high. Of course, everything is gonna turn out. Of course, everybody is gonna vandalize everything. Give up. Monday to suspend classes to death penalty.
And if God actually give me a copyright strike for all this, I'm gonna tell them the truth. Fix that fucking zoom, motherfuckers! I fucking hate it! I really want to enjoy this game, but the animation and the video music are not. Are not I'm not a fan of that. I'm really not a fan of that. Get rid of the zoom. I wanna enjoy the, the entire music video. Without any fucking zoom. Like this one. This one doesn't have any zooms. And yet I can actually enjoy this one. So, come on, please. I beg you. If uh, there's, there must be one of the game developers looking at this. I fucking beg you, get rid of the zoom in the rock band section. Well, rock band, the, the gameplay sections. Because I want to enjoy the animation. The zoom is useless. I fucking care about the, that perfect picture in the, in the animation. I want to see the animation entirely. I'm, uh, I'm very sure I'm not the only one that actually complains about that. Just get rid of the zoom. Please. The show was intense, huh? Guess you haven't talked to Trish. Nope. It feels too weird right now. Like, are we even still friends? Uh, only one way to find out. So, is LNL still on for this weekend? Dude, I wish. I'm pretty sure LNL is dead as hell. Hard enough to get the group together in the good times. With all this. And all that, I'm pretty sure it's good as done. I don't think you should just give up on it, though. There's not much a DM can do without a group, dude. Personally, I can't think of anything I'd rather do than mess around in a fantasy world. Laughing, crying, making stupid jokes, seduction rolls, whatever. That's a real escape. I think we need that right now. I agree. But it doesn't really work if you're on your own. I guess I knew things would get bad. But I thought we'd at least stick it out together. Yeah. Me too. Yeah, music's still around. This is the kind of music video you should leave it. No zoom or shit like that. I want to enjoy the animation, please. I really want to enjoy the the music video as I'm playing. I know I'm taking care of Listen, it. Kid. Sounds like it's controls and everything, but yeah. Your friends wanted different things. You should have known that. Uh, yeah. I think maybe a part of me knew. I just didn't want it to be true. Where are you gonna go from here? I don't know. Trish did say I could go solo, I guess. No. Fang. Hold up and look around you for a second. I'm trying. Fang, you've got skills and the making of something great, but you're better with your band. Happier with them. That means way more than making it big on your own. <laughs> what, too soft for you? Listen, if I was in this business for profit alone, I'd sign you as a solo act and ship you out on an apocalypse tour yesterday. There's a reason I stayed in this town and why I look for talent and kids like you. It's about community. Nothing's worth doing till the end of all things if you don't have people to share it with. When it comes down to it, I'd rather have people I love with me when the meteor hits than piles of money and whatever else comes with making it. And I think you would too, Fang. 
I don't know if that's possible anymore, though. I think I ruined everything. Fang, Trish still loves you. You know that, right? It's not the end of the world. Yet. And I love this fucking music. If it is there is an album about this music, I totally gonna get it. On Spotify, I have to actually look for that. I think it's time we kill Braxus. Okay, so uh, the end of time. I'll tell you what, you are so lucky I already had an extra character sheet for him. <laughs> Like you haven't been planning this as soon as I agreed to play? I admit nothing. Whatever. Thanks for agreeing to it, though. I think it'll be fun. Yeah. We could use some fun. So... We ready to kick some Braxis butt? Yeah. Ready as we'll ever be, I guess. All right, almighty DM. Take us away. Okay, here we are. Previously on LNL. After venturing to the misty mangroves, the vagrant got caught in the foliage, and the party had to abandon ship. Don't remind me. After that untimely evacuation, the team was ambushed by mushroom folk, who they defeated, and then. And then the mob bore us. Ew, no, gross. That was uncalled for. Uh, Reed, is there an HR department I can talk to? <laughs> and then the living mud of the swamp began sucking you down into its bottomless maw. Exactly what I said. The party was beset by terrible visions, but managed to escape and make their way to the foot of the blight tree. Which then proceed to pour Maya. Basically. I'm ignoring you and I am continuing my recap. The Blight Tree consumed Maya, leaving the rest of the party alone to fend off the living avatars of the swamp. And then we make them feel like shit. The party's psychic taunting freed Maya long enough to strike at the heart of the Blight and cleanse it, purifying the swamp. And within the tree, laid your prize. The Blight Bane Axe! With the god-killing blade in their possession, the party left the swamp, and Maya's hair looked amazing. Hmm, I wrote that in my notes. Maya did a great hair flip. In the last moments of our previous session, Faye, you had a vision. In it, you saw a sky lit on fire, and a voice amidst the blaze. Braxis, calling out to you. Spooky! Yeah, so where are we? Did that vision just happen? Time has passed since our last session. The crew of the Vagrant has been traveling, preparing for their final confrontation. Oh, so we're like in it. We are in it. The hulking metal frame of the airship cuts through the thick atmosphere, clouds and fog mixing together in a soupy haze. Yes. You all look up and see a swirling tempest in the distance, the source of the crimson glow. It's a whirlwind, a portal being opened, a doorway halfway stepped through. And then... A sudden clap of thunder erupts from the vortex and sends the vagrant crashing to the ground at its feet. Oh! Shit! Are you okay? Are you okay? Yeah. Head count, everyone, alright? Breathe? Yeah, oh yeah, everyone's alright. 
The ship, however, is downed. One moment, let me just... There we go. You all approach the spinning tempest, your teeth gritted. Is there anything anyone wants to do or say before we get into this? I don't think so. We're ready, right? We're ready. All right, here we go. There it goes. As much as we'll ever be. Yeah, let's kick some ass. All right. All right. As you get closer, you begin to make out a form at the center of the storm. A massive figure, their body glistening like a diamond. Death? Braxis. Fade. You hear his voice in your head suddenly. Hey! What do you do? Mm, let me talk to him. Let's be his ass. Let me talk to him. Uh, I respond. Praxis? There is no response. Hold up! Made it sound more mystical. Ah, uh, right. Praxis! With the right intonation, you hear a response. What does he say? Hello, old friend. What? Old friend? Enough talk! I charge in! Oh, yeah. Roll oh, chicken! Uh, okay. Roll for initiative. Okay, let's go! We need a. a 20. 90, damn it! 90! No, how did it fuck? It will be at 20. Still, I think I got first. Alright, let's smash this guy back wherever he came from. I send a slash of dark magic out of the blade of my sight. Roll for damage. Twenty, thanks! Critical hit! Twenty! There's my crit! I do 20 darkness damage. Braxis takes that straight to the face and screams in anger. Faye, you hear Braxis laughing in your mind and a splitting pain knocks you to your knees. Roll to resist. Okay, hell no, he's not gonna get in my, into my brain. Seven. Try to put up mental walls, but the attack hits you for a full 20 damage. What? That's more than my, half my life! Hands off, my friend, you psycho! Stop that, Faye! With my power and Linnea's combined, my leaves do extra slashing damage. Nice. 13 damage. You're up next, Ollie. I bash him with my guitar! Hell yeah, great damage on that. But roll to see if your guitar breaks. I can't believe you will take my guitar away from me. Maya, Braxis turns on you again. You hear his voice in your head now. You already lost! I take you out of first! Then the rest of them, one by one! Become paralyzed, locked to the spot, and you cannot feel your magic energy when you reach out for it. That's enough! My time to shine! I punt my fork at his chest, take him, and hello! Jeff Jeff, Super Soul, Power Blast! Did you, did you just make that up just now? It's a reskin of Divine Smite. I know what I'm doing. Damn, okay. Divine Smite is holy damage, so it's extra effective. He clutches his chest and drops to his knees. Hmm. Ah, ah, my wounds are grievous. I cannot go on. Wait, really? Wait, what? Hey, come to me before I pass on. Okay, seriously, what is his deal with me? Pesky, I gotta guess. Pitch me. I got errors. I feel like I might have an idea, but I'm not sure. Should I go to him? Maybe, but be careful. 
Okay, I approach the following Braxus. I reach out. You reach out. You hear his voice. Hello, child. I want to know more. I want to end this. I want to know more. Hi, why do you know know me? I sorry, sorry that's fake. <laughs> I he didn't like the, the, the poker. No, I, I thought it was the poker, sorry, that was fake. <laughs> Hi, what do you know me? What do you want from me? Ha! Still as brave as I remember. I'm just as foolish. It seems you still haven't recovered your memories. Allow me to return them to you. Suddenly, Braxis reaches out, his hand moving like lightning, too fast to dodge. He taps his finger against your forehead, Faye. And then you remember. I remember? It comes in flashes, not whole pictures. Almost like you're watching a movie. Like all this happened to someone else. You see a younger version of yourself. You see a family. And then comes a hand offering power. And then comes a pact, an agreement. You watch yourself enter into the service of Braxis. Fuck! Yeah, wow. Hey, are you okay? I'm processing. You remember now how you decided one day to deny your teacher. How you rebelled. And as punishment, you remember the day he stole your past. Your memories. Your family. Your brother. Brother? Oh, don't you remember? Here, allow me to reacquaint you. <clears throat> and hold on. Give us one second for this next part. Fang. All set. Huh? Reed? What are you up to? Nothing. Fang? Oh. I'll let him reveal it. Ah, uh, have you two been scheming? Maybe, yeah, just a bit. Everyone, we have a special guest joining us tonight. You wanna come in? It is I. Hey, everyone. No way! Shut up! Oh, Stella's is gonna be so jealous! <laughs> nah, sir, my dude! Oh my god, yay! Ah, uh, yes, yes, yes. Exactly the reaction I wanted. Yeah. Nice entrance. <laughs> Nailed it. Hey, thanks. Definitely more fun than the school assembly performance. <laughs> You're gonna be so good at this. Holy smokes! Why didn't I think of this before? Nice move. Thanks. I just wanted him to have some fun. Okay, photo unlock. Give me a moment. I wanna see... The, the photo. Okay, kept Redemption's arc. Ooh. Okay, okay, back in the game. Uh, hold on, let me remember where I was. <clears throat> Allow me to acquaint you. He snaps his fingers, and with a sudden flare of flame, someone appears before you. You all recognize him immediately. It is I! I summon him. Oh, I, I, I summon him to make a point! Hey, do you remember now? I. I do! Huh? Remember what? I'm their brother, Cat. Wait, you're Cat? Yep! H. Hi. Uh, hi, everyone! I knew you were dead! Finally! We can be together! Wait, what? <laughs> What's it this? Cap! Cap! And Faye are siblings? How oh, unpredictable! Of course we are! Okay, it actually makes sense. We were both brainwashed by the same evil god. We were young and we made a pact with Braxus together. But he did something to our minds. Made us forget each other. It, it was what either of us seen up for. 
Maybe not, but there was a time when you were both happy to serve me. You were my favorite disciples. It can't be like that again. What do you say? Take my hand. Don't do it! Silence! Wait, take my hand. I reach up. Wait, Faye! And I flip Braxus the bear. <laughs> I love my friends and I will never betray them. Never for you. Pathetic! You should be more afraid of me. Maybe, but I know something you don't know. Yeah, uh, what is that? Oh, I just know. Just that I had this. And then I pull out the axe. Mama! The evolution! Dan, 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 dan. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, uh, I didn't write that, damn it. That was time, that was time. Sorry. Oh! Oh my god! Hey! Foolish mortal! Maybe mercy for you was a mistake. But no matter, there is always time to correct the errors of the past. Braxis rises up, also transforming. There is a clap of thunder, and his body becomes painted by red light. Oh, look what I should have done centuries ago. Reduce this wind. Ah, damn it. Uh oh. That is out of time. Do you dare to try me? Your magic it comes for me. He hurls a bolt of lightning in you, which you barely dodge. Your pass confronts me. He throws another bolt. It's very immature. Everything you are, everything your will ever become, me. He readies another volley. Quick, let's hide behind this boulder. But you all take cover before it hits. We need a plan. We pin down. Someone needs to cause a distraction. Let me! I got the power of the swamp coursing through my veins! Are you sure speeding up is a good idea? We should split up, uh, we should go together. If one of us goes, we're all going, yeah? Yeah! Wait, wait, before we go, I think I owe you an apology. My love, you can do no wrong in my eyes. We can handle that later, after we win. Right now, we have a cut to deal with. Think what we stand a chance? Possibly. Definitely. Probably not. Okay? We got this. It's, it's a tall order, but we got this. And even if we don't, I'm glad we are facing it together. If we are going down, I wanna go down fighting. On three? Yeah! On three! One, two, three! Alright, I got a second win, but we're gonna need a. Damn it! Damn it, I got win this is time! <laughs> okay, support someone. Attack. I'm gonna support someone. I'm gonna boost someone. In this new form, I have a bunch of cool spells I want to try. Try out. Cast a dark weapon on Kev, cast energy shorns linea, cast con contagion on Hol holy guitar. Cast contagion on holy guitar. Oli, I cast contagion on your guitar. Oh hell yeah! So it's poison guitar, poison damage. We can make it as as slimy and rapey like mango. Okay, sure. It's covered in bright orange slime. All right, time for me to join the fray. I got stone to try and grab a ball of Praxus mine to hit him with a basic damage. All right, that'll be a tough one since he knows all your tricks. Give me a roll. Nine? Okay, great. Let's say you've been working on some tricks that Praxus hasn't seen and you get past his defenses. 
You see him shake his head, trying to clear it, but you've definitely thrown him off. Bunny child, I taught you everything you know. Go oh, there, you corner me. He lashes out with his tail and knocks your spear out of your hand. Oh god, I don't know what to do. Hey, be careful, you still hurt. I'm going to cast healing hands on them before they take any more damage. Great, paint me a picture. I run over to Faye and... Uh, you grab my hands. Oh, okay, yeah, I grab your hands and... And bow over them, whispering my healing charm. So cute. Roll to see how much health you regain, Faye. All right, now me, you, you have to go, you have to let go of my hands. Wait, can you roll for me? <laughs> okay, ah, uh, Ray, can you roll for me? <laughs> Eighty. Eighty. I feel invincible. I'm gonna snap this guy's stupid hell in half. Thanks, Lidl. I'll whip you all off the face of this planet! You see Braxis's halo start spinning faster and faster, and then it suddenly flies out and slashes the people closest to him. That looks like Faye, Kef, and Ollie. You all take 12 damage as a searing pain runs across your chest. Oh, come on, I just got killed. Maya, you're up. I need some input. I could try to cast... Entangle on this guy or I could heal. Uh, immobilize. Immobilize him. Right. That way anyone that's looking after me can get be better hit. Roots birth from the ground around where Braxos is floating and grab onto these many limbs. Alright. He beats his wings violently and starts trying to rip himself out, but for now, he won't be able to move much. Perfect! She's sitting duck! I cast on the club, sending out a bolt of sound waves right ahead. And thanks to that contagion spell from earlier, all my attacks also inflict poison. Poison sound! Braxis wraps his wings around his head to buffer against your attack, but your sound wave rips handfuls of feathers out as it rolls into him. Once the air calms, he opens his wings back up and blasts you back ten feet. Oh no! I think my guitar flies out of my hand and sticks it across the floor, all bent up. Let's not waste time. I start with my fork right at his stupid wear nasty face. Okay, and since he's immobilized, you can actually stab him twice. And then, an evil cackle! <laughs> Oh, you're trying to your best, but that still is very cute laugh. Alright folks, blast him with magic, attack him, attack with Kef, attack with Oli. Attack with Kef! Twelve! Kef, attack him with me! Ready where you are! Kef, you're bloody! Your blood has weakened it. It's not too late to to return to me. I show you, Wick. We both aim our weapons and then hit him with rays of darkness. That's a good roll. Times two. Damn. Braxis looks truly shaken for the first time. Enough! Attack with Lanera. Attack with Maya. Uh, attack with Lanera. Eighteen! Nice! Yeah, yeah, I can I can finish him off, but I need your help. Right, I cast Writer's Fury on Faye. It's over, Braxus. You better mess with anyone's memories again. I launch a flurry of missiles of wild light out of my wings. Straight for Braxus' heart. Wow. The portal Braxus came through begins to... What? Look at it. Ah, uh, okay. Light. Lights out. Shit. The portal shits? No, Sage. It does not shit. 
<laughs> These are getting a lot more frequent. Yeah. Okay, power's back. Uh, there we go. Back to the game? Uh, sure. Where were we? Um, uh, the portal Braxis came through begins to turn in on itself, pulling him back inside. Holy shit! Did we do it? Woohoo! God, what's a rush? Let's not celebrate just yet. Ollie's right. The portal continues collapsing, but suddenly you feel it start to pull at you. Uh oh. That can be good. It isn't. The vortex twirls violently, growing as it consumes matter. Around you, light begins to bend, and everything begins breaking down. Is it this? Is it the end? There's so much I never got to say. I'm not ready. I'm okay. We're together. It's okay. We're together. We're all here. That's what matters. We won. The portal lets out a howl. And underneath your feet, gravity has inverted. You rise, your feet floating through the air. What happens next? What's on the other side of the portal? I don't know. No one knows. The portal sucks you in. And then closes like a zipper behind you. And that's it. Behind you, the portal closes. Sealing yourselves and Braxis away. For a long time, you drift through the void. Dreaming. You see glimpses of memories. Happy moments. Loose ends you never got to resolve. Eventually, though... You start to lose grip. It becomes too hard to hold on to yourselves in the Tempest. You have to let go. And so you do. You all, one by one, let yourself go in the portal. I wish I could tell you where you end up, but I don't know. I like to think it's somewhere nice, though. What I do know is that the world you left behind was saved. People will live and die happy lives, in peace, because of what you all did. They won't remember you, or even know you existed. But they'll be there because of you. Beyond that, though, I'm not sure. My guess is as good as yours. That's it. The end, I guess. Mm. That was sad. So, that's it? We died? Dead, dead? Like, no, no coming back. No plot twist. Yeah. Yeah. The story ends here. Hmm. Well... It was a great session, Reed. Thanks for hosting us. Later, guys. Bye. I better get going, too. Bye, guys. This was... fun. I'm gonna text Stella about the reveal. She'll be so jealous. See ya! Well, that... didn't go as planned. Not it. Your entrance was perfect. You killed it. And then you killed us, Reed? What the hell? Yeah, I don't know. Hard to think of a good ending right now. At least y'all went out together. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, after that. Okay. Yeah. It's kinda sad, but that's, that's it, I guess. We're gonna Here die? I am. We're gonna... Lost, alone, broken. Uh... Lost. No mountains on the horizon. No stars in the sky. Something, something. Hmm? Don't even try I can't even find me So why 
why should you try? What the hell went wrong? And can I fix it with a song? Hmm. You know, gang. Will you guys be down to come to the pit? There's something I need to say. In person. Good picture. Good picture. Okay, I guess this is the last night we're gonna get together right before I get in <laughs> I, I get in there. <laughs> I'm not in that in that in that in that fucking asteroid, so that's part of my my story. What's up? You're so dramatic. It's what gives me my sparkle. It kinda is. Thanks for coming though. I was nearby. Saves me from falling down another hole of doomsday videos when I get home. Like, did you know solid rock can liquefy if you hit it hard enough? Ah, I do now. Hey, at least when it happens, you won't be surprised. Ah, uh, yeah, that's kind of my whole personality. Hey, look, about everything. I... We're interrupting! Hello! Hey, y'all. It's good to see you. What have you been up to? Oh, you know, the usual. Uh, lying face down on the floor. <laughs> I've been flying a lot, actually. Oh, yeah? See anything cool? Actually, yeah. You can't fly? <laughs> Sorry. I know you're a paralactic, but I didn't know you could fly. Hey! I'm glad you came. Me too. Um, Nasser gave me a lift. He was... I think it's good you invited him. The Strish and Rosa. Try not to make it weird, please, Fang. <laughs> this is the last night we're together, I guess. Be cool, I don't know. Okay, ah, uh, that's normal. Don't fuck this up. Ah, shit, I. Whoa, when did you get here? I've been here the whole time. Ninja, that's where you are, now, sir. <laughs> okay, well, you're welcome. It's nice that you're here. <laughs> hey, everybody. I, uh, I kind of have something to say. I was messing with some music earlier, and I thought I could say it with a song or something, but, um, well, it's like, I guess I just wanted to, um, okay, look. You guys are my best friends. Every time things get weird, we're still here. And now, stuff is really, really messed up. And I don't think it's just gonna go back to normal. But you all answered my text. And we're still here. Whatever happens, even if nothing is ever okay again, I want us to be okay. I don't want us to give up on each other. Ever. I... Ugh. I love you guys. Wait. Did you just heal us with the power of friendship? I mean, I don't feel worse. <laughs> I don't know. You're weird, but you're brave. Things are crazy right now. It's okay if we're a little crazy sometimes, too. And I had this feeling we'd end up here. I just didn't know how. You did that. To being okay. To being less than great, but more than dead. Here, here. 
Nice. Of course, we're gonna get drunk as fuck, right? <laughs> I thought I was gonna I love that. You're funny. He's funny. How come you've kept us apart so long? Yeah, Sib. Why do you keep me locked in the basement? Dude, <laughs> I don't even know you. <laughs> now all I need is to be a permanent LNL member. Dude, was that even a question? You totally stole the show last session. My dear Kev. Why are you looking at me like that? Bang, help. You got yourself into this. <laughs> you got me into this. Oh, right. Well, I don't care. Ah, oh, mages. Am I right? Hmm, I'm not sure. Parts are the weird ones, if you ask me. <laughs> LJ. Hey, fan, how's it going? Um, good, everything okay? Listen, I have some bad news. It's about the... Yeah, it, I'm very sure. Like, okay? So, with everything going on, just isn't going to work to put on a show. The size of color of a There we go. Okay. Yeah, smaller is better, I guess. Yeah, smaller show will probably be better right now. That's not what I'm talking about. I'm calling it. I'm calling it. Clara Fest can happen, not now. So, what's happened now? Try not to let it in your head, okay? Turn on those friends you were talking about. Music isn't the only thing you got going on you. I'm gonna bore that lava, ja lava java. I can't stand to see things get bad there. I had to get to the cabin in the woods to wait out, whatever this is. I'm sorry, Frank, really. It was real pleasure to work together. Take care of yourself. Thank you. You too. Okay. Even if it's for an independent film, if I never see a guy make out with a weight bench ever again, it'll be the best thing that's ever happened to me. Well, anyway, I have his number if anyone's looking for a weird time. You find the worst guys. Maybe Fang can get him to direct one of their music videos. Yeah, I would love that. <laughs> I can see it, actually. Was that mom on the phone? <laughs> Why? So you can narc about us drinking beer? Nah, it was LJ. I was just asking. Don't worry about it. Are you sure? It doesn't seem like nothing. Well, it's about Caldera Fest. Got a rib, uh, band aid got a something to blow. What the hell, like, what the hell, like it is? No rodeos around. Apparently, Caldera Fest is too complicated to run right now. So all that stuff I was saying before about staying sane doesn't really apply to me anymore. Oh, Fang, I'm sorry. <sighs> Figures. Sorry, man. You've been killing yourself over this. That's not fair. Yeah. Sucks, dude. It's weird. I feel like I should be more upset than I am. I mean, I'm not thrilled, but I'm also weirdly, like, at peace. It's all I've thought about for a year, and right now, I'm just relieved you guys are here. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, Caldera Fest doesn't... Doesn't make my laugh cheer me up. Come on, have my back. Keep me honest when I mess up, but love me anyway. Who needs the future when you have all your friends in the present, right? Seriously? This was your big thing. How can you say it, it just doesn't matter? How are we supposed to just be fine? What else are we gonna do? It's not like we can stop it. I know, but that doesn't... That doesn't mean we can pretend everything is okay. No one's pretending, Naomi. Yeah, there are some things that just can't be changed. Better to accept reality for what it is. No point in getting upset about it. Maybe for you guys, but some of us had plans for the future. Excuse me? Uh, guys, it's 
It's easy for you guys to give up on everything, but I, I had so much planned. I have so many things I've worked on that I'll never get to see. What, you think you're the only one? Sage isn't gonna get to be a chef, Fang isn't getting Caldera Fest. Yeah, but what about you? Were you planning on letting the cards choose a career for you? Naomi, are you actually talking about a career right now? There's way more to life. Easy for you to say. Some people want more from life than deliveries and board games. Whoa, cool it. You of all people should understand where I'm coming from, Trish. Yeah, but I care more about my friends than my career. What? You had no problems letting your career get between us. Oh my god, are you kidding me? You avoid me all the time, and the world is gonna end any fucking day now. <sighs> That's rich coming from you. You're like the most avoidant person I know. You need to cool down. Fine, whatever. Now that your dream is canceled, I guess we should all just accept our fates. Oh, fuck off, Naomi. Hey! Hmm. That go well, very well. I think you nailed it. <laughs> Hmm. Stella, Rosa, and I don't have Sage. Okay, I'm gonna go talk to Rosa. Rosa's neat. Uh, hey, mind if I sit? Go for it. How are you feeling right now? Oh, like shit. <laughs> Makes sense. That was... pretty rough. Mm. Understatement of the decade. How are you doing? Honestly? Honestly. Not great. Things are kind of rough with my family right now. That sucks. I'm sorry. Yeah, well... At least I have my supportive and emotionally balanced friends to help me work through it. Right? Sorry. It's fine. I'm just teasing. What's going on with your family? Well, things have already been tense for a while. Like, not since I came out to them. My parents have come around. They've been great, but... You know, how, like, cultural barriers are a thing that makes it hard to get to know your family. When you grow up in a different place than they do, that gap only widens when you're trans. Yeah. I have definitely been there. My parents are dealing, but there are a ton of cousins and, and relatives that I'll never really know. I don't think it'll ever be safe for me to come and visit them. And before I came out, I had to like, weigh that. If transitioning is worth losing my family and my family's culture. Exactly. That's kind of what's happening for me right now. Since everything's ending, my parents are trying to figure out how we can see family again. Or if we want to be with them when it hits. And I bet the whole gender thing doesn't help. Yeah. There are some parts of the family that don't want me with them as I am right now. And I think I'd rather be with people who do. I'm really glad I know you, Fang. I wish we had more time. I'm glad I know you too, Rosa. Sucks that you were just second grade volcano girl to me for so long. <laughs> oh my god, I know. <laughs> that volcano's gonna follow me to the grave. <laughs> I don't know. I wish we had more time too. But I I'm glad we had time together at all. And it, it doesn't feel like we're missing connections, if that makes sense. We know each other better than that, at least. Yeah. I feel like we've been friends forever. Is that weird? Hmm, kinda. I mean... I just hear so much about you and read from Trish. Really? Huh. I figured you two would just be in bug mode the whole time. <laughs> Don't get me wrong. There's plenty of that. But Trish has a lot to say about everything. Especially you. Ooh, I hope it's not all bad. Ask Trish yourself. 
I'm not telling. But unlocked. Okay, give me a moment. I'm gonna see. Surprise and friendship. I'm glad we met. I will. Thanks, Rosa. Hmm. Yeah, Rosa is neat. Too bad she had a really bad, really bad time. Time to sell this before everything goes to hell, I guess. Are we talking to people now? I think we do. <laughs> I think we did. Okay. Widow man or Nasser dude? Uh, I'm gonna go talk with Nasser first. I'm not sure. Can we actually talk with all of them? That would be already cool. Hey. Is, is she... Don't know. I decided to give her some space. You might have better luck, though. Got it. Yeah, I'll I'll do that in a bit. Never thought I'd see Naomi go off on someone like that. Ugh. Me neither. Never thought I'd see you tell her to fuck off either. Ugh. I can't believe I said that. Neither can I. Naomi is gonna hate me forever. Probably. She's gonna dance on my grave. Most likely. She is gonna save the whole planet from the meteor with her super science brain and then choose to leave me behind and watch me get flattened. Yep, all that and more. <laughs> You're not great at this whole reassurance thing, Nasser. Oh, is that what we were doing? I thought we were wallowing in much deserved guilt after you cussed out my best friend. I didn't mean to say it. I didn't want to hurt her. You never do, but it keeps happening. Mm. She's liked you for a while, Sib. She's not exactly subtle. Maybe you never cared enough to notice. Hey. And has always been your priority. It's easy to get left behind. Not just Naomi, either. Oh. I'm sorry, Nasser. It's fine. Well, it's not. But I kept myself busy. So, wasn't a total abyss of despair. Yeah, no, I've got dibs on the abyss. If you want in, you gotta pay rent. Seriously though, I, I had no idea you felt this way. Even if I never noticed, you hide it pretty well. Hmm. Skills acquired for many years of being the good child and keeping mom off my back. I can't believe you had to put any work into being the favorite. I thought I made it easy for you. Nope. I took a lot to get up on this shining pedestal. You make it look effortless. And you make it hard. It's hard sometimes, watching you do whatever you want. Our parents pin all their expectations for normal on me, even if I don't want normal. Don't worry. I'll let them know you're a freak too. Freak? <laughs> Coming from you? They'll never believe it. Hmm. Thanks for coming out tonight, Nasser. I'm glad you're here. And I'm glad I got to play L and L with you guys. That was fun. Good, because I am never letting you and Reed hang out ever again. You can't keep us apart, Fang. It's destiny. Well, you're in too deep now. Good luck getting rid of us. I wouldn't have it any other way. Now go apologize to Naomi before she kills us both. Okay, give me a moment. I wanna see the picture. Love you totally, bro. Okay, Trish and Naomi. I'm not sure if I'm gonna I'm gonna go with Trish. Wait, with Naomi first. I'm sure if we go with Trish now. I'm gonna fix this first. Naomi, I. What do you want, Fang? From me. What? <sighs> Listen, Naomi, I, I'm... I'm really, really sorry for everything. I can't believe what I said earlier. I'm so sorry. I don't want to be like this with you, ever. 
All of this stuff, it's, it's just a lot. I feel like I'm drowning in everything and I barely know how to tread water. And I know that's not an excuse to treat you like shit. I know I've let things fall apart. I mean, I've, I've made things fall apart. And now I'm trying to fix it. And I just don't know how. I've never been the glue before. Or like, tried to hold things together at this scale. You're... You're much better at this than I am. <laughs> I really am. <laughs> yeah. So messed up. <laughs> it is. Everything is insane right now. I always had a lot to focus on. And this year feels like I've been desperately trying to fill the time with more and more anything to keep from thinking too hard. Am I part of that? When it comes to you, I can't stop thinking too hard. I don't know. What do you need from me? I need to reach the end of something before... I need to know what this is, Fang. Us. More than friends. Friends. Ah, we're gonna die, so why not experience love for Alice? One time in our lives. <laughs> Just say. If it wasn't for you, I I don't think I would have survived this year. Even when I didn't know it was you, you kept me grounded. You helped me achieve one of my oldest dreams. I'm done keeping you waiting. Whatever time we have left, I want to spend it with you. I want to be here with you. I want to face it all together. If you still want that. I want it. <sighs> Nasser is going to be insufferable about this. <laughs> oh, it's going to be a spectacle. I mean, Naomi actually was supported even if we didn't know, or Bang didn't know it was her. So, I think it was the correct, the, the correct idea to actually at least have some, some kind of relationship with her. So, yeah. Let's just try it. You never know. Okay, now to settle up with our best friend. It's... it's a nice night. Yeah. Is that all you got right now? Uh, yeah, um, the rough draft is still coming together. Listen, Trish... I'm... I'm sorry. I haven't been a good friend lately, or, like, at all. I've been doing whatever I want and ignoring what you want and with everything that's happening with you and Rosa and bug stuff and the future, I think I'm, I'm scared that you just don't want me around anymore and I, I miss you. I haven't gone anywhere. It feels like you have, though. Or that you're about to. Like you're about to disappear if I don't hold on tight. And I think that makes me hold on a little too tight. <clears throat> a little? Okay, a, a lot. But still... Well... You're right. I don't want you around. I 
need you around, dude. You're my best friend. Wherever I am, whatever I'm doing, I want to be able to share that with you. We don't have to love the same things. We still love each other, right? But you weren't sharing stuff with me, though. You were sharing it with Rosa and leaving the band. What? Dude, if you had gotten your Caldera Fest brainworms out of there for like one second, I... Never mind. Listen, when have I ever not shared stuff with you? You and Reed are constantly telling me that I know too much about arthropods and need to talk less about the mechanics of worm mating. <laughs> okay, fair. But I don't know. It just felt like there wasn't any room for me in your life the more into it you got. And when you said you wanted out of the band, that felt like it was just the final nail in the coffin. I will always have room for you, dumbass. Worms forever? <laughs> Worms forever. Better about my flies. <laughs> I don't like worms. <laughs> and again, Fag also established that she doesn't like worms as well, so... Okay, let me worms. Ah. Alright, we spent a really good night together, I guess. Or at least we try. Caldera Fest. We'll do it ourselves. We're gonna go out. We're gonna go out with the show of the century. All of us. The eight members of Worm Drama. Hey, if you guys want to. Uh, Fang, that was incredibly cringe. And I love you. Hmm. Raging against the meteor. I like it. I am the obvious choice for Hype Man MC. <laughs> You're probably the... Can't roll the end credits without a closing track, right? Let's melt some faces. And skulls. Brains! Wait! Don't we need, like, a place? Shit! You're right! We need a venue. No Lava Java. Wait a sec. Mr. President. Hold on. It's cool. It's cool, guys. One more speech. <clears throat> I... Before this year, I had all these plans. And when my future became a maybe, I held on so hard. Too hard. I'm sorry. I kind of freaked out, and I just... I guess I wanted to say... We know. Who needs a future when all my friends are in the present? Oh, um... One more thing. Um, since we've been inducted into the band, we need to do a pre-show ritual, don't we? Naomi... You worked so hard on that. We can't. It's time to let go. I'm here now, with you. And I can't think of any better tribute for the worm gods of music. So we awarded it. So that's why we were awarded it. I vote yes. I don't think this is a voting type situation? I mean, it does kind of belong to all of us. Or it was supposed to. It does. You did a great job. So, what do you say, Faye?
just in case that the music is really neat. I, I definitely gonna get this music in, in Spotify. If there is. I hope there is. Okay, get in the band back together. Forty-eight hours to do all this. Okay. Good morning, warm drama. Yo. I'm in the band. Smile star. Hello. From the room literally across from you. Sup, worms. Let's go. Good morning. Okay, so Casara Fest. So you are going to spread shit I'm sent. Everyone knows there's a task. It doesn't. <laughs> oh Reed, I need your email. Sorry, sorry, you're breaking up. Nothing work on text, dude. Mm. Reed, you're on your equipment with me. Gotta pick up from Lava Java. Roger that. Okay, great. Colera Fest, we got this. I feel like we need an official starting board. Like start? Spaghetti? Um, now I know that I'm having for dinner tonight. Focus people! They give us a signal... We're gonna stay sing the uh, signal pang. Kick us with... With a good energy. Uh, go. Godspeed worms. Godspeed worms. Hey yeah! Nobi. Hey. If you are not too busy with Casara Fest stuff, do you want to go out later? Tonight, I mean. Yeah, why not? Yes. Okay, yay! I might have a little surprise plan for you. Nothing big. But I think you will like it. Trish. Hey, warm lord. Wanna come over there later? Um, duh. When though, I just made plans with Naomi. I see how it is. Let me make for new or cuter model. <laughs> yep, I'm trying to do it. <laughs> hang, on, hang after we met the video secure. Absolutely. See you later, nerd. Okay, I think we are starting to literally go in at the end, the end game. Looks like that's the last of him. So, you're really gonna do your own Caldera Fest, huh? Absolutely, maybe if we can. Yeah, absolutely. I'm gonna go all the city. We are. I knew you got it. Now is the perfect time for a concert. I mean, what else are we gonna do? Um, LJ. You should come to our show. Whether you wanna, you want to come to our show? I gotta ask. Do you wanna come to Caldera Fest? I mean, our version of it. Front row, kid. <laughs> cool. Hmm. Nice. We own we own her a lot. So why not? We we call him by her. Progress check. Killing it too. Killing it, obviously. Snacks are on the way. I'll go here. Read. Wait. I'm not, I'm not sure how, what is that. <laughs> w, I'm not sure. Okay. We got the equipment from LG. Awesome. I finished the uh, itinerary. Once everything is at the venue, we can start set up proper. Amazing! Rosa and I are on the roof, getting all the plans arranged. Help me with Naomi's part. Kind of. She did most of it. Ah! We're really doing this!
Okay, I'm very, uh, we all know that that's Reed's van. So yeah, Reed had a van. That's cool. Ugh. I hate this. Hey, sounds like everything's totally chill in here. Go away. I'm fine. Help. I'm gonna ask you for help. Ugh, can you help? I, I can't. I, I can't. I can't. I can't. I, I just hate all my clothes. All of them? Because that's a lot of hate. All of them. Oh my god. She told you. So, what's the plan? You gonna kiss Naomi? <laughs> Come on, Nasser. Out. Out. Yeah. <laughs> I know I knew he was going to be unsufferable with this. Whoa. Yeah. I also wasn't sure what you'd like, so I have two different kinds of juice, and I probably brought way too many snacks. <laughs> Wait, do you like beetle rolls? I know some people are allergic. No, they're great. This is all so great. Okay, good. Now, so you don't have to wear it, and it's totally cool if you don't, but we kept talking about your songs, and it just inspired me to make this outfit, but... But I know you probably want to wear your own thing for the show, but just in case. Anyway, I made you an outfit, but like, yeah, that's a surprise. <laughs> Can I see it? No way, that rules. You're so sweet. No way, that rules. You made me an outfit. That's the coolest thing I have ever heard. Can I see it? So that's a cool uniform. <laughs> that looks like a cool uniform. Okay. I mean, I mean um, some of the stitches are crooked. I was trying to finish it in time. Do you like it? Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> Naomi, it's it's amazing. Definitely wearing this on stage. Yeah, I'm gonna have to wear it on stage. She made it for me. It would be not I am nice. Absolutely actually. wearing this on stage. Really? I'm glad you like it. I really do. It's maybe the nicest gift someone has ever given me. Take a hand, take it slow. Ah, take a hand. Let's... It's not... There's no time to take it slow. We're gonna die eventually. <laughs> this is nice. It is. I guess something good came out of this terrible year. It did. No thanks to the meteor. So, um... Oh, I told my parents about you. You did? They were happy, but got all weird and formal about it. My dad actually used the term paramour. And my mom opened a bottle of sparkling rhubarb wine. Maybe you can meet them sometime. I'd like that. I wish I had my guitar. I wonder what she's thinking about. Mm. I wish I had my guitar. I wish I brought my guitar. <laughs> you know, I think this is the best spot in the whole city. Even better than Lava Java. I don't know. Lava Java is pretty special. Especially with you on stage. <laughs> Thanks. You too. <laughs> huh? Yeah, that totally is not for me. I meant it was special playing up there. Playing for you. Oh. Nice save. Oh, our song! We never finished it. Oh, yeah, I, I guess not. Wanna take a stab at it? Sure. Okay, let's see. We won't sit around and let the world go by. Okay, we 
won't back down. We are in a rise. We're gonna take a breath. Hold on, this one. We're gonna take a breath. Hold our head up high. Actually, no, this one. We won't sit around with the world go by. Okay, and the fire falls from the high, and then the end is times to crystallize. And in the love we have internalized. And in the love we have internalized. We're gonna take a stand, we won't comply. With everything we got, we gotta try. We got, we're gonna take control, we won't say goodbye. We're gonna take control, won't say goodbye. We're never gonna grow up, we're never gonna forget, we're never gonna go down. We're gonna, never gonna go forget. You like it? That's perfect. Level story. Okay, give me a moment. I'm gonna see the picture. To as to as many of those knights we can get. Ah, that's cute. Okay, not sure how much time we actually have. Uh, man, I want a little bit to spread my legs a little bit. You know what? Let's let's continue until it's finished. Then I'm gonna spread my legs a little bit. Ah, damn it, my legs. I can feel them. Hey. Hey. Um. How's it going? Fine. Everything okay? Looks like she's concerned. So everything okay? You good? Nothing's wrong. Well, actually, no. That's not true. Uh. I, I just got a call from mom and dad. Okay. They're still stuck. Everywhere's a no-fly zone, apparently. Something about falling debris and keeping the skies clear. Okay. Um, so when will they be back? Um, they don't know. Like, no one knows. Because I guess they might not ever. I don't know. It's bad. So, yeah, um, I'll be in the living room if you need me. Hey, I hope you don't mind that I used your shampoo. Fang? Fang, what's wrong? My parents aren't coming home, and planes aren't flying. And I might never see them again. That sucks. Wow. I'm so sorry, Fang. Gosh, I fully expected your mom and dad to be at Seafest, like, I don't know, telling us we're too loud or something. Or that my armpits are showing. It really sucks. I remember that. I wish I could just melt my brain for today. I guess all I can do is just focus on the concert. Melt brain. Just for today. Is he okay? I think he's having a moment. Fireworks? Fireworks! Yeah! Yeah, if everything is going to blow up, why not have a little, a last one night of fun? <laughs> of course, of course, you were tempted with your own health. Also, that's how fun actually flies. Nice! <laughs> Okay, there it goes. <laughs> Why don't you use the, the front door? Why well, use the front door? No, nobody's gonna tell. Man, it sucks that the end of the world is so pretty. Right? 
It's hard to feel like everything's gonna be gone when it looks so beautiful right now. I love you guys. Love you too, dude. You too. Mm. Well, that was the last time I that I see my prince, I guess. I think you should put them in front. Yeah. Mm-hmm. No, accessible stuff's always off to the side. Yeah, it sucks. Mm-hmm. Hey, S Stella, w one sec. I gotta pick her up in a bit. You good to get to school? Yeah, Reed's gonna be here soon. Okay, great. Sorry, I know I promised breakfast, but I think... No, uh, Fang. Yeah, I, uh... Mm-hmm. I got it. Oh, sorry, yeah, 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 I'm still here. Uh... Okay, Reed is here. Oh. My. God! Hey, it's a... Yeah, it's a logo I did. Wait, wait, that's... You you did it! You actually did it! Yeah. I kind of messed up the... Uh, you barely notice. Hmm, that's great! Honestly, this is incredible. I mean, your design is doing all the work. <laughs> but I guess all the scribbling for L, &L paid off. Will you get in the van before the world ends, please? I'm admiring art. <laughs> yeah. Unbelievable. No respect for your craft. Ah, oh, the both sides. That's good. That's cool. Okay, we are gonna make our own concert. That's pretty near right. Before, you know, before we die. And I'll bring the fucking meteor theme all over the place. But hey, I'm in that meteor. <laughs> I'm not sure if I see dinosaurs while I'm was landing. All I see is I'm just a burst of flame. Then I died. Then I revived. Something was a fucking inferno. Then I died again. Then I. Then everything was. The oxygen was not. I was literally all diamond dust, but then I got a game for a lung infection. And over and die all over again until I was I was in really proper condition for me to actually not die anymore. <laughs> okay, we will. Uh, okay, we are watching profiles again. Okay, we're gonna watch wild profiles again. Let's see. We are not trapped under the meteor. The meteor is trapped here with us. I respect Nick Antagonist's brand of weapons. Being out here is better than walling in my room, I guess. Our moms are friends, but we will never get that close. Okay, can have shit in Pagnia. Mess one viral pause away from being fully flanked content creator. At least I'm here with you. Oh my god. Has Francesca finally told Mel they're having feelings for her? Now this time. If I have to die on impact, I'm going to die looking cute. Danny is really active with extracurricular arts, but they're strangely a huge gamer. I have no idea where their friends the time for for all. I'm only outside because they shut down the last Fairy Tales 30 servers. If it was up to me, I would reading until the meteor hit, the per hit me personally. Chris and I are neighbors. We used to hang out as kids, but they never really left the house after they started playing, playing last Fairy Tale 13. Is that, a, is that a wing to Final Fantasy 13? I'm very sure it is. Maybe if we try hard enough, we can post our way out of this. I never met anyone who exists on the perfect in intersection of God 
and jumps his head for that one. The rock got gently. Alexis is cool, but she's always felt like a literature professor in a teenager's body. Why do we insist on posting them there's a situation? I don't know much about Sam, but I know they're like weird little creatures, I bet he'd move mango. The, do you think we'll, we'll be able to see it coming? They're pretty cool. I wish I had met her summon this year. Okay, anybody else? Yeah, there's one. There's literally like a week next in the existence, and you still, still spoiling TV shows finalists on here. Let me have one thing. Marty's funny as hell, but I can never tell which of their posts are cry for help. The video better wait till the concert's over. I see to key. I'm not sure how that what that means. <laughs> Stooch. I'm Stooch. 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 I'm not sure. Stuch? You can always count on Morgan to show up with the concert really for for the rock. Well, this time I think it's real so over. A surprise turn here instead of bringing shows at home. Go ahead, Kate. I just hope that when it hits, it's quick. Alana's sweetheart. We had a few classes together freshman year. Well, that's all of them, I guess. Ready to fight God? Hey, oh my gosh, you look amazing. I'd be scared of you if we weren't already friends. You're so hot! How are you feeling? Big. Ish. Big, big. Yeah, it's packed out there! I mean, that's what we wanted, right? Right. Hey, d did I rope you all into this? Did I make it all about me? My show? Our show. Wish Mom was here. We're screaming this. They'll see it. I I think I need to call them. Nasser, can you? On it. <clears throat> Mom, look at you. Mom, not not now, please. You look wonderful. Very grown up. Very cool. This is a wonderful thing you are doing, Patricia. Hello. Oh, look at you all. Hi. I'm sorry. It's time for the show to start. Right. I have to go out first then. <clears throat> gotta work the crowd. <gasps> um, Mom, Dad, we gotta go. Love you. I love you. I love you. Play a good show, okay? <laughs> we'll be here. Right here. Yes, this is it. Are we playing or? Well, if that if we are playing, I'm gonna try to Ooh, okay. make it perfect. Here we go. Bang! We each have something for you. For good luck. Thanks, Rosa. Fang, for luck, I bestow upon you my most treasured, my most lucky, my most plastic. Gispecho. I don't think I can actually use that. Oh, Sage. Thank you. I, I, I just, I can't bring this on stage, though. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Well, that's okay. I'll hold it for you. But the luck will be right here if you need it. You're safe with me, Smacho. <laughs> it sounds like fucking. What the cards have in store? Why should with that? Yeah, let's do it. Okay, minute one, just as always. Thanks for holding on. Oh, I knew 
you get that card. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Really? Yep. I rigged it. Hey, we're taking charge of our own destiny here. So, Three of Cups is like, mm, about a big celebration, like this one. But more than that, it represents community, togetherness, mutual shared celebration. It's not about any one person. It's about you, us, and the willingness to put aside individual wants for collective needs. You've been a really good friend, Fang. I'm so glad we got to put on this show and come together like this. Stella, I... Just take the card. My turn now. Plus one to charisma. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I feel it. <laughs> Come here, dude. One more for the road. Hmm. Yeah, bad Rachel. Okay. Wait. Ugh. Now I'm fully powered up. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna ruin the moment by saying, "Are you sure God doesn't want that thing to be killed?" <laughs> okay, I guess we are doing. Hello. Caldera Bay! How are we feeling tonight? <laughs> Welcome to the last concert you'll ever see! I know you're all dying to see worm drama right now. Am I right? No, no, that's no, no, just no. <laughs> that got dark! Who's ready for some music? <laughs> for real though, thanks so much for coming out to our little show. It really means a lot to us. We live in a strange world. But right here, tonight, maybe it's ours. Now, while I have you here, I've prepared some spoken word poetry just fucking with you. I give you word drama! <sighs> okay, here we go. I'm pretty sure we're gonna play, right? Yeah, if the zombies over here, I'm pretty sure we play. Yeah. 
My complaint is still the same. I want go up to actually get rid of that. Zoom. It's fucking annoying. And I wanna I only really literally wanna see all the fucking pictures. I'm not sure if I did it. All with a gun. All with a bang. But I tried to my best to actually nail it all. <laughs> Thank you. Our next song is about going home. And that's why I am actually okay. You want some extra? <laughs> Let's, uh, give me a moment. I gotta turn it up a little bit. There we go. If you want an, an extra thing about what happened after that, that's me actually dropping in inside the, the fucking world <laughs> in the barrier. <laughs> Again, that's how I actually get in, in in this world. If you're actually asking, how the fuck this crazy demon get in here? That's me. Well, technically, that's how I actually get it. I didn't get in there by, uh, by my, my own choice. So, yeah, I totally didn't do that on purpose. But, yeah, that's how I actually get in this in this world. <laughs> anyway, um, the game is literally good. I'm not gonna tell you that. There are, there are some parts that literally put my nerves out. Like, for example, the fucking... Uh, Video, video music. I fuck that. I fucking hate the zoom on the fucking video, video music. Come on, Koa, please, please, I beg you. I'm gonna go in your fucking houses and I'm like, gonna really, literally, hit you, put you in your fucking neck until you fix. Take out the fucking zoom out of the. Video! Alright, come on. Come, together? Together. Please, get rid of the zoom of the of the animations. I wanna see the whole picture. There is a lot of pictures that we were I you can only see the flash of the whole picture. But we were able to actually appreciate that and I fucking hate that. I literally fucking hate and I hope in co-op literally say, you know what? Let's get rid of the zoom thingy because I don't, I, I, w I wanna actually see all the, those other pictures that, that happen at the, uh, at the end. There was a lot of pictures that I literally was th thinking that they were nice. And again, it's not because I can totally multitask on seeing in the background and totally play. That pissed me off. The fact that I cannot see the background with a lot of the other art they were pla planning to get in this this game totally me fuck me up it totally me pissed me off so Koa please I'm begging you I literally begging you when you literally fix that issue with the zoom take it take it out take it out why you don't need it just take it out I wanna see all those other pictures 
I definitely wanna in wanna see that thing. But however that happens, I don't I don't think that that's gonna happen. But yeah. But well anyway, if that happens, if you fix that issue, I'm gonna play this game again. I'm not I'm not joking around. If if you fix that zoom in the in the in the entire um, music videos, I'm gonna play this all over again. I'm not joking around. But that's the that's the only thing that totally pissed me off. Like that is just um that is just a development issue, and I really wish they totally fixed that. You should fix that. The other th issue that I'm having with this game is uh, thirteen dollars. Uh, again, I'm not sure about how much you can spend on a visual novel especially with those these kind of novels like for example if we if we, if we go like in terms of gameplay i think the closest over the, the gameplay we can have with with this game is um monkey island yeah i think we can say monkey island is no, yeah monkey it kind of like a piece between monkey island and um, Dragon Slayer. So if if you if we are trying to get comparisons, so yeah, thirteen dollars for this experience. I think it's a little bit a lot if you ask me. So if you literally want people to play this game, I think I think or try it out. I think you should wait for a sale or at least. Uh, I think I think Co-op should actually lower the price to twenty dollars or fifteen. Just just saying, it's just on me because I don't I don't feel this game is worth thirty dollars. Like totally, it's not worth thirty dollars. It, it's 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 a really fun game. It's fun. It's really cute. The story it has re it has its low his lows, it has his heights. But if you ask me, it's not worth thirty dollars. Like. For literally, I bought Guild. That is also another indie game, but I'm very sure I'm gonna play on on Halloween. That literally cost me less than this, and it has it, it's not it's not there to compare, but but uh, Guild is an entire horror game 3D action thing, but uh, 3D graphics horror game. That that's the thing. But and that cost less than this, and I think. Uh, yeah, they they they, they turn a lot of on the, on the price on the Bible, you know. So yeah, I I really I really like this game, or at least I try to like this game. Again, the the zoom on the video music is something that is Latino. Yeah, I'm Latino. I'm, I'm totally Latino. So <laughs> I'm from Argentina. If you are asking asking that, so yeah, I I am I'm a Latino. ¿Qué? ¿Acaso vos también sos latino? Si sos, está, está bien. Te doy la bienvenida. <laughs> But anyway, that's what I think about this game. It's it's good. I'm gonna tell you, it's good. Not a 10 out of 10, but more like a 7 out of 10. It's possible. It's fun to actually watch. However, again, the the thing that it's literally taking away the 10 out of 10 is the sum on the the summing. Zooming in and zooming out on well, no, 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 that's definitely not zooming out in on the on the music videos. I hope, I literally, co-op. If you take out that zoom shit of the music videos, please, I swear to God, I'm gonna go to all your houses. I'm gonna kiss your feet. I am not joking around. I'm totally gonna do that. <laughs> And trust me, my friends know that I am willing to actually do that. But yeah, that's all my thoughts of this game, and we have awkward silence, unfortunately. Okay, you know what? I I'm gonna I'm gonna skip this. I'm gonna I'm gonna totally gonna skip this. If there's no music, and I hope you this game that's all doesn't copy strike uh, give me a strike on copyright issues because if, if that happens, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do the same to you, co people. I'm gonna track you, I'm gonna go to your house, but instead of kissing your fucking your fucking face, I'm gonna punch you in the in the face and then I'm gonna go to the next one. <laughs> just saying, just for you it's saying. 
Okay, so that was that's that's all for goodbye volcano. Hi, I hope you uh, give me a moment. I'm gonna switch to just chat. There we go. Okay, that's all for goodbye volcano. Volcano hide. Ah, uh, again, really good game. The only problem is again the music builds. I wish I little little wish Coop fixed that. I wanna wa I wanna watch all the pictures you actually put in the background because I totally I totally want to watch them. I totally want to see all the pictures and because I am playing on a PlayStation I cannot dig into the in, into the save and into the files to see the, all those pictures so that that's another thing that I piss me off so please 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 fix that cop I'm not joking around if you fix that I'm gonna play this game all over again just to see all the pictures again. And again, this is this also is something for you, for you guys. I, I if you really love this this game, I totally uh, okay with it. Also, another thing that I also established is that Snoop Game actually had a, a really big impact as well of this game because uh, again, again, I, lo I know that a lot of people of the game developers doesn't want to know anything about Snoop Game, but you have to actually. Uh, I have to actually uh, know or accept the fact that because of Snoot game, a lot of people actually didn't know about this one or even thought to play this game. So again, even me, even myself, with Snoot game came out, I played. It was oh, it was really good. Not in terms of good, good, but it was good, and that had me to actually play this game. But knowing how it was, or at least the little box it has. I think it's not worth $30 until they totally fix it. So if you guys want to play this by yourselves, go. I I I gonna tell you that it's I recommend it, but I recommend it until it's a sale until or or until they fix the issue with the music videos. I th I'm totally I'm totally serious with that. But for me, it's just a straight seven, not a ten, but a straight seven. And it's really cute. It's a really cute story. The the whole aspect of the game is really, really revolutionary. I mean, uh, well, not revolutionary as a fact, because again, I if I have to actually compare this game with another game, I th I think it is also the same way that Monkey Island and and uh, Dragon Slayer. No, Dragon Slayer. Yeah, Dragon Slayer. And yeah. I'm not sure if it's revolutionary, but the fact that it has a little bit work to be to work with, I think, yeah, uh, I can, I cannot recommend it with but by, by thirty dollars. It's okay, but I cannot recommend it by thirty dollars. So anyway, that's all that I have to say with the game, and that's all that I have to say to the stream. So let's see if we can raid someone and let's gonna call out the stream because right now I'm starving I literally been streaming by seven and a half hours Damn. <laughs> well it was worth it I gotta tell you it was worth playing this game and I and again I totally play this one until if they fix the entire music videos I swear to god I gonna stream this game again I fucking dead serious so that's my thing Okay, let's see. Uh, Little Pilia and Jumi Kore are streaming right now. Mm, let's go with let's go with Little Pilia. Little Pilia. Oh, no, wait. Actually, we 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 read Little Pilia last time, right? No. Then let's go with Jumi Kore. Okay, read Jumi Kore. Jumi Kore. There we go. Okay. This is the end of the stream. I hope you guys had a blast because I always had a blast. Tomorrow we're gonna continue uh, another the last stream of my vacations. And as I said, <laughs> as I speak about Snoot Game, we're gonna play Snoot Game. But we're gonna play Snoot Game with a guy. I'm gonna try to actually get uh, well, Marcel and Chitose are gonna come with me as well to play Snoot Game. I'm not sure about Crystal. She's my little sister. And she, I'm having a little bit trouble reaching her these days, so I hope everything is going well to her right now. But 
for now we're gonna try to be with bars and chi and if uh, we are lucky we're gonna try to get as well a crystal so we will see we will see the same as always if you didn't follow me on twitter you can or x whatever you wanna call it for me it's always twitter focus and it sounds like uh, that page that mommy and daddy goes one <laughs> goes by <laughs> We are, I already said that before and I said it again. So you can follow you can follow me on Twitter as Lonos Kellys and you can if you wish to watch my previous streams you can follow me on YouTube as well as Lonos Kellys. But that's the this is the end of the stream. So if you guys really had a really good time, I totally had a good time. So tomorrow we're gonna play Snoop Game again again with the gang. And I'm gonna take my the rest of my vacations, Monday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna stick with just uh, resting myself up, and then I'm gonna start streaming at 5 p.m. again Argentinian time on those Thursdays, and again Fridays as well. I'm gonna stream. I'm gonna streaming at midnight again from Argentinian time, and Saturdays again midnight. But also Saturdays I play online games, so make sure to mark your calendars because that's what my regular streams are gonna be. Thursdays, Fridays and Saturdays. But anyway, as I said, I see you guys tomorrow for playing Snot Game with the gang. And give Yumiko my regards as always. And again, as always, be safe out there and have a good night. See you next time my videos!